does look like Endor. Yeah. Probably my favourite Star Wars planet, actually. Mine as well. Oh, I love it. It's, it's, it's just because of the Ewoks, really, isn't it? <laughs> um, but gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous nine o'clock kit. Um, coming up in the 11 o'clock hour, oh, Mark, this is so exciting um, because I really wanted to launch a collection with you. Um, I couldn't. We had, we had mm. my husband was away. That's right. Blah, 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 blah. All that kind of stuff going on. And um, this is such an exciting... There's so much work that has been poured into this. Literally, your heart and soul has been poured into this collection. Yeah. We've got the last few chances of Mark's incredible chestnut close spring collection. It is just gorgeous. There's some beautiful pieces here. I love the packaging. They are so collectible. They're so mm. easy to collect, yeah, aren't them. they? And as we said in your in your Facebook Live, we're yes. launching in May, we're launching summer. Oh, wonderful. So we're busy at the moment, just putting all the, all the, the packaging and the cards together. So, so spring is all lavender purple oh. and summer is going to be baby blue. Oh, all, all going to be changed. They are gorgeous. Yeah. So beautifully made with genuine gemstones. Um, uh, the, the manufacturing quality of these is Incredible. absolutely Absolute superb. Um, it really is brilliant. They're so professional. They're beautiful finished pieces. Um, enjoy those. So they're coming up in the 11 o'clock hour. 12 o'clock. Now, Mark, I, I, I didn't actually see the post on Facebook, but thank you so much for um, uh, posting this on, on your Facebook page mm. and asking for your input. What would you like to see as a demo in the masterclass today? Because we haven't had kits like this for ages. I'm amazing. so excited. No, no, amazing. And at the moment, I've just, I've just had a double check. And at the moment, Love the them. tassel topper demo is winning hands down at the moment. Okay, so if but you want we'll, to, but we'll see. We'll okay, see. so if you want to go to Facebook yeah. and you want to go to um, uh, Mark's um, guest designer page, which is uh, Mark Smith Jewelry Make it no um, jewelry. guest designer Mark Smith. There we go, perfect. And if you want to comment on the post and you want to see, and um, you want to comment on on what you'd like to see as a demo, then perfect. But yes, the tassel topper is 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 winning so far. But I, I know that you were going to hopefully briefly explain as well yes, how you bezel the set the these incredible yeah. cabochons as well. Oh, there it is, lovely. Oh, there we are. Oh, gorgeous. Okay. Perfect. There we go. JM guest designer, Mark Smith. There he is. Nice photo. You are very good at photography, Mark, aren't you? That's on our patio. Is it? <laughs> yeah. I couldn't work out if it's carpet or stone. It's, it's, the best, it's the best backdrop to all our patio stone. Gorgeous. Wonderful. So feel yeah. free to comment on that and we'll, and we'll do whatever you'd like us to do in the 12 o'clock. Brilliant. This hour, oh my word. We've got this red dragon peridot. These are mm, these are incredible. We've been going on about this all week, actually. Um, uh, so these beautiful um, uh, red dragon peridots, giving you hands down the best colour of any peridot in the world. They really are sensational. We're also going to be bringing you a very very special opportunity with this genuine Kingman turquoise in a strand. I've really only ever bought you a couple of strands of Kingman turquoise. Everything else I've bought you has been either cabochons or little kind of slices. This is some of the most ancient turquoise in the world. It's, it's absolutely it's stunning, gorgeous it? stuff. Um, and it's coming your way in this hour. Shall we get going? I think we should. Right. OK, perfect. <laughs> what? <laughs> We're starting with the double trouble. OK, uh, let's start with the double trouble. Uh. Oh, yes, nice. Oh, Let's yeah. start off with a double trouble deal this Sunday morning. Okay, here we go. Eight mil rounds, double trouble deal. Eight mil rounds of Unikite and Frosted Sage Sesame Jasper. Um, gorgeous, gorgeous uh, gemstones. I do love Neary's bundles because really what Neary's bundles are all about is literally uh, making your savings, basically. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we go, everybody. Here we go, 19 pounds and 99 pence. Amazing, incredible. Um, yeah, we've got people coming through. To, uh, there's three different ways you can get involved with Jewelry Maker, either by calling us on our free phone number, which is 0800 644 655, or by getting involved on our website. Ju oh, Ben just flashed the clock there. <laughs> oh, goodness me. <laughs> or you can get involved on our website, jewelrymaker.com, or you can download our app. Uh, you can download her app and you can watch us on the go. So if you are going to be out and about today, watch us on the go. Here we go. All the way down, £12.99. Looking amazing, looking great for your two incredible strands of, uh, of eight mil rounds. Beautiful, amazing. Oh, look. Oh, look. He's on a roll today. Neary Nunu is producing the show today. Oh, yes, Neary. There he goes. 
9.99 under a tenner for two strands and that is about making your savings that isn't it it really genuinely amazing. is wow gorgeous well done lovely recording surprising actually how well these gemstones go together actually i really like them i love these frosted jaspers i think they're absolutely beautiful oh no oh hang on what are you doing <laughs> okay uh okay so in 24 seconds we're going to give you another price point there we go so we're at 9.99 already under a 10 pound note already already people coming through that's great to see well done check out your baskets as soon as you can does someone think i reckon i reckon to go oh, with the yeah. gorgeous tiger's eye from our nine o'clock uh from our nine o'clock kits absolutely gorgeous already people popping these in their baskets checking out that's great to see 9.99 <laughs> not your deal all the way down starting as we mean to go on here oh yeah with all the deals five 99 there you go 5.99 there you go good morning carol mark from cloudy cornwall says jane oh lovely I, th morning, I, think, jane. I think it'll burn off don't worry yeah, yeah. i think it's likely to uh burn off morning carol and mark i'm on oh. holiday and i'm still up to see the fab show today very excited said julian somerset hello julie. where have you gone on uh, where hello. have you gone on holiday julie let us know let us know message in joe's through helen jillian well done everyone Mark, I can only just do a 15 minute walk because my back um, was a bit of a one. Uh, but um, crunches and sit ups mean I can now walk again. Gee oh, whiz, Joe, that sounds wow. a bit, uh, that sounds a bit uh, active. Amazing though, well done. Oh no, I need Carol to sing to wake me up. Got to do breakfast <laughs> in our B&B, says Wendy. Uh, says Wendy in Herefordshire. <laughs> Well, Mark, uh, no. Mark has bought me chocolate, so I won't sing today. Oh, it's Actually, not the sing it's not the next singing. time, Mark, I'll tell you what, just bring me the cash equivalent. That would be wonderful. <laughs> it's not the singing that I don't like. It's the participation that I have to do that I don't oh. like. Oh. No. No. Burn today. <laughs> he's all his skull scathing. <laughs> We've got a lot to get through. Pink Sapphire, Songida, wow. Tanzanian Zircon. We've got, what are we going to do now? Alexandrite, one of the rarest gemstones on planet Earth. Here we go. Here we go. We may as well. <laughs> so here we go. Alexandrite Rondels, here we go. One of the world's rarest gemstones. Here we go. Beautiful quality. Do you know what I love about Alexandra? I love those kind of soft, sagey greens that you get with this gemstone. It's, it's so gorgeous, impressive, isn't it? isn't it? It's just beautiful. With that jadeite we've got coming up in the kits, I think it would just be amazing. Just one yes. in the centre. And it's one of those gemstones you just want to be able to say mm. you own Alexandrite, don't you? Is it November or December's birthstone? No, it's uh, June. Oh, it's June. I got yeah, it Moonstone, oh, Alexandrite right. and Pearl. Oh, gosh. Yes, there you go. £19.99. pence. Well done to you, Carolyn Lincolnshire. Through, that's great to see. You all get your 30-day money-back guarantee uh, with everything you get from Joy Maker, even at our incredible, amazing discounted prices. I know. It's incredible. Well done. Go, 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 go. Black Ethiopian Opal, this is a ridiculous strand. This is mm. ridiculous. This is stunning, isn't it? Look at oh this. my words. I think it's a really good strand to, to make something for your father for Father's Day. Ooh. Well, that's in June, isn't it? It is I in love, June. I love opal, but sometimes the, the, the white opal is a bit feminine. Yes, I get that, so, yeah. So for chaps to be able to wear opal like this i think it's amazing perfect isn't it it really is perfect and you would have thought that by having a black ethiopian opal that it's going to be uh you know you're going to be missing out on that opalescence but my word it it, it just doesn't um uh, hide anything does it no. all that opalescence just leaping out the gem Ooh. isn't that gorgeous okay so we're going to take this to the lowest price point we possibly can do okay all the way down 37.99 wow 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 incredible it really is superb isn't it and of course on the strand they they're not going to be at their best because of course they're all kind of touching 
uh, each other side by side, you know, you're going to be getting, uh, you're going to be um, uh, kind of losing out on a lot of light going into these stones. But my word, once you get these off the strand, they're going to look absolutely incredible. I mean, they look wonderful now, don't they? But they're going to look even more amazing then. I like those bright reds against the dark background. That's yes. so dramatic, isn't it? Yes, me too. It's got that, it's got that real pop of colour, hasn't it? It's absolutely gorgeous. Looks a little oh, bit futuristic, don't yes, you think, when it's yes. um, got this lovely black base note. Oh. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Well done. And use it against something completely different, uh, like, a, like a white pearl or something like that, or the white nephrite, maybe. Um, and just see what happens. The quality you're going to be getting here today is absolutely superb, isn't it? Well done. And this is the kind of opal which a lot of people, you know, will pay over and above these kind of prices for. But that is, that is absolutely amazing. Well done. King is bringing in all the gemstones today. There she is. There she Oh, lo we love Kinga. Oh, we love her. She's going on holiday. I'm going on holiday too, Kinga. When do you go away? Tomorrow. Oh, she's ex you can tell she's excited. Tomorrow <laughs> she's going away. When are you next going away, Mark? I am going away, well, the last, well, week of May, so the 14th onwards. Very nice. We, we've got a and b within the Chatsworth Estate. So we can actually walk out of our beam. Oh, and hello. And two, two, 200 feet down the road is Chatsworth. We're not staying in Chatsworth, unfortunately. Oh, that would be amazing, like wouldn't it? Yeah, so we're in Derbyshire for a week. Oh, how gorgeous. Can't wait. Can't wait. Oh, that's going to be lovely. Wonderful. Multi moonstone rounds, here we go. Would you be tempted wow. to ombre these, Mark? I think I would actually. Yes. I think I would. With Botswana agate, maybe. Oh, uh, yes. You've got all those colours, haven't you, in that? Now you're talking to me. Gorgeous. Yes, definitely with your Botswana agate. It's got those gorgeous kind of, um, yeah, those stony colours, wow. the greys, the soft peaches uh, going through there. That's gorgeous. Happy Sunday, gorgeous oh. people. Um, JM t uh, to JM, t uh, JM Tow settled in for a lovely show. Mark's jewellery is stunning, as always, says Ms. Janet. It, it really is, isn't it? Thank it's you. gorgeous. Always is. Um, well done, Camilla. Well done to makeup. Well done. Loads and loads and loads of, of items still to come in this hour. Are we doing the Wall of Fame now? Oh, my oh. word. Let's go to the Wall of Fame and see some of your incredible pieces. <laughs> Hello, uh, so the Wall of Fame is a chance for you to showcase some of your incredible pieces which you've made using uh, Jewelry Maker items. Take a photograph of it and then email it to studio at jewelrymaker.com. Every um, Wednesday we pick a winner and a runner up who win £100 or £50 credited to their Jewelry Maker account. We've got Erica uh, first today. You're number 309, lovely Erica. Oh no, Erica, there she is. Wow. Now, I was looking at this. Is this... Is this done with jump rings? It is. It's incredible. When I first it's saw this incredible. on Facebook, I thought it was super duos. But then when you look closer, oh, you see it's jump rings. She says, beautiful. hi, this is my entry called a Japanese Lace Weave. Found the pattern on a JM DVD. All components are from Jewelry Maker. Good luck to everyone. That's from Erica. That is absolutely gorgeous, Erica. Well done. Uh, Sean Kerr, your number... 310. This is my floral necklace based on the fabulous booklet by the very talented Monica. The booklet is so easy to follow and very well written. I finally got over my peyote stitch nemesis. I used the kit and bought, um, uh, I bought, but added more sea beads from my extensive JM stash. Thank you for your continued inspiration and fantastic products. Love and best wishes. That's from Sean. Sean, that is a beautiful Incredible, piece. I love the colourway you've gone for there and I love the greens. That really is stunning. Well done to you. Uh, Vivian Hamilton, you're number 311. Oh, oh no. wonderful. Um, hi, everyone at JM. Um, this is my Wall of Fame entry, a beautiful 14 mil jadeite uh, round necklace I got many years ago. I teamed it with Grandidiorite um, in a box clasp, and I uh, love the finished results. Do you know what? Grandidiorite and jadeite look amazing together. You've done a brilliant job there, Vivian. Well done. Uh, and I've got Michael, Michael Knight. Oh, please Ooh, tell me. Oh, uh, please tell me you've got a talking car. Um, 312, I use spinel in both of these necklaces. On the green one, it's with Amazonite and aquamarine. It reminds me of kiwi fruit. On the purple black one, it's with peacock dyed pearls and it gives a little extra sparkle. Both necklaces are three strands loosely plaited. Uh, they're gorgeous, uh, Michael. I hope you like them and good luck to everyone. More pearls delivered today. Oh, brilliant. Well done, love. They're gorgeous pieces. So my Beautiful. first entry today is number 313 and this is from Nicola. 
Nicholas Ooh. says, hi everyone, please find attached my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. A necklace made with lapis lazuli chips with galvanized gold seed beads. A nice, simple, but effective make. Love to all, and that's from Nicola, number 313. Number 314 is from Margaret. Margaret says, this week's entry is a pink opal cabochon from a jewelry maker kit, surrounded by black spinel coins and seed beads. The chain is made from the same spinel and seed beads. Thanks to all at GEM, including the brilliant guest designers, for keeping going during this difficult time. That's beautiful, mm. Margaret. Absolutely beautiful. And last entry today is number 315 is from Lorraine. Hi, jewellery makers. This is a simple but effective make with freshwater pearls, tanzanite and twisted jump ring detail. All components from jewellery maker. Happy Easter, everyone. And that's from Lorraine. Thank beautiful. you, Lorraine. So I'm busy eating eggs. Love those. Aren't they gorgeous? Absolutely. Just beautiful. shows you what a difference yeah. you can make to your pearls just by adding a pop Completely. of colour. Completely. Well done, everyone. Yeah, well done, everyone. Yeah. Gorgeous. Yeah. Um, so, what? Oh. Multi spinel faceted coins. Where, where, where? What? And blue eye light coins. What? Really? Star by. Do you know what, Mark? There are certain shapes which um, I think appeal to uh, us for different reasons. My two favourite shapes are bicones, mm -hmm. which we've got coming up in the 12, um, and faceted coins. I, I, I absolutely love them. They're just a little, I call them a little pips. That's exactly they, what they are. They're just beautiful. Aren't they, they are the most, it's the most wonderful shape, the most wonderful a um, uh, little kind of capsule, if you like. And the oh, fact that these have got right. checkerboard faceting on them give you the most wonderful, gemmy, diamond-like, expensive-looking gemstone uh, product. It really does. I, 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 I look at these and I just think you could not, you, you just can't better that cut. That faceting is extraordinary, isn't it? That sparkle. It really is. Wow. Square facets on a round mm. shape. I, 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 it, it, it's just, it works so well. Now this is multi-spinel. Spinel is a wonderfully diverse gemstone which comes in all colors of the rainbow. There are a few key locations geographically worldwide which are to note. So Cambodian spinel is really, really uh, beautiful. Um, Thai spinel, absolutely wonderful. But there is a location which is head and shoulders above the rest of them for the range of colour that you get, the unique way and the unique conditions in which the spinel forms. And that location is Burma. And the Magok Valley in Burma is one of the richest gemstone um, um, uh, deposits in the entire world, uh, not just for spinel, but for all sorts of different gemstones. Because of the, um, because of the granite-like rock that, that the gemstones in Burma form in, the colour that you get from Burmese gemstones, not just from spinel, but from your ruby, from your tourmaline, from your sapphire, from your jadeite, from all sorts of different gemstones that form in this particular area, in this tiny little valley in the middle of Burma. Uh, it gives them better saturation of colour. What the granite does is it stops impurities entering into the gemstone, which can discolour the gemstone, which can water the colour down, which can muddy the waters. So what you have here is arguably the purest spinel that money can buy. You also get some unique colours with Burmese spinel that you don't really tend to get from other varieties of spinel. Um, you can get Jedi reds, which are beautiful and kind of bright red. You can get beautiful um, cobalt blues. You can get gorgeous mauves and um, beautiful purples. But a colour which is, is my favourite and the colour which I know that when we visited the Magok Valley back in 2017, Jake Thompson, our gem guide, it was his tip of the trip, was was silver grey spinel. There is something about this gemstone that, and in, in particularly in this cut as well, it looks so expensive. And the silver grey spinel you have here is absolutely beautiful. Um, the, 
the spinel is mined in a completely unique way. Um, mo almost all spinel uh, that's mined in the Magog Valley was mined about two or three centuries ago. What you're looking at here is going back through the deposits which have already been mined and picking out gem qualities um, uh, which were mined two, three hundred years ago. There is no new, there are no new mining prospects um, uh, in the Magok Valley. There's no new mining operations. There's very little commercial mining left in, in, in uh, the Magok Valley. So what we're looking at here could have been mined at the same time as the Black Prince Ruby, for instance. You're looking at the most incredible quality, the most, the richest variety of colour, and those silver greys for me are stunning. The only reason why we have access to Burmese gemstones on the whole, whether it's jadeite, whether it's, you know, you know, whatever it might be, is because we were invited there back in 2017. Uh, we're still in very, very close contact with a lot of our, um, um, with a lot of the um, uh, gem dealers that we met when we were um, uh, lucky enough to go over there. And the quality that we have access to is some of the best in the world. It is just the most beautiful strand, this one. We're under 20 pounds. It's not your price. Easily one of the most collectible cuts, easily one of the most beautiful strands, and we are not done at this price. If you've never ex experienced genuine natural Burmese spinel, you need to get this strand. There's nothing quite like no, it. Absolutely not. It's just gorgeous. It, it really and again, is. I think, I think this. I think all of spinel actually is, is a really good, really good gemstone for gents as well. I mean, I'd have definitely to on, a, on a bracelet. Absolutely. And you could choose whether to go for those gorgeous purples, the beautiful pinks, the kind of almost rutilated ones that you're getting there as well, the silvers, the whites, the blues. Um, it really is up to you. Nine ninety nine. Oh. Whoa! It's crazy. I was not expecting that. Nine pounds <laughs> ninety nine pence for any strand which has got this gorgeous microfaceted coin shape attributed to it is amazing. But for natural Burmese spinel is amazing. Yvonne, well done to you. Uh, well done to you, uh, Helen. Well done to Lorraine. You've got two in your basket there. Well done to Maker. Well done to Sorry. Well done to Agnes and Hilda. There's loads of a Maker in West Midlands. There's loads of people coming through to get this. Well done at 9 .9. I can't believe that's only a tenner. That's amazing. Wow. That really is incredible, isn't it? That quality you're getting there. More makers coming through this time in Fife. Well done to you. Check out your baskets. Uh, Cornwall, you've got two in your basket. There we go. Well done, everybody. I would be multi, multi, multi buying this. And I think the usability of strands like this is, is, is just superb, isn't it? So whether you're going to be channel setting these, whether you're going to be doing uh, rosary linking with these, whether you're going to be um, uh, just making very simple stacker bracelets, because don't forget, we've got other strands coming up with this gorgeous shape applied to it as well. So whether it's go you know, whether you're going to be popping these alongside your eye lights or alongside your gorgeous um, agates or, you know, it, it really is entirely up to you. But that shape, I believe, is kind of on a par with that kind of German cut saucer. It's so collectible, isn't it, Mark? I think it's just, it's just absolutely beautiful. I've always, always loved this shape. Mm. I think it's, it's a real cute little shape. And it? you're right, it is a cute, it is a yeah, really cute yeah. little shape. As you say, they're like little pips, aren't they? They're gorgeous. Maker and Surrey, Iris Louise, well done to you, my lovely. More people coming through a multi bind. That's really great to see this morning. Susan, well done mm. to you in Norfolk. Absolutely fantastic. Well done at just nine pounds and 99 pence. Diane, well done to you now in Yorkshire. This is so good, isn't it? Well done, everybody. What a treat to be able to get this. And by the way, if you're if, just in case you're wondering, it's fasted on both sides. So you get that um, checkerboard fasting on both sides. Um, but that is absolutely amazing. I can't believe we're able to do this for nothing. I think it's, I definitely think it deserves to be separated, the colour with a knot or a rosary link or something like that, just to let all of the light permeate all the way around the gems. Yeah, do you know, I'd, I'd, I'd agree with you there, yeah. Mark. I think, I think, yeah, definitely. I think with, with some yeah. of your rosary linking as well, because yeah. you can rosary link with really quite fine wire, absolutely. can't you? Yeah. Yeah. It would look absolutely gorgeous. And of course, anything where you're going to be um, making kind of articulated jewelry, the great thing about that, of course, is you're gonna get all of that luster, yeah. the benefit of all of that gorgeous luster. Let's do the eye light. Now, we've had some amazing strands of eye light over the last, over the last month, mm. really. We've had some incredible strands. Eye light, for me, has always been one of those stones which um, uh, you, it's got the most specific blue colour of, of any blue gemstone. There's nothing else quite like it. Wow. It's a stunning gemstone. With this checkerboard fasting, it just, it just elevates the look of the gemstone, doesn't it? You get this beautiful kind of watered kind of 
a watered down kind of inky color. And um, it's absolutely beautiful. It really um, retains light so beautifully and just, and just kind of, um, it works for you, doesn't it? It's just gorgeous. And there are certain blues which I find a little bit, a little bit too strong. So some of those cobalt blues, I, I personally wouldn't wear. They're just a, a little bit too, a little bit too powerful against, against my kind of fair skin. But this is absolutely perfect. And if you don't want to go for black, this is a great absolutely. shade yeah. to go for, isn't it? It's not far off your London blue, is it? It's, it's, it's yeah. That's dramatic blue about it. I Gorgeous. Yeah, look at that. You get such a wonderful variety of colour going through here, variety of tone going through here as well. Some of it's really saturated, but others are really quite delicate. Um, let's get that price point all the way down. Don't forget, we are moments away from our incredible uh, Red Dragon Peridot and also uh, Kingman Turquoise. Very excited to have a, a proper strand of that in the studio today. Under £20, brilliant deal. That is absolutely gorgeous. Well done. 0800 644 six double five uh for less than 20 pounds for your gorgeous and um, beautiful blue eye light faceted coins obviously we can take this a little bit lower today as with everything today well done everyone get those messages sent through lovely to hear from you all um already this morning it's great to hear from you 7.99 oh that's amazing we've got sir ben gibbs he's directing us today so lovely there he is I know. There he is, returning to Jewellery Maker for one day only. And then he'll be back on uh, Hobby Maker. Don't worry. Are you on a double today, Ben? He's not on a double today. No, certainly not. But Michael is. Michael's on a little dirty double today. There he is. Don't worry, Michael. There'll be time later on in the show to dance. Don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> Helen's got through those. Well done. You can blame Mark for ruining that. But he did bring chocolate in, so that's fine. Um, right. Okay. Love this. Now, this is unusual oh. because, of course, you haven't got any clarity with this um, agate. And I wouldn't expect to get clarity with this agate. But my word, it, it still works, doesn't it? Oh. What an unusual strand of agate. I thought this, this would have been a jasper. Yeah, me too. Like a, an ocean jasper or something so, like that. Yeah, those greens are amazing. Aren't they just... I love those wow. tealy colours. They're really wonderful, aren't they? On Thursday, um, Eleanor and I had a, a Mukite showcase, and I think this strand would work so beautifully. Because we mentioned that in Mukites, you don't get greens or blues. Mm. And these are the greens and blues, and, and that would actually work really well with the Mukite, I think. Because look, you're getting you're getting your beautiful kind of mustard kind of mukite colours there, and your lovely earthy colours there. So and 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 it looks wonderful, doesn't it? So definitely, definitely uh, uh, try this with your mukite. Really, really um, uh, valid point there. Um, Four ninety nine for you today. Amazing. Definitely one for guys as well. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Now you know those wrap around bracelets where you've got um, kind of a leather. A piece of leather either side of your gemstone oh, it's kind of channel setting here. yes even out with the cord yes yeah, I, I can imagine this, this yeah. in in a design like that yeah. mark i think that would look great yeah. uh, maker in the west midlands well into you paula helen i think really dev relaxed jewelry but if you did want to ombre these you could do because of course notice they're not graduated in size so if you want to graduate that color then you know feel Perfect. free to do that absolutely go for it it's I just think why macrame will be amazing with these as well nice yes in, well we're going to be lovely. seeing some beading thread macrame we aren't are. we in the yes. next hour actually uh and these these could be, be you know these would work beautifully wouldn't they well done everybody uh bit is in cornwall greater london oh you got two there paula well done 4.99 for you today well done okay we've got an early bird special, which I have to say, I have not seen. I have not seen this gemstone in a strand for an eternity. It's a strand of Kingman turquoise. I love it. Um, right, okay. We're about to bring you a strand of what is, I think, the most significant turquoise deposit in the whole world, I'm gonna say. Um, uh, it, more so than, more so than uh, any other American deposit, including a Sleeping Beauty. Um, this really is, this is the gemstone which um, is, is 
uh, uh, has been the inspiration for an entire, an entire civilization. This is the original American turquoise. And everybody talks about Sleeping Beauty turquoise and what a wonderful gemstone it is. And it really is. It really is a stunning gemstone. But the Kingman um, turquoise mine is not only one of the oldest mines in the world, but it was also the very, very first variety of turquoise that was mined by um, Native Americans. Uh, this is, um, you know, what the indigenous people of the United States of America, this is, this is what has been mined for thousands of years by them. This is what really started it off. And th there's lots of legends, there's lots of um, uh, really fantastic stories, and, you know, some of which are true, some of which, you know, you don't really know where they've got their roots. Um, but this is the gemstone that started it all off. And legend had it, um, um, has it that when um, uh, certain uh, uh, tribes people were, were dancing uh, for rain and hoping for rain, when the rain eventually fell, their tears mixed with the rain created this incredible stone. And it was known as Fallen Sky Stone, the perfect marriage of Mother Earth and Father Sky. And actually, when you see this gemstone in the rough and you see, and you see in, the, in the host rock rather, and you see the host rock, which, is, which tends to be very, very dry, parched stone. And then you have this, what looks like a river running through the stone. That's your turquoise. And, and, it's, and it's, it, it makes complete sense, that kind of connection with water, that kind of, that wonderful, that wonderful through line, that life almost running through the host rock. Um, so the Kingman mine is at the last full-time uh, production mine of turquoise in the USA, it, and that is it. The high-grade natural is ultra rare and appears to be less than one percent of what the mine is currently producing. This makes natural high-grade Kingman turquoise ultra valuable, and it really, really is. There it is in the in the host rock, and for turquoise, for turquoise to for turquoise to um, to exist, it needs to it needs to um, it needs to uh, uh, kind of form in very, very dry rock. And that dry rock, you have, you have rainfall, and when the rain does fall on the dry rock, it, it, it evaporates very, very quickly, but it leaves behind it all of, the, all of the kind of copper and iron impurities in the water, and that's what colours the rock. Because of this, turquoise is a very, very porous stone. So when you get any variety of turquoise, but particularly your Kingman turquoise, which is famed for its incredible color, you have to wax it, you have to stabilize it. If you don't, what will happen is, is the turquoise against your skin will turn black over time because it'll soak up the natural oils in your skin and it will just discolor. So just to seal the gemstone, just to give you, just uh, just to give, uh, just to give it that um, uh, that coat, and to stop it from soaking up the natural oils in your skin, this will have been waxed, and that's literally just to that's literally just to seal it. A bit like when you're washing a car and you just put a wax kind of top coat on I'm it. It's just literally. Quite pleased of that to have happened, actually. Oh, one hundred percent. Also, your your turquoise that hasn't been waxed. It feels very very different. You can kind of feel it hasn't been waxed. It's really important that it does get waxed. Um, now, this hasn't been polymer filled. And it's important to note, actually, because a lot of turquoise is polymer filled. This hasn't been polymer filled. This hasn't been dyed. This, has, this isn't reconstituted. This is absolutely 100% genuine, natural Kingman turquoise from the Kingman mine. Now, when you imagine the first mining process for this gemstone, which would have happened thousands of years ago. I've got a little slide, actually, which I, which I found about the, um, uh, the Kingman uh, deposit. And it's, it's literally there. The, there we go. Um, and it's, and it's it, just, it just literally talks about the, 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 the age of this. The Kingman turquoise mine is the oldest and highest producing turquoise mine um, uh, in America. It was originally discovered by prehistoric Indians uh, well over a thousand years ago. Kingman turquoise is known for its beautiful sky blue color and produces many um, uh, variations of blue turquoise. The Kingman turquoise mine also produces green turquoise from the turquoise mountainside of the mine. The Kingman mine is actually quite a large area, 
But when you consider that the first mining of this um, done, felt, it was kind of closer to about 2,000 years ago, where you literally pick away at the host rock with um, animal antlers uh, just to kind of try and try and get little pockets of this gemstone away from the host rock. What we've got here for you today is the same variety from the same deposit from the same mine that has been mined for over a thousand to two thousand years. This is the gem. This is the reason why this gemstone is at the center of Native American culture. This gemstone is not just a gemstone to them, but a symbol of luck, of um, fertility, a symbol of, of, of their forefathers. This gemstone is passed down through generations. And it's not unusual to find people wearing four, five, six, seven generations worth of this incredible stone. But this is the variety and location that started it all off. Now, just to kind of show you that we absolutely mean business today, we're going to do something which is crazy. We're taking £100 off that price point you've just seen there. So we've just shown you £148.99. pence. This should prove to you... that this is going low. We are at 49.99 and it's on split payments of 24.99. Now, I'll be honest with you. It's on split pay and we're taking the price lower. This is one of the only strands of Kingman turquoise we have ever done. Almost every other quality and um, um, every other piece of Kingman Turquoise I have bought you has either been in wafer thin slices or the odd cabochon. This is, this is unbelievable that we have an actual strand of Kingman Turquoise. If it was a strand of Peruvian Turquoise or Tibetan Turquoise or even Sleeping Beauty Turquoise, amazing, brilliant, awesome. This is Kingman turquoise. This is the original American source that got, that, that has made this gemstone the center point of Native American culture. Price point, $29.99. Just get it. Just get it. Just go. Just wow. absolutely. Just check out your baskets. Phone lines have gone nuts. Marley in Arizona coming through yeah, to get this. Wow. Loving the inclusions in this beautiful story. Isn't it gorgeous? Isn't it wonderful? Please, can I just say, for anyone who's coming through to get this, particularly if you're going to be making jewellery to sell, please get your authenticity certificate for an extra 25 pence because it will say Kingman Turquoise on it. The fact that it has that providence, that pedigree, of, of that, pr that prefix of being a Kingman turquoise means that this gemstone for me, but not just for me, but for so many people out there, is worth two, three, four, five, six, maybe even more times um, uh, what your other varieties of turquoise are worth. This, this, this is something very special. And it's one of the only strands of this incredible uh, location turquoise I've ever bought you. It, it is truly magnificent, isn't it, Mark? But being, being the last turquoise mine in full-time production, yeah, you'd yeah. think the prices would be hiked right up, wouldn't you? Well, this is it. We've, I mean, we're lucky enough to have really great connections with the mm. turquoise mines, not just Sleeping uh, Beauty turquoise, uh, but with, uh, but with um, families who, who, who deal in um, Arizona turquoise, um, including your Kingman turquoise. Mm. Because we've got that direct access, because we've got access, and, and you know, we've shown you videos before um, of, of Mario, who's our connection over in Arizona. He's actually, um, I think he's actually from Poland, but, but, but him and his family live out in uh, Arizona, and they've made it their life's work. I think it's his father, actually, who started the company, uh, to deal in not just Sleeping Beauty, but all varieties of American turquoise. And it's only because of that, and because we've been there, we've met him, we've spent time with him, um, uh, that we have access to um, uh, deals like this. This is very, very special indeed. This is like owning the original. This is as close to me bringing you the original Sinai Peninsula, you know, Egyptian turquoise um, uh, quality. Stunning strand. It's my birthstone. Going to keep it for myself. Thank you so much. Love it. Liz in time. Liz, I mean, this is amazing. 
This really is incredible, isn't it? And I it's love, beautiful. I love, I love inclusions in turquoise. Oh, it's uh, wonderful. It's, it's, yes. It's just lovely. And the fact that you've got these sort of these flecks of gold running through as well, it's just beautiful. Well, because a lot of turquoise is mined yeah. as a byproduct of the copper mining industry, so yeah, it's it's, it's really normal, and actually, yeah. it should be yeah. celebrated, Mark, that, that you get those copper inclusions, as you say. It, it really adds mm. something so beautiful to the gemstone, makes it so interesting. And. Um, in baskets, Erica, Maker, Christine, Veronica, Sally, Veronica, Janet, uh, Camilla, uh, Sharon, Lorna, Maker, Sally, Heather. There's so many in baskets. Lots of people still coming through. Well done. $29.99 for a strand of genuine Kingman turquoise. It's beautiful. And it's on two split payments of £14.99, which is ridiculous, isn't it? It's absolutely gorgeous. Well done. And of course, the fact that they're rounds as well just makes it so easy to and set. they're graduated, aren't they? So, yes, so nice. Again, you just decide on a colour of a little space of bead in between mm. or a little little crystal bicone or something just to separate. Absolutely. Them. Absolutely, yeah. And would you go with silver, yellow, gold, rose gold? What, what do I you think, think with, Mark? With turquoise, any colour works, doesn't it? But I think, I think gold... Yes, I think I gold think too. I think gold. Yes, so do I. And I think that I think that if you were to if if you you know making jewelry with this, if you're going to be selling it on, I would be shouting it from the rooftops: mm. genuine Kingman turquoise. And I'd do a little, you know print a little bit of information off about this incredible stone. This is this is the very. F it's such a rare. It's such a rare find this isn't it? it's such a rare opportunity because quite often you know we talk about the egyptian mine emerald which was mined out oh gosh you know hundreds thousands of years ago you know we're never going to be able to find the likes of that but to be able to find and still bring to you the actual location the actual yeah. very stone that was prospected by um uh, um uh, you know native americans um uh, we're talking, we're talking, kind of two, two you know, two thousand years ago. Is amazing, superb, isn't it? Just incredible. Well done. Such a special stone. Beautiful. Well done. And um, still got loads of people there uh, with us in their baskets. Well done, everybody. At twenty nine ninety nine, we're down into single figures now. Well done to everybody there. Karen, well done to you. Teresa, Gwyneth, well done. Irina, Lorraine, it's just gorgeous, isn't it? Well done. And like I say, if it was Sleeping Beauty. Tibetan or Peruvian, amazing. But this is like the one that started it all. The one that started it all. Tessa, well done to you as well. Kathleen, loads of people still there. Well done, everybody. And just to, and just to deal with the waxing again, because if you, if you, weren't, if you weren't watching, um, turquoise is a really porous stone. And um, if you don't seal turquoise, uh, then it just takes the natural oils from your skin and it discolors the turquoise. Um, over, and not... not kind of within a few days but within mm. months and years it'll go brown which isn't very nice so we need to seal it um a bit like putting a top coat on nail varnish or something just to protect it um and that's what and that's the wax which is applied to the stone just to seal it um just so it'll look like this in in 10 years time uh basically uh but well done everybody sharon's still coming through L genuinely we've got six six opportunities left and we've got about 30 still in baskets um wow. Well done, everybody. What a special opportunity. Beautiful. Well done, everyone. Gorgeous. OK, we're going to do another star by now. Um, this is going to be... Mm, this is going to go nuts. Let's make her and Linkage's bought yeah, four of this strand. Yeah. Well done, lovely. Um, one of the few strands I think we've ever bought you. Amazing. Right. We've now got another early bird star by I don't I don't know exactly what we're going to be uh, showing you, but we're going to be showing you an introduction and then we've got the best Peridot that money can buy. So it this is this is oh do you know what I love I love this stone. Um I I I find it incredible. I find Mother Nature incredible. And I find it incredible when you see natural natural things happening, natural weather fronts happening, natural, you know, and, and you know, it, it it really is Mother Nature is amazing. Our earth and our planet is quite incredible. But I can't quite get my head around how this gemstone forms. No. <laughs> I mean, it's so unique, isn't it? You've got a gemstone which, um, I mean, we had, uh, we had Dave with us the other day and we were bringing that gorgeous natural gold and tanzanite, and, mm. which was part of the tanzanite deposit that when, when they were mining two metres down, they're now mining more than a kilometre down, um, you know, which is incredible. 
and various different gemstones you mine uh, by alluvial deposits. So you go to riverbeds and you kind of pan for it. And that's how you find lots of gorgeous sapphire in places like Madagascar and Ilacaca. But this gem forms 20 to 50 miles under our feet at temperatures and, and pressures which are unimaginable. Unimaginable. Now, it's interesting to find where you find Peridot. So I've got, a, I've got a world map with the key Peridot mining locations. Because um, I think it's really important that we know where this gem can be found. So um, the USA, let's go from, let's go from um, uh, west. So you've got the USA, amazing, world-renowned, um, world-renowned uh, Peridot. Absolutely incredible. You've got um, uh, Peridot from um, um, uh, Egypt, which very, very rarely do we actually get that, but you can, but you can find it in that kind of um, Middle Eastern kind of area. You can then get it from places like Kenya as well, so you can see it in Africa. Also uh, from Pakistan, you can also get it from uh, Thailand as well. I mean, there are a few key locations. A lot of those locations, what you will find is, is that the gemstone is found on tectonic plate faults or where you get lots of earthquakes, where you get lots of kind of tectonic activity. And that's because when this gemstone forms, it's pushed up through the kimberlite pipes. And it is found just literally a few hundred feet below the Earth's surface as it's been pushed upwards. Now, depending on where you get this gemstone from, you it will result in very, very different colours. So American Peridot, you get lots of lovely greens, um, uh, uh, kind of mint greens. Um, you can get lots of uh, different colours from your Kenyan Peridot and your Kashmir Peridot. Wonderful, great carrot weights, absolutely superb. But there is one location um, for Peridot mining, which is the absolute, it's got absolutely everything. And that is the red dragon mine in China. The result of this incredible um, uh, gemstone mining area is, is, is this incredible Peridot here, where you get the best, the absolute best greens. I've got different grades of Peridot. I've got another slide to show you, uh, which, is, which just briefly goes through kind of what, what, what it is about Peridot that kind of um, gives it its, um, um, you know, gives it its incredible graded qualities. So you've got A grade uh, Peridot, which uh, will be um, commercial grade mines from um, Vietnam, New Mexico, strong brownish colours, very pale yellow colour. Well, that's not what we've got here. Double A quality uh, Peridot comes in uh, green colour, nice, with yellow hue. OK, comes with slight inclusions. Well, that's not this. Um, uses cabochons and, um, um, and faceted cuts. And then you get triple A quality. No brown and saturated green colour with slight yellow tint. Well, that's exactly what we've yep. got here. Slight yellow tint. Difficult to find in sizes bigger than nine by seven. So these are four mils. Um, and we'll come to that in a minute. And when you get Peridot of this quality, you are not going to get it in big sizes. If you, if you, if you, if you want big sizes, then go for cashmere peridot, but it's not going to have the colour. This is an incredible quality. It's got that balance of colour. It's got the most incredible, what I describe as dichroic quality, that fire, that dispersion. And considering it's a natural stone as well, the variety um, of fire, but the consistency of that green is absolutely amazing, isn't it, Mark? And every single stone is exactly the same, which I really love as well. Mm. The, the, the colour grading is, is stunning. Now we've got, gosh, we've got a really interesting slide here. Um, this is from a, um, a lady called Erin uh, Jordan, by, uh, by the looks of it. Uh, friends of mine live in Hawaii, right next to the area impacted by the most recent lava flows in the midst of the destruction nearby. And stress of the unknown, they woke up to this tiny pieces of olivine all over the ground. It's literally raining gems. Uh, nature is truly amazing. Well, it's not quite raining gems, Erin, but uh, what will happen is, is this peridot will literally have been pushed up through that volcanic eruption. Um, and olivine is your, is your peridot. Um, note the colour on that. The colour's really lovely. It's quite a watery green, but it is, it, I mean, to find that is absolutely amazing, isn't it? 
It's nothing compared to this, though, is it? It really is incredible. <laughs> now, this particular variety of peridot, they believe, because, of course, the inner kind of part of the earth is a movable feast, they believe that when this incredible gemstone started to form, it started to form where the North Pole is. Oh, and forever. millions of years later, it's kind of erupted in this particular location in China, which is very near um, Changbai, Heaven's Lake, um, which, which is uh, right um, uh, near an extinct volcano. You've got here the most, I, I think, one of the purest qualities of peridot that money can buy. Now, there's loads of people there already. You are going to be getting a pack of 12 red dragon peridots here. Four mil rounds at 29 99. What a privilege to hold Hello. something in your hand that formed, you know, 20, 25 to 50 miles below our feet. That is quite incredible, isn't it? What a journey this gem has been on. It's really beautiful. To find its way through a network of pipes and cracks to the Earth's surface. What a privilege to be able to be able to bring this gem to you. What a privilege to hold this in my hand. What a privileged position we're in to be able to bring this to you today for 29.99. But of course, that's not your price. Lincolnshire's through, Gillian Maker, Maker in uh, Wales, Devon, London, Yorkshire, Lincolnshire, another bidder in uh, London, well done. Now, whatever you do with this, whether it's you make um, gorgeous spring-inspired jewelry, whether it's you set these with your gallery wire with your bezel strip whether you just keep them it's february's birth not february i do beg your pardon august birthstone as well the freshest the greenest the crispest the cleanest it's it, it's gorgeous it's so good mark it almost doesn't look real does it no it's just it's just absolutely beautiful absolutely beautiful yeah what's he doing he's doing this mark 17.99 I was such a fan of Peridot that I've actually included Peridot in my first part of my collection. Look, this is a, this is a chaffinch. Ooh. Like, let's have a look. I'm oh, Mark. A piece of Peridot. Oh, gosh, that's enormous, that piece of Peridot. Really, so um, I was determined. Whoa. The, the, the collection, all my favourite birthstones and gemstones are included. So. That's amazing. Gosh, that's a really big gorgeous. piece of Peridot. Yeah, gorgeous. That's coming up at 11, Mark's collection. Gorgeous. Seventeen ninety-nine. Not done. Oh no. Yeah, this is gonna go. We've got loads of people there. Dorothy <coughs> Lorna, Maker, Maker. Oh gosh, there's so uh, Danzibel. What a lovely, lovely name. name. Oh, I like that name. A bit of forwardness here. On I mentioned it to you earlier on before the show. On the nineteenth, I'm in the studio with my <laughs> they've twisted my arm. It's taken three years, they've twisted my arm. I'm doing my very first gem setting so yes mark <laughs> I've got the toolkit everything it's going to be amazing so i would grab these in preparation for for the 19th when uh, you've got so a calibrated yeah, stone like yeah. this and there will be semi mounts yeah. that we've got yeah. on our website for this you've got to, you absolutely and you've got such a reliable gem set. you've got a gem mm -hmm. set born of fire there's very little that you will be able to do to wreck this gemstone you know it really you will have to go a long way this gemstone has formed in pressures and temperatures which are unimaginable and it's yours today <laughs> Biblical gemstone, <laughs> yours today, for £9.99. I'm holding a gem which is millions of years old, billions of years old, which is born of the fire of the centre of the earth, and it literally is born of, of temperatures and pressures which I cannot imagine. The only way this gemstone gets to the earth's surface is by being pushed through tectonic and volcanic activity. Um, I've got it in the studio today, in the middle of Redditch, and it's yours for a tenner. What a journey this gem has been on. And to be able to own something of this beauty is absolutely superb. We've got millions of these in baskets. Diana, Jeanette, Claire, Lorna, Maker, Maker, Lindy, loads of you there. What a tremendous deal for you. To, Amanda's just bought two loads. Janet's got two loads. Devon's got two loads. Well done to you. It really is tremendous. What a deal. 12 four mil Red Dragon Peridots 
for nine pounds 99 pence that is absolutely superb well, well done involved for less than a pound yes Ridiculous. Yes, less than a pound yeah. a stone, which is unbelievable. Well done. And as Mark mm. quite rightly says, if you do want to do your gem setting, if you want to go on that journey, if you want to embark on that journey with Mark, because it's going to be, we're all going to learn something, I think, aren't we, Mark? Mm. <laughs> uh, then please, please, please uh, do bag these and get them in readiness for Mark's very first gem uh, setting show on the 19th. Right. Do not move a muscle. You are going to be <laughs> you are going to be lucky enough to get the chance to get the most exquisite tiger's eye kits with the most incredible mm. white nephrite and snowflake jade don't go anywhere we'll see you in a second Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Hello, Jewelry Maker. This is Glenn Lair and I'm here to celebrate my 10th anniversary with Gemporia. That means I've been on the Gemporia channels for 10 years now. So this is a big occasion for me, for sure, hopefully for all of you. And of course on the Jewelry Maker, what's totally brand new that we haven't done other than one other time is where now you're able on Jewelry Maker to actually acquire one of my stones. In this particular collection, you're gonna see a quasar cut, Taurus ring or man in the moon, where you can buy the loose stone, get your own mounting and put it together as your very own piece of jewelry. That's never been done before except brand new here on Jewelry Maker. I'm so glad to be able to host. I will be live in the studio. Tune in live from 11 to 1. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, 7 days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Stay interactive with Jewelry Maker by texting the studio during our live hours of 8 till 5. Start your message with JM Studio and send it to 78070. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email 
or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Hello. <laughs> Do you know what I was thinking day. about then? Do you know what I was actually thinking about? Yeah. Mini eggs. Oh. I was just thinking how lovely they are. Thank you so much, Mark. All right. Top tier chocolate. Top tier. Oh, hello. Oh, the bin's oh, fallen over. Bin. Again. <laughs> right. These kits. Tom sent me a star buy sheet via email. And I was oh, looking yes. at these kits last night and thinking, oh, that sounds amazing. That sounds amazing. And it looks amazing on paper. I really hope, I really hope these are going to be brilliant. Because if, because if, if not, says Kinga's arm, we love you, Kinga. <laughs> we just love her. We love her. Um, because if they are as good, even, 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 uh, even kind of as good as they sound and, and, and read on paper, they are going to fly. Oh my word, I was not expecting anything that looked as good as this. Mark, I know, I know. the tiger's eye, the ag, it, it works beautifully, but the nephrite, oh my goodness me. I've never worked with it before, nephrite. I never, I've never worked with snowflake before. But I, I've never seen no, snowflake no. before, ever. They're enormous. On uh, on jewelry maker, yeah, no. these are the snowflake uh, jadeites, which honestly they've got in them. Let me just show you um, these because they've got in them this these wisps of clarity, Mark, haven't they? No, they're, they're, they're just beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Oh, look at that! Oh they are my like, gosh! They are like little planets, aren't they? The size of the drill holes as well. They are enormous. Look at that. Incredible. So one of the kits, you're getting a couple of these. Um, uh, what look, I mean, it's literally like they are mystical. Mystical. Look at that clarity. Can you see that moment? It's almost like a white seraphonite. In reverse. A negative yes. version of. I was just thinking the same. Yes. Astonishing. <sighs> and then this nephrite looks like the moon. The white nephrite. Have you got that recording, Ben? Because it is literally. Look at this. No, look no, at no. that. Purest, crispest, cleanest whitest nephrite I have ever seen in my life. And what is so wonderful about this, Mark, is it's like, it's got that, you know how when you get jade out, you really want to get that water content. You want to get that yes. translucency. This is all the translucency. There's no fibers at all in this. It is, it is completely clean material. Phenomenal. Okay, this is a kit we're starting with. Now, uh, can I just, these kits are going to be incredibly popular. Um, I'll, show you I'll show you around the tiger's eye first, because it is honestly, it, it's, yeah, it's just ridiculous. exceptional. It's ridiculous. Now we've bought many colors of tiger's eye to air, oh. and the turquoise is by far the viewer's favorite. And this, this strand, because they're so, oh. I've never seen this, this color in 12 mil rounds before. You need a big gemstone just to show off this. Toyancy, it's incredible. The bigger the tiger's eye, the more surface area, the yeah. more you're going to see that incredible chatoyancy. Um, wow. Dyed, dyed tiger's eye sometimes for me doesn't work if it's too dark, like some mm, of the dark right. purple ones, because yes. you don't you don't get that chatoyancy. But you're absolutely right, Mark. Mm. With this kind of teal turquoise blue, you get um, chatoyancy. Uh, it is next level. And every single stone is yes. exceptional on the whole strand. Every single, oh, look at that record. Oh, my gosh. 
Oh, it so is so tactile. It is beyond tactile. It is the, the individuality of these stones is, I mean, this for me is a strand of kind of, you know, that, that's a 50, 60 yeah. pound strand of, um, of, uh, of tiger's eye right there. They are so big, 12 mil pieces. Mm. Right. And, and just so you're aware, tiger's eye, when you get tiger's eye, um, you can mine it in huge, great big pieces, like pieces as big as a, you know, as big as a, a suitcase. Um, but not all of it has chatoyancy. You have to have the fibers lined up perfectly. That's the only way you get chatoyancy. And the fibers inside the gemstone have to be lined up perfectly to give you that chatoyancy. And that doesn't happen all the time with tiger's eye. It's not like, it's not like, it, 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 it's not always like that. Um, here you are getting material, which is, I mean, if we graded tiger's eye, this is like double, triple A quality, isn't it? Now I love the fact, oh, were they? Uh, Gosh, I didn't know that. Okay, these strands are meant to be a deal of the day. That would be amazing. So they were meant to be a deal of the day for next week. They've been actually they've actually been put into kits. Oh, interesting. Now you're also going to be getting a threading pack, which I love, Mark. I've not um, seen these for well, I don't think this is the first time I had the threading threading pack since we've been back at Eagle Road. Really? Yeah. yeah. So what? Since kind of oh gosh, November yeah, last yeah, year. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Gosh, there you go. So yeah, to get a threading pack. Now your threading packs has got monofilament, beading thread and elastic and in. These, these are the big reels, not the little sample reels that we've bought recently in little packs, in little bags. <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. The, um, <laughs> the monofilament is like a very clean, fine, almost like a fishing yeah, line, isn't right, it? That's right, that's yeah. um, right. And then you get elastic and then your, your beading thread, otherwise known as tiger tail. Yes. And we're actually going to be seeing a demonstration with the, uh, with the beading thread today. We're going to be seeing how you can use it in gorgeous macrame designs. But it is the nephrite in this kit. And these are wow, the kinds of qualities that... They're half drilled, which I think is incredible. So to carry on that kind of moonbeam quality, if you want to peg set these like Mark has done in this gorgeous necklace, um, then absolutely superb. But you've got this incredible luminosity, which I have never seen before. This is the kind of material that, um, you know, uh, Jake Thompson or Dave Troth, you know, they, they would want these to come to air with them separately as a separate opportunity. And for one bead, it would be like a hundred pounds or, 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 mm. or something like that. Um, I've got a bit of information about the, the value of your, of your luminosity and your translucency in white jet. It's just literally, uh, it just, literally just a little bit of information from a really, really great uh, website called Gem Select. I love Gem Select. It's a wonderful source of information. And it says here, nephrite clarity and luster. Nephrite jade uh, typically occurs in opaque, uh, uh, sorry, uh, occurs opaque in clarity. Although fine materials form with good translucency. Translucent materials are the most highly valued and when cut and polished, nephrite jade can have a vitreous to greasy luster. What you are getting here, I think we can all appreciate, that could not have more translucency if it tried. There are no fibers, there are no inclusions. It is what I would describe as 100% water content, which is what gives jade its, its kind of, its, its kind of, its gemmy luminosity. The quality you are getting here is literally off the scale. It, 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 is, it is incredible in its, in its translucency. And I would go as far to say, because what I was kind of preparing last night was a little bit of a presentation on mutton fat nephrite. This is, this is a billion times crisper and cleaner than mutton fat. The whole point with mutton fat and uh, 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 nephrite is the fact that it has those kind of inclusions in. You can see that mottled quality. Um, this doesn't have that. This is like 
a white version of Imperial Jade. That's the only way I can describe it. It is so pure and crisp, it's amazing. Now, what would you pay for these two stones here? They're half drilled. And what you are looking at here, size, oh, size wise, are these the eight? Nine, uh, nine, nine mil. Yeah. Goodness yeah. me. Yeah. Nine mil pristine white nephrite orbs. Now, if you do a, a search online for white nephrite, this is what you can expect to see. It's lovely. Very, very nice. Really lovely. But you can see those kind of mottled qualities there. You can see where mutton fat gets its kind of name from because it's got that mottled um, fibrousness. What you are getting here is literally like a black piece of paper with a white, uh, sorry, with a hole cut in it on a white table. It is that, it is that pure and consistent. They are orbs of imperial nephrite. Now, this week I've been bringing you, you know, we've, we, we bought you jade kits this week at, yeah, 200 pounds, 150 pounds, 99 pounds. You know, they've been, they've been absolutely wonderful and worth every single penny of it. The price we're about to show you, I think is completely and utterly incorrect. I don't know how we can do this. I don't know why we would want to do this. But the most important thing is, is we can do this. Prepare yourselves. Prepare yourselves for something incredible. Mark, do you know how much these kits no are going to be? Absolutely oh, my idea. gosh. Right. OK. No, no. So in 60 seconds, you are going to see a price which I wouldn't even pay for one of your nephrite half-drilled rounds, let alone the other nephrite half-drilled round and the incredible strand of tiger's eye you're getting here and the threading pack. It Honestly, it makes no sense whatsoever, but you are getting here a vitreous translucency the like of which we have never experienced before on Jewelry Maker. I mean, this quality, I don't know what it's even akin to. It's kind of akin to the finest. It's not even akin to Moonstone. It is. It has got such a high water content here. It is pure, crisp, genuine, natural, white, imperial nephrite. <laughs> It's 50 quid for the whole thing. For the whole kit. 49.99 for the entire kit. Oh my word. Pat, Maker, Barbara, Gabrielle, Maker, Eileen, Anne Marie, Sally, Susan, Gloria, Julie, Susan. This is absolutely unbelievable. Stuart, Lynn, Barbara, Maker. This is absolutely crazy for the quality that you're getting here. It's amazing. I've got a price comparison as well um, in a ring. Look at this, a beautiful white, um, uh, five A's uh, white nephrite jade, um, 22 karat gold ring. It's over, it's over a grand. Uh, I mean, I mean, that's, I mean, yeah, it's, I mean, it's absolutely beautiful, isn't it? It's gorgeous. But that's the kind of level of quality we're talking about here, isn't it? The kind of pieces which on their own, should be, I think, 50 to 100 pounds just for one of these incredible half-drilled orbs. And you're getting two of them with the tiger's eye and, of course, the threading pack as well. It's absolutely wonderful. It must have been wonderful to work with, Mark. Incredible. They're absolutely beautiful. And as I said, I've never worked with it before. I don't actually get to work with Jade very much. I've had a couple of knotting kits recently. Yes. But I've, I've never worked with nephrite. I've never, never seen or actually physically work with the white. It's, it's like so, a it's light beautiful. bulb, it isn't it? Glows. It just yes. glows, doesn't it? It really does. Peter, Lynn, there's more people coming through. This is so good to see. Well done. Yours today for under £50. It's absolutely um, uh, tremendous. Well done, everyone. 0800 644 Go, 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 go. Guess what? We're not done. <laughs>
Look at what you are getting here. The most amazing quality. The most amazing deal. I can't believe we are taking the price points lower. It really is up to you to add this to your order, to get it, to make with it. To, and also, you could just take the nephrite and go and see what people's reactions are, what local jewellers' reactions are to this incredible stone. Because the like of... I've, I've, you know, we've... We, obviously, jewellery maker has been going now for 11 and a half years, almost 12 years. We have never seen anything like this. Sheila, well done to you. Elizabeth, well done to you. More makers coming through. This is great to see. Well done. 34.99. Oh my word, it's absolutely super. 34 pounds and 99 pence. You've got the most incredible nine mil natural nephrites. It is a glowing representation of this. This is like the textbook quality of white nephrite. This is what you want it to look like. It's like an imperial quality of uh, nephrite. Well done to Jeanette, well done to Sue, well done to Janet, well done to Liz. It's absolutely flying out the door. Obviously, with these kits as well, very, very, very limited quantities as well. So please just add it onto your order as soon as you can. Well done. We do have more kits coming up, different sizes as well, which is wonderful to see. Well done. Yours today for $34.99. Well done, Maker in Hampshire coming through. Well done. Now, of course... Now, of course, um, now, of course, we do have other kits. And I understand that a lot of you will be putting these kits in your baskets, seeing, you know, which ones you like the most. Check out your baskets then. They are very low quantity kits, so, so please do not leave them in your baskets for too long because they will be taken out your baskets and given to Alison in Bristol, who's just checked out, or a maker in Hampshire, who's just checked out. Vivian in Hertfordshire, well done to you. $34.99, amazing. Well done. Oh, I'm, wow. I, I, I can't Incredible. wait to see what your reaction is to the tiger's eye. And, of course, that incredible nephrite half-drilled pairing there. It's beautiful. And it's interesting that we're bringing these to you in pairs. Um, when you get things like jade bangles or when you get uh, really high-quality jade carvings, they tend to be sold in pairs. Mm. Um, right. So it's interesting that you've got these half-drilled yeah. uh, pieces in pairs as well. Hazel, well done to you. Sue in Somerset, well done. There's more people coming through. This is great to see. Well done, everyone. Gorgeous. Now, we've got, uh, yeah, another Tiger's Eye kit. Now, the Tiger's Eye you're going to be getting here slightly smaller. Same incredible quality, though, isn't it, Mark? It's just, it's just absolutely stunning. The, the colour matching is absolutely perfect. So if you wanted to do graduated Oh, yes, I so, like that idea. So with this kit, I made the bracelet, the little stretchy bracelet oh, in the front there. The way. Yes. There we go. It's just there we go. It just glows. Even against the white background, look, it just it's just amazing. Mark's absolutely oh, yeah. right with the colour, the colour matching is yeah. perfection. Um, so we haven't we haven't gone for a different quality, we haven't gone for a different shade. You can see here slightly smaller, slightly larger pieces there. Okay. Now, also something that we have not uh, skimped on or changed at all is the quality of the nephrite. So then, oh, sorry, the tiger's eye you're getting here, by the way, is uh, these are 10 mil rounds, okay? The same uh, quality of nephrite. Let me show this to you. Ever so slightly smaller, these ones. These are 8 mil, so the ones we just bought you were 9s. Yeah. These are 8s. Exactly the same. Look at that. It's like amazing. light bulbs. <laughs> they are amazing. They are absolutely superb. So the 9 mils, we've now got 8 mils of your gorgeous nephrite. There you go. Wow. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous quality unbelievable um unbelievable tone and again they're half drilled aren't they are they half, are yeah. these ones half drilled yes yeah. lovely nice that they are half drilled so if you wanted to set them into a gorgeous ring you know peg set them into a ring can you imagine how that would that would just look wonderful wouldn't it set kind of upwards incredible absolutely beautiful i've as I said, this is this is a um a, a cz peg that i've used yes nice it and it just works just beautifully it really does, doesn't it? It really does. And when I say kind of luminous, let me just show you this. In fact, do you know what? I think I've actually got a proper torch. Just, oh, no. Of course it's got no batteries in. Of course it doesn't. Oh, no. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, there we go. Just look at these. Look at the way that glows. It literally is luminous. It's absolutely superb, isn't it? It's just in, 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 in daylight, in sunlight, that is going yeah. to be unstoppable. 
It really, really is. Okay, we're at 99.99. We're not stopping there. We're going to give you the best possible deal that we can. It comes with a threading pack as well, which is just gorgeous. Here we go. Absolutely <laughs> superb. We're going to go lower on the price point. We shouldn't be doing this at all. The, yeah. $29.99, honestly, amazing. And I have to say, and this is something which Neary's just said, but I will, you know, and I've, 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 I've said this, but I'll say it again. Can you imagine if we bought these two nephrites to air on their own, these two, uh, as near as damn it, you know, in, in, imperial white nephrites to air on their own, as a pair, how much would they be? Would they be $29.99 for the pair? Or would they be, you know, uh, uh, £100 for the pair? Or maybe even more because it's being sold as a pair and they're identical. I mean, it just, it is, it is incredible. Alison, Anne-Marie, Gabrielle, Irina, well done to you. Pat, Maker in Stirlingshire, Pauline, Barbara, Yvonne, well done to you. Sheila, Maker, well done to you. Absolutely gorgeous. Well done. It's just superb. Well done. 0800 644 Well done. Go, 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 go. Lots of people with multiples in their baskets as well. Now, we do have two more kits to bring you. Um, oh, gosh. I am, I am genuinely quite scared about what Neary's got in store for these uh, because these are really, really high quality kits. We've got the gorgeous snowflake jade as well, which we've never had before. Very excited about that. Well done, Eileen. Sheila's just taken two of this kit. Well done to you. The quality you're going to be getting here, absolutely superb. Um, right. This is a quality of jadeite we have, I, I've, I have never seen before. Um, it's specifically um, um, it's specifically uh, been drilled with these drill holes, which are, I mean, you'd be able to get almost any of our wires through Absolutely. here, won't you, Mark? Yes, it's 1.25, I think you'll be able to get through. Do that. you think? Yeah. Oh, my gosh, yeah, amazing. Really so all your, all your knotting cords, even your one mil leather, I think you'd yeah. get through that as well. So a simple, simple friendship bracelet, friendship necklace. Abs yeah, Absolutely. Yeah, they, they, they really are. That drill hole is yeah. wonderful. This is a very different quality of jadeite. It's got more of that kind of waxy luster. It's got more of that traditional gorgeous color that you'd expect to see. You're going to be getting your threading pack with monofilament beading thread and elastic. You're also going to be getting a gorgeous strand of black agate as well. It's very, very good quality black agate. It's really deep and rich. And it's got that wonderful luster to it, that gorgeous kind of glossiness, which, you, um, which, um, which just looks superb. Now... I do have black jadeite coming up as well, just to let you know. So if you want to put this with black jadeite, then you absolutely can do. Just wait until you see the quality of this snowflake jadeite. This is, this is something I've, I, I have not seen before. I'm just going to pick them up because I, I've, I've got to show you around these stones. They have got it. The only way I can describe it is like, yes, seraphonite in reverse, yes. as we were just saying. You get these you get this depth of kind of translucency and clarity, these flecks, which are unbelievable. Snowflake jade is unbelievable in its quality. So you should be getting a predominantly white stone, but with these incredible teal green to kind of apple green um, uh, fibers going through them. It is unbelievable believable again we're bringing these to you in a pair which i really love i love the fact that we're um, offering these to you in pairs these are your 13 millimeter snowflake jadeite rounds they are unreal aren't they absolutely gorgeous gorgeous quality now again a really really limited limited kit start price is oh you're gonna absolutely love this start price <laughs> oh my word start price of just 100 pounds and again imagine in like a jade show or something like that or a deal of the day we'd be offering you know two of these for that kind of price. look at this in the gorgeous in, in, in the beautiful beautiful necklace that um that how, how many how many have we got Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh gosh. 
Oh, Neary, wh what are you doing? No. Oh, my gosh. Sorry. O OK, so I'll be honest with you. We were plan We are planning, obviously. You know, we've always planned to take this lower than 99.99. Fact, yeah? Um, uh, oh, gosh. I'm a little bit discombobulated because the price point Neary is telling me is... Uh, miles, miles and miles and miles and miles and all of the miles lower than, thank you, Mark, than um, where I had envisaged us going. What are we thinking? 79.99, yeah? 69.99? Surely not under 50. Surely we can't do under 50. Surely we can't go lower than 50 pounds. <laughs> 29.99. That's not even the price for one nope. of the left right. Nope. And also, Mark, I think there it's important go. that we all realise the price for one, if you get two of them, the value and the price doesn't double. It, it kind of mm. goes up massively because the appeal of getting two and the versatility of getting two and the fact that traditionally jade pieces of this calibre are bought to you in pairs makes these infinitely more desirable and to a lot of people infinitely more valuable. Barbara, Suzanne's got two, Julie, Pat, Maker, Angela, Maker, Pauline, Bob. This is absolutely flying out the door. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Absolutely superb. I can't believe this. This is, uh, this is just superb. Now, we've got Neary, who, <laughs> who, who, decided, who decided this morning he had a plan. OK? He we decided... weren't involved in this plan, were nope, we? Nope, <laughs> we were not involved in this plan. So, um, so Neary, about, about three or four minutes ago, said, do you know what? We're going to go to 29.99, but... We're going to shock them with this price. And I tell you something, it's not $24.99. We are going low. To just, I tell you what, anybody who is even remotely interested in, in this incredible offering of genuine natural snowflake jadeite in this kit, this is an opportunity of a lifetime, something which you simply cannot miss out on. Your deal today for the most sensational kit. Neary's pressed it. <laughs> Honestly, and Mark and I have got nothing. We have no. nothing to do with this. This At is all. obscene. 1999. Ah, oh, that's so wrong. That's such a wrong price point, Mark. What has oh, he done? Man. Honestly. Of course, it's flying <laughs> out the door. Well done, Stuart. Well done, Angela, Maker in Devon, Lincolnshire, Hilda, Teresa, Alison, Sandra, Sally, Lindsay, Barbara. Lindsay's got four in her basket. Check out all four, lovely. It's yours today for £19.99. pence. That is tremendous. Deborah, Maker, Joyce, Maker, Hilda. Maker, Maker's got three. three. Yeah. Who thought this morning they could buy three kits with snowflake jadeite in this morning? I mean, this is above and beyond any. This is, yeah. So those, those two components there, so you've got your strand of jade, what, 8.95? Yeah. Oh, um, agate, sorry, 8.95, yes, 4.95 for that. So that's, 30, so that's £7 for two nephrite, two, two jadeites. Two snowflake jadeites, the like of which we've never seen before. It is unbelievable. It is a tremendous, it's like quite, it, it, yeah. yeah, I know, right in the wallet, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> right in the wallet, says Neary. Maker in Devon's bought two. Lorna's got two. Suzanne's got four. Hampshire's got two. Well done to you. It's yours today. Well done. Under £20. Absolutely superb. It's ridiculous. Margaret, well done to you. I know. I, I can't believe it. I, I cannot believe this either. It is just tremendous. And I'm just so pleased so many people can multi-buy this kit today, yeah, Mark. Absolutely. That's it's gorgeous. Beautiful. I mean, do you know, if you kept those, those jadeites as your markers and your guru in a really nice jadeite mala and then use the agate for other projects, I think it'd be amazing. It really is tremendous. It is, it is yours today. Well yeah, done, yeah. everyone. Guess what? We've got one more kit as well, haven't we? Does we've got... Know? We've, does, does no. Realize? Neary, we've got one more kit. Did you realise that? Oh, gosh. Oh, oh man. No. 
Well done. Please check your baskets out. Peter, Margaret, Maker, Maker, Teresa, Sally, Lindsay, Barbara, Pauline. It's your... Well done. Peter's bought four. Well done, darling. Maker and Sterling Shears just bought two. Well done to you. There's no point in being scared, Neary. You need to you need to just get on with it. Well done, everyone. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh no. Right, okay, please keep coming through for that. Oh gosh. Ah. Mm. How are you feeling about this, Mark? <laughs> Slightly worried. <laughs> it's completely out of our hands, isn't it? Okay, black agate. Oh gosh, no. Elasticity from Beadalon. I like the fact that, but, that we're all privy now to uh, Tom's inner monologue. <laughs> uh, okay, you also get white half-drilled nephrite six millimeter rounds. These are Amazing. Gorgeous. Look at the, they are beautiful, Mark. Again, Stunning. that same quality, that same luminous quality of nephrite. It's absolutely beautiful, isn't it? Just gorgeous. It needs a whole new colour of its own, doesn't it? Yeah. I think white is just not descriptive enough, is it? It needs a whole new colour like moon nephrite yes. or something or yeah. I, yeah something it needs something doesn't it it deserves it because this isn't your if you've seen the the mutton fat nephrite that um oh gosh Tsar Nicholas II, when he was, um, his, his sarcophagus was made out of mutton fat um uh Russian nephrite beautiful quality absolutely gorgeous but you have got here the most translucent imperial quality nephrite that money can buy with the purest whitest color and it's in a kit okay right come on neary let's just do it oh gosh no yeah oh well just do it yeah 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 oh gosh Maker of the West Midlands, Pat, Sharon, Maker in Neathport, Tolbert, well done to you, my lovely. This is, yeah, just, uh, just do it. Oh, gosh. <laughs> just, just, yeah, just do it. Just rip off the plaster, Neary. Here we go. Oh, no. This is, right. This is, we've messed up. 1999. Just take it. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Well done, Stuart, Lorna, Anne-Marie, Alison. Just, you are getting the deal of the century here. You are getting the deal of the century here. This is, this is way too low. This is far too good um, a gemstone to be taking this low. This is worth uh, so much more. It's yours today. Well done. And I just, and I just know that anyone in there, anybody who is a nephrite, a jade, jadeite fan, the quality you are getting here is nigh on imperial for under 20 pounds. It's tremendous. Lorna, Gabrielle, Caroline, Barbara, well done to you, my lovelies. Gorgeous, well done. And of course, what's so nice is you've got that graduated size as well um, uh, throughout the kits as well. So if you do want to get all of them and make the most incredible graduated jewelry, then you absolutely can do. We've, I mean, we've totally messed up on the price points of these kits, but do you know what? Just, just take them, enjoy them. Well done. There's very, very little point bringing us, uh, you know, bringing you kits if they're uh, if they're not gonna they're not gonna completely and utterly sell out. And, and at deals like this, they are flying out the door. Right, Mark. What are you gonna make? Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to show you a bit of beading thread macrame because, as I said, I haven't had I haven't I've not had beading thread or worked with beading thread for years. It must be three or four years since the last time I I've done it with wire and with um, Estelon cord and that sort of thing, but I've not used beading thread for a long time. So, put my specs on. So this is the, the beading thread, otherwise known as tiger tail, if you've not used it before. And it's lots of very, very fine strands of metal, all twisted with a colored coating over the top. Do not use your ordinary Fiskar scissors with this because it is a metal. So ah, either, use okay. your, either use your wire cutters from your tool kit or flush cutter pliers, which, mm. which I use. So what we're going to do, we're going to make these little sections that are on the... If you could pass me the 
the necklace on the minky bust. Oof. There you go. Marvellous. Lovely. So we're going to do these little sections on here. So you can either do one section vertically on your board or just turn the board as I've done on here. Uh -huh. And we're just going to go across. So just take one piece of your beading thread and have an overhang of maybe three or four inches either side. Make sure we, and in your back of your beading thread, you'll have a little slot on the back. So just that will just hold on your, your beading thread. Mm -hmm. So to attach your beading thread, we're going to place one part of the thread over the top into a slot. We're going to go through the adjacent slot from the back. And then we're going to take our shortest piece underneath the long piece back into the initial thread. Mm. Now what I do with beading thread is I take my flat nose pliers and I just pull nice and tight. So oh, that that, okay, go, that nice. goes right down into the, yeah. into the slot, into the wedge. So next we need to pop on our bead choice. I'm going to go for two of the larger black agate with one of the big tiger's eye in between. Now what I've done is I, I like to separate the gemstones when I'm doing macrame. So I've gone into my stash and I found some 80 gold Mayuki seed beads in between. Mm. So for each of our sections, we're going to pop on one Eito, and then we're going to pop on one of our agates. Then one of the Eitos, and then our large tiger's eye, which is just, as I said, every single one is just incredible. Then an Ato, and then an Agate. And because we started with a with a seed bead, we're going to finish with one as well. So we're just going to pop on our gemstone, and then finish with an Ato. So then you need to decide how many times you're going to do this. I think with my necklace, I did eight of these little sections. So we're just going to slide those up to one end. We're just going to go down in the corresponding slot opposite, and we're going to do the same. And again, you can use your flat nose pliers just to give you a bit of a bit of help. So pull nice and tight into the slot, because that's nicely attached top and uh -huh. bottom. So now we can start our macrame. So again, we go for our new piece of tiger tail. And you'll probably need a good 60, 70 centimetres for each little section. Okay, now with tiger's eye, you generally don't want it to kink, but when you're macrame with it, when we come to do our gemstone wrapping, you want it to kink. So it's, a, it's the best of both worlds actually with, with the, the beading thread. So we're going to take our thread underneath and we're going to bring the two ends up so they meet at the top, so then you know that you've got equal amounts of thread either side of your piece of work. And we're going to do twist macrame, so half knot macrame before our bead section, then we're going to go into full square macrame, and then we're going to go into half square again. Because it's sometimes it's quite difficult to do twist knots in between your, your gemstone beads. And when we okay. get to that, I'll, I'll show you when we get to that little section. So again, we're just going to do our half knot macrame. So I, from doing a half knot, I always do the left side and all we're going to do is repeat. And what I've done is for my, each of my sections, I've made 15 half square knot moves. So we're just going to do, that's two, pull nice and tight. And after about three or four of our moves, you'll start to see the little helix pattern start to form. That's three. And if you wanted to, because you, the gemstone have the gemstones have such large drill holes, you can actually use multiple layers down through your through your beads. And then we've got five. So let's we'll go to ten for the demonstration. And then that's six. Now even, even though this is a metal thread, it's very, very soft to use. So you don't worry about doing multiple use. You can, I mean, I'm a, I'm a crown for two days solid for the kits in preparation today. And 
absolutely no issue with it at all. Okay, so we've got R10. Okay, so when we add our first CB, we're going to slide that up and we've moved from now, in, in, instead of just doing left-hand sides of the knots, we're going to do left and right. So I'm going to go left and right. Okay. And then we're going to take our first gemstone up. Now this is where we want the bead to kink. So I'm going to go left side of the knot first. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pull the thread so it sits around the gemstone. And I'm just going to pull the two threads just down. And what that's done, that's actually kinked the thread underneath the gemstone. So you can see now that the, the threads haven't moved that are surrounding the gemstone. So I'm going to do the right-hand side now. It's such a great material to do this. I love thing. tiger tail. And as I said, it's so nice to have it back again. Mm. Just going to go in and just pull nice and tight, give that a little kink, and then we're going to bring up the second part of the knot. Then we're going to go up and do the little, little seed bead again. As I said, you don't, you don't have to use a seed bead in between, but because of that tiger's eye especially, I like to have lots of light around the bead just to show mm. it off. Even, oh, that's just yes, spectacular, definitely. isn't it? <laughs> that is absolutely beautiful. So we're going to go in again. Pull nice and tight, and then we're going to pull down, which kink, kinks the thread. Going to go and pull nice and tight, then go up. Then we'll do the left-hand side and the right. And then our agate. Awesome. Okay, so drop the sides down either side, just kink our thread. It's quite an it's quite unusual, isn't it? Because you've got a thread, but it acts as almost a wire. Yeah, absolutely. It? No, 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 absolutely. No, I've, I've, as, as I said, I've always loved this this product. Yeah. Now, because we've added our last eight o, we revert back to our half square knot because we want that that twist again. Okay, so. That's one, and then, as I said, we're going to do. We're going to replicate the number of beads we had. And as I said, after three or four of your knots, it will start to twist again. So that's three, four, and when you're doing your macrame, if you find that the threads want to, can you see at the moment, I've got one standing upwards and the other one at oh the yeah, clock. Okay. So if, that, if you find that that's quite awkward to do your macrame, all you need to do is take your right hand cord from right to left underneath and just flip it over and then they're back, easier to work again. So we'll just do our last three. We've got one, two and three. So that's our, that's our 10. Okay, so that's 10. So that's our little section finished. So what we're going to do next is we're going to take it off our board, like so. And then what we're going to do is, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to cut off our working threads. So what you can see is one side of my spiral, you can see that the, that the thread is, is just coming out from that last little knot. So what we're going to do is take our flush cutter pliers uh -huh. and we're just going to lay the back of our pliers flat on the top of the spiral and we're just going to cut and then we're going to flip it over and we're going to do the other side. Okay, so that's that's our section. So what we're going to do is you need to decide whether you're going to finish with a another you can so if what I'm saying is you can have a long working through a long lazy strand and then just leave a space and then add your next section. So you could pop in another bead if you wanted to Let's do that. So you could pop in a new bead, and then you can do your next macrame section. Gosh, I, li I like uh, to do the sections and then join them together. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to use crimp beads, because mm. I like, I'm going to make those little sections. So 
just going to take one of our one of our beads, one of our sorry, we're watching a bead falling off the table. There we well go. caught. Got it, got it. <laughs> so I've taken one of my crimp beads with my thread. I'm going to take the thread back. <laughs> I'm going to pull nice and tight. I'm going to use my round nose pliers as an awl. Just pull that nice and tight. And then I'm going to close that nice and tight. And again, using my pliers to cut the thread. And then doing the second side. Oh, yes, there's the pegs on screen. Ah, right. Mm -hmm. Ah, wonderful. Lovely. Pulling nice and tight again. And then we're going to flip it over. Give a little crimp. And then we're going to close that over. And if you look at the necklace, all I've done yeah. to join them together. And I've not used crimp covers on the two ends of my pieces, yeah. as you can see, because I didn't want them to detract away from the flow of the work. So it's, it's quite seamless. If you, had to, if you had that really tight macrame twist knot yes. and then a big round crimp cover at the end, it would just detract and it wouldn't be as seamless. So all I've done is I've just flattened the crimps, left them flat, and then I've got all these little sections. And then all I've done is I've just popped a jump ring in between as, as yet another another spacer. It's really lovely. At the they're just, they're just, it's just beautiful. It's, it's a so really nice, nice link, beautiful. isn't yeah. it? Yeah, no, it's gorgeous. Yeah. Absolutely lovely. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Well done, Mark. Thank you for Thank that. Thank you. Thank you, lovely. Because a lot of people will have lots of beading thread at home and kind of wondering what to do with it. And it's a really lovely, a it's a really lovely, lovely uh, medium yeah. to do if you've got lots of beading mm. thread. So that's wonderful. Thank you. Um, right. OK. There's a couple of things I want to try and bring you before the end of the hour. Which one? What are we going to do first, Neri? Shall we do it? OK. We have got a star by for the most oh my word. incredible strand of ruby. Don't go anywhere. Now, Ruby, it's it's a gemstone which um, I, I think I think when we started jewelry maker we always wanted to get the big the big four gemstones the big five gemstones if you include tanzanite and you know your your sapphire emerald diamonds and of course your tanzanite and of course your ruby um, but it was something which um, oh my word um, we've had in lots of different kind of qualities we've had filled ruby before and that's absolutely wonderful and it's great and it offers you it offers you a nice. It offers you a nice quality. It can offer you lots of lovely clarity, but it's filled. And when you consider that 95% of rubies nowadays are filled and treated or heated or diffused or coated, whatever, this is natural. 20 carats of natural faceted ruby ovals. They are gorgeous. Take a look at that. <laughs> now, that is a strand of ruby, Mark. Incredible, isn't it? That is a strand of ruby. Ooh, Maker in Sterlingshire just literally went, yep, I'll have one of those. Susan in Warwickshire, yep, I'll have one of those. It's one of those, it, when, you, when you finally find ruby like this, naturally, so not heated, not fissure filled, not glass filled, not, you know, um, uh, uh, diffused, nothing. This is totally natural. When you find ruby like this naturally, it's one of those occasions where it doesn't really, it kind of ceases to matter how much it is because maybe you've never been able to find ruby of this kind of quality naturally. You've never been able to find carrot weights, individual carrot weights um, uh, naturally. Today, we are offering you 20 natural rubies, which vary in size. Okay, get this, five by four to eight <laughs> by seven. They are gigantic pieces. That's amazing. In, I mean, here, I think you've got, uh, so two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14. There's about 15 on here. I think you've got 15 rings. 
easy. No, I said I've got a beautiful um, pieces. My first um, gem setting show week after next. Yes. I've got something which I've never seen before. You might have seen them on the show called Huggy Settings. Oh, okay, right. Yeah, so they have the long arms, which you, you fold over and then you cut to size. Ooh. Which are really amazing. So for your larger cabochons and your larger stones. So that, that, I'm just thinking of those. They'd be incredible. Do you know what? I think yeah. you're absolutely yeah. right. And, and with things like your wrap tight settings as well, which go around yeah. the gemstone, because you've got this kind of, right. you've got this midpoint on the gemstone. Can you imagine these bezel sets set with your gallery? Can you imagine how they are going to look in your jewelry, in rings, in... I mean, I'll tell you what they remind me of as well, Mark, because they've got that beautiful fastening across either side, but just imagine that it's flat on one side and it's got that gorgeous, that gorgeous faceted quality over the top. They're almost rose cut. They're almost Absolutely. like the cabochons yeah. you've got in yeah. your 12 o'clock kits, actually. Yeah. They're they good, are yeah. gorgeous. Maker's got three in their basket. Okay, let's show that we mean business here. The price on this is obscene. And if, you're, and if you're one of the many, many viewers out there who are just thinking, I don't care how much it is, I just want it, then I'll tell you something, this is going to be one of the best decisions that you make. Because honestly, 49.99 is a billion miles away from where we're going to be going today. If I could promise you this today for under £20... So that's less than a pound a carat for natural ruby. And by the way, and by the way, we don't have thousands of this strand available. We're at 19 pounds and 99 pence. Pat, Veronica, Rosalind, Maker, Susan, Barbara, absolutely tremendous. Gabrielle, well done to you as well. Judy in Yorkshire, well done to you as well. This is tremendous. Now, a lot of people recently have been putting their natural rubies oh, yeah. with things like this with your beautiful jade eye. It's absolutely incredible. It gives you that wonderful kind of, that gorgeous kind of Eastern inspired kind of color combination, doesn't it? That beautiful uh, good fortune red, that imperial red with the beautiful uh, uh, jade eye greens. Ben. What you doing? Get your clock out. And make it a 30 seconder. Nineteen ninety nine oh, is God. not your price. Now I'm not going to lie to you. We, it, it is a limited quantity strand. However, there are millions of you there. This is wonderful to see. Well done. We are going lower, significantly lower. I mean, to the kind of price point where anybody who is at home now and thinking, Do you know, I absolutely love this. It's gorgeous quality. It's beautiful, beautiful quality, beautiful quality. But I'm not going to be able to afford it. I'm going to make you a promise. You are today. Look at this. Twelve ninety nine. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> That's amazing. We're looking at what? About, about, you know, we're looking at around about, what, 70-odd P a carat. That for natural ruby. This is unbelievable. Barbara's got two. Gabrielle's got two. Well done to you. Maker and Sterling, she's got two. Well done to you. Judy's got two. Hilda, Lydia, Maker, but, uh, Peter, Carla, Julie, Mary, Brian, Mrs. in Cornwall. Well done to you. Maker's got four. Well done to you. Susan's got, uh, well done to you. Sorry, well done to you, my lovely. 12 99 That is undeniably one of the best deals we've ever done on Ruby, Mark. And they're not small pieces, are they? I mean, they're enormous. That's each, it. Each individual piece is a piece of jewellery. The, the pendants there, incredible. I wouldn't even mm. expect to get natural yeah. Ruby chips or nuggets no, no, for 12 99 no. Let alone what can only be described as beautiful oval, almost kind of rose-cut qualities that you're going to be getting here. Such a beautiful strand, such a sympathetic cut for the gemstone and such a vibrancy um, that you would think it's been filled, it's been dyed, it's been heated. It's all 100% verified natural natural ruby it's yours today irene sue makeup well unto you pat's just come through that's great susan's just bought two northampton she's got two well done to you it is tremendous well done everyone there are so many in baskets check out as soon as you can everybody it's yours for 12 pounds and 99 pence i i mean I, put it with whatever you want i i would have to put this with gold mark i would i keep looking at that that strand of i'm assuming that's jadeite next to you this yeah with the red this that would be so beautiful so at some point today yeah, we will yeah. be playing this probably the next hour after the deal of the day but it is uh, the very first strand we've done of natural gray 
Jadeite. Um, it is uh, it is the ultimate strand, I think, to put as guru beads. The quality, yeah. the wonderful, wonderful patinations you're getting in here. I think, look at that. With the, it looks amazing with the ruby, company. doesn't it? It's beautiful. Colleen's got two. Rosalind's got two. Well done to you. It, it's absolutely flying. So many in baskets. Well done to you, Sally Maker, Nottinghamshire, Greater London, Colleen. Well done to you. Please, please, please check out your baskets as soon as you can. What we're going to do, we're going to leave these graphics live throughout the break so you can keep on coming through to get it. I've got, I've got like 20 left. Keep coming through for that. Well done. Do not go anywhere. Deal of the day, genuine wow. diamond briolettes, I think, for the first time ever on Jewelry Maker. Coming up after the break, it's the deal of the century. Don't go anywhere. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Hello, Jewelry Maker. This is Glenn Lair and I'm here to celebrate my 10th anniversary with Gemporia. That means I've been on the Gemporia channels for 10 years now. So this is a big occasion for me, for sure, hopefully for all of you. And of course on the Jewelry Maker, what's totally brand new that we haven't done other than one other time is where now you're able on Jewelry Maker to actually acquire one of my stones. In this particular collection, you're gonna see a quasar cut, Taurus ring or man in the moon, where you can buy the loose stone, get your own mounting and put it together as your very own piece of jewelry. That's never been done before except brand new here on Jewelry Maker. I'm so glad to be able to host. I will be live in the studio. Tune in live from 11 to 1. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Stay interactive with Jewelry Maker by texting the studio during our live hours of 8 till 5. Start your message with JM Studio and send it to 78070. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email 
or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. I just want to say before we move on to the deal of the day you love the ruby we've got a strand of emeralds coming up after the deal of the day which in fact we're just going to put it on pre-order feel free to just come through and get it now right what we've got here is 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 quite a landmark moment for jewelry maker because diamonds are one of the last big gemstones that we got on Jewelry Maker. If my memory serves me correctly, Mark, I think we got Tanzanite on Jewelry Maker before we got diamonds. It did, a long time before, um, actually. Yeah. Diamonds was the, it yeah. was the only, it was the missing jewel in the crown. It was like the only, the only... Uh, big gemstone, the only kind of gemstone, the only kind of famous gemstone, I suppose, if you, mm. if, if, if you want to use that word, that we couldn't bring you on Jewelry Maker. And I remember doing birthstone hours and being able to bring you all the birthstones. And when we got to April, yeah. you know, for diamonds, <laughs> we had to uh, borrow, <laughs> borrow, <laughs> borrow a diamond pendant or something from our friends at um, uh, Gemporia and bring that to you instead. Um, it, it, it was always that kind of, it was always that real difficulty in being able to bring you um, what is probably the world's most well-known gemstone. Uh, my husband has got next to no interest in gemstones. He knows what my birthstone is. It's, it's, it's emerald and I'm you know, lucky enough to own a really, really beautiful emerald. But other than that, if I was to say to him, you know, what is this stone? And I was to show him a tanzanite, he, he would have no idea. He'd go, oh, oh a blue stone of some description. Um, but diamonds, everybody knows about diamonds. And, and, and everybody has seen diamonds. And in the same way that you don't have to justify the price point of things like pearls, with diamonds, people expect them to be a certain price. And with diamonds, it's very difficult to source diamonds because you are against so much competition. Of all the jewellers out there, there are more jewellers specialising in diamond jewellery than any other gemstone, really. If you think about Boodles, De Beers, Tiffany's, they primarily deal in diamonds and coloured stones. Other coloured stones are, are, you know, parts of special collections that they do, but they primarily deal just with diamonds. Or Van Cleef, you know, you think of the incredible designs. Now... When it comes to white diamonds, white diamonds are, are really wonderful. And white diamonds are the, kind of, are the kind of diamonds that you can source in a few locations, a few key locations worldwide, most notably South Africa. When it comes to coloured diamonds, and I'm talking about naturally coloured diamonds, but I'm also talking about Diamonds which are mined, which when they come out the ground, they are in essence um, of a whiter color. And then they're heated. And they're heated to get to, to intensify the titanium elements or the cobalt elements within them. And when you heat them, it brings out the yellows, it brings out the blues, it can bring out the reds. Those kind of diamonds, where do you get those kind of diamonds from? Well, there is a very, very special location um, uh, in Australia, uh, known as the Argyle Mine. The Argyle Mine, beautiful, beautiful, um, uh, you know, uh, mine, really quite, quite magnificent when you look at it and you look at the scale of it. But um, back in September, November last year, the Argyle Diamond Mine closed its doors. And uh, this was reported back as far as 2019, where it says the world's biggest diamond mine is closing. And nobody could, nobody could really, nobody could really believe it. Nobody could really understand why. And nobody really um, uh, uh, expected it to actually happen. 
But this has been reported by Bloomberg, as you can see here. You know, it's, it, 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 it's all very well, you know, uh, mining gemological uh, papers and, you know, gem, gem journals talking about the closing of mines. But when you've got Bloomberg talking about it, who are a huge news, um, American news network, um, then it starts to ring alarm bells. Um, the mine closed, not because of lack of diamonds in the ground, but because to actually mine for the diamonds and to extract the diamonds, more money was going into the ground than coming out the ground. So although there are still diamonds in the ground at the Algar mine, they're too expensive to extract. It's just, it is, it is, it is impossible. It's not commercially viable. So for that reason, the mine closed its doors. So we're in a situation now where us, along with everybody else in the world looking for diamonds and wanting to invest in gorgeous colored fancy diamonds, we're now looking for the next thing. We're now trying to find fancy colored diamonds in other locations. And my word, what has it done to the price point of colored diamonds? The price point has gone skywards, massively so to the point where people are being priced out the market all the time. So for us to be able to bring you genuine blue and golden tone diamonds today, which have only been heated, they're not irradiated, they're not dyed, they're certainly not dyed or coated, we definitely don't, wouldn't do that, but they're not even irradiated. For us to be able to bring you heated diamonds, which have been, all we've done is speed up the process at Mother Nature, and uh, could potentially have applied to these diamonds had they been left in the ground for another few million years. Um, for us to be able to bring you this opportunity today, it's such a rare proposition. It's such a rare opportunity. The quality we have today isn't just blue, and it's not merely just a strand. It is I believe, and Mark said this right at the beginning of the show, the only or one of the only strands of briolette cut blue diamonds. Now, this is, yeah, this is from the same South African deposit where, you know, which is famous for the Cullinan diamond uh, discovery. What we've got here is I believe, oh my gosh. They're amazing. The very first strand of blue diamond briolette drops. I love these. We have ever done. And, and this at a point in the market, Mark, where arguably, you know, it is, it is at this point in the market that I wouldn't expect to see any new strands of diamonds at all, no, let no. alone blue <laughs> briolette cut That's diamonds. Exciting. I mean, these are... <sighs> and when you think that you need a diamond to cut and facet a diamond... Yes! To, ..to the work involved, it's incredible looking at them. They're amazing. Diamonds come in lots of different shapes and sizes, and, and a lot of the diamonds you will see on the high street are what you would describe as kind of um, melee sizes. So they are literally um, like tiny little microscopic pieces of what, what Steve Bennett, the founder of Gemporia, would call um, gravel. Or, uh, or he, would, he would describe it as something called frozen spit. He would just, he, he's described it as before. And, it, and they're grey and they're just grubby and they look dirty and they look... And no matter how much you heat or irradiate a diamond like that, it's always going to look awful. It's always going to look ah, The surface of it will be cracked and pitted. What we are looking at here, the initial quality of these diamonds has to be supreme. For us to warrant the heating, but most importantly, the faceting. The time it takes to facet these into a briolette cut, <laughs> these have got to be exceptional diamonds. 
Now, we know you love a briolette. And in fact, it was, it was on, it was on um, ah, Friday when we bought you the Cullinan Topaz briolette uh, drops. They were absolutely sensational. And they were by far and away the most popular strand. There's something about this cut. And Mark, I know you're a huge fan of the briolette cut. I love it. You? I think it's probably one of the most elegant shapes. Absolutely. Be because of the shape, every single one warrants being a pendant, whatever size, colour, shape or, or a briolette. They just sit so beautifully on skin. And it's such an impressive cut mm. as well, isn't it? Beautiful. It's, I, I think it's probably the most elegant of all the cuts that we that we yes. sell on strands here. Yes, I, I, I yeah. definitely agree with that. We're going to have a minute clock to graphics. Now, the reason for that, I hate to be the bearer of bad news. 50 opportunities, 50. I, it's always one of those things, it's always bittersweet, isn't it? But with a strand like this, where you are getting five Five blue diamonds, which are close to one point, sorry, which are close to two carats. So you're getting here a strand of 1.8 carats of blue diamonds in this strand. We'll never be able to bring you more than, more than 100 strands like this. Today, less than 50. Best of luck. Go, 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 go. This, at, at, this is something I would never have expected to see at a time like this. At a time like this, when diamond prices are unbelievable by comparison to where they were a year or so ago because of the closure of the Argyle Diamond Mine. I would never in my wildest dreams had ever to expected to see a strand of genuine diamonds on Jewelry Maker faceted into a briolette cut. This is like the dream strand. Now we've got less than 50 chances. They're already, already being allocated. Lots in baskets. Now, Mark, I mean, this is, this is a strand which for many people... This, they're already selling, by the way. This is a strand which for many people, I can imagine a lot of people getting this home and maybe not doing anything with it for maybe mm. two, three, four years and not doing anything with it, waiting for that right piece Special of jewellery, yeah, yeah. waiting for that right moment, waiting. I mean, if you can think of a design instantly perfect, well done, brilliant, that's awesome. What Would you do anything with a strand like this, Mark? I don't think I would, you know. Mm. I don't think I would. And if, and if I did, it would have to be a, a special occasion, like, a, you know, a big anniversary or a big birthday. Or, yeah. Or something like that, I think. But they're, they're just beautiful. I mean, you've got five separate pieces of jewellery there, each containing a blue diamond. <laughs> it's just... just can't fathom into words, can you, really? The cut and the quality of the gems you are getting here warrant that price yeah, of 698 pounds and 99 pence don't they i mean 100 percent what we're going to do for you today is another one of those cases which it's not about it's not about uh yeah, what i think is a great deal it's not about what mark thinks is a great deal it's not about any of that it's about what we can genuinely do and I am absolutely amazed that we can bring this to you for under 500 pounds. I mean, I am absolutely amazed. The time it would have taken to facet each one of these individual diamonds. We're talking, and, and I'm not talking about collectively between all 50 strands. I'm talking about this single strand here. You are looking at hours and hours and hours of work. <laughs> Sometimes I wish I wasn't privy to talk back. Yeah. Oh Do you know what Neary's just said? <laughs> Shall we bring this to you for under <sighs> 300 pounds? 
Oh, my word. Right. OK, so Brian's got two. Maker in London, Alla in New York, Marie in South Yorkshire. You are all very savvy. And I can tell that you want this, and I can tell that this, is, that this, this means as much to you as it does to me. At a time, at a time in our, in our lives when you would never expect to see a strand of diamonds, a new strand of diamonds on Jewelry Maker because of the competition, because of the amount of people who are scrabbling around trying to find diamonds, coloured diamonds at the minute. And here we are with a 1.8 carat strand of genuine blue diamonds, close to two carats and their briolette cut. And at 299.99, we're not done. <laughs> oh yeah, we're going low. We are going low. We are taking this price down. Anybody who is remotely interested, just put it in your basket. You don't have to check out till you're happy with the price point. You don't have to do anything till you're happy with the price point. The deal we are offering you today is, is above and beyond anything I've ever seen before with diamonds. I've never bought you a diamond deal like this before. This I, this I truly believe, if this had been saved for our birthday celebrations in May, it would not surprise me in the slightest. We're at 299.99. We are absolutely no. But yeah, of course, we just don't have the quantity. And arguably, you could say, well, we don't have the quantity today. We've got less than 50 chances, more of these being allocated already. This is so good to see. In baskets, we've now got Patricia and Agnes and Noala. We've got more people coming through. This is great to see. Well done. And believe you or not, you don't have to check out till you're happy with the price point. You don't have to do anything till you're happy, happy at where we're going to go. But believe you and I, so many of you are going to be so happy today. And we're not going to have enough to go around. We are at £149.99 pence for close to two carats of genuine blue diamonds, which have been been faceted with the most incredible briolette cut and um, briolette cut shape and as Mark says the most graceful the most elegant cut you have got here something which is only comparable price point wise to something on on a par with your red diamonds Heather well done Patricia well done more people coming through this is absolutely brilliant Pam well done to you my darling in County Antrim this is wonderful to see Agnes in Lanarkshire congratulations well done to you it's superb isn't it Pam in County Antrim well done this is yours today genuine blue diamonds for under £150, there's more people coming. This is just unbelievable. And don't feel guilty, don't feel bad that you don't necessarily have that idea, that, that, that design idea in your mind straight away. Don't feel guilty that you're looking at this and thinking, Do you know what, I love it, I want it, I want to be able to get this for a really special piece that I'm going to be making in five years' time. Don't look at this necessarily and think, Do you know what, I feel bad that you know, I'm going to be getting this and not using it for 10 years. There is absolutely, there is absolutely an opportunity for you to use this whenever you see fit. If it's next week or if it's next century, it honestly, you are getting the opportunity to get genuine blue diamonds in a briolette cut. To my memory, one of the only strands we have ever done in this particular shape, in this particular color. And we're not done. <gasps> Ooh. Here it is with the yellow diamonds. Oh gosh, Ben, hit it. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at it with the yellows. <gasps> Just to show it to you with oh. the gorgeous golds and yellows, the multicolored strand we've got coming up next. Dorothy, Fiona, well done. Okay, oh gosh. I am actually quite nervous about this. The chance for us to be able to get diamonds like this again, I wouldn't, you know, th there are certain gems and yeah, yeah, I'm able to say, Mookite, brilliant. You know, uh, pearls, yep. Diamonds of this caliber, of this size, of this quality, of these carat weights in this cut, if we never see 
this kind of quality between now and the end of the year. Uh, you know, do not be surprised. This price point, by the way, feels very wrong to me, but we can do it. Staffordshire, well done. Gillian, well done. This is the deal of the century for 99.99. Oh my gosh. Ah! Uh. 99.99 is your deal today. That is as low as we can go. It's absolutely superb. Well done to you. Well done to Sian. Well done to Jill. Well done to you, Maker. Oh my word, it's absolutely tremendous. It's 99.99. It's on individual split payments of 24.99. That is your deal today. That is absolutely one of the best deals I've ever seen for diamonds. Uh, for diamonds of this kind of caliber. It is unbelievable. Well done to Doreen. Well done to you as well. This is amazing. Marie in South Yorkshire now through. That was great to see. Well done. Check out your baskets as quickly as you can. It is an unbelievable opportunity. Agnes looks like she might be coming through for another one. Well done to Doreen. Uh, well done to you, my lovely. There's more people checking out. This is so, this is so unusual. This is such a unique opportunity, isn't it? Just gorgeous. The luster, everything about this cut, I love, Mark. And whether it's whether it's in you know whatever gemstone it's applied to, it just works. But with diamonds, Absolutely. it just seems to do yeah. something spectacular, doesn't it? What a kudos, though, to see that you have blue diamonds in your stash. Yes, <laughs> in your stash. Yeah. It's incredible, isn't it? I know. Agnes, you've come through for another one. Well done, oh. Maker. This is amazing. Jill in Lancashire, Jill in Staffordshire. Gillian, you've got two there. Well done. What would be the best way to put them individually on a chain for a necklace, please? Um, says Siam in County Durham. What do you reckon, Mark? So you, it would, you would probably use um, 0.4 millimetre sterling silver wire mm -hmm. and do what we call a, a brillet wrap. Pop a jump ring on the top of the wrap and then just feed the chain through. Just keep it really, really simple. Yes. I think if you go onto our, onto our YouTube channel and, and put in jewellery maker brillet wrap, Yes. One, of, one of the guest designers will pop up with a with a demonstration of it. And do you know what, Mark? I think you're right. The simpler, yeah. the better. That's all I. That's all I would do. Yes, that, definitely. That. Yeah. Because I think the more you try and overcomplicate things and try and be clever, the more it's going to detract from the diamonds. You've just got to keep it really yes. simple. Phil, well done to you, Maker. Yeah. This is amazing. There's more people checking out. This is tremendous. We've just taken 1.8 carats of genuine blue diamonds, which have been cut into a briolette, a briolette cut to 99.99 it is unbelievable i know it's tremendous i know it's just incredible i can't believe that uh we've got i mean i mean it's so wonderful that we've got multi bidders but uh, you know never in my wildest dreams did i ever think we'd ever be able to offer you something like this maker in surrey well done to you as well this is absolutely superb well done to everybody and of course when you consider the rarity of the colors even if the diamonds are heated red is the rarest then you've got blue and then you've got kind of your greens and your yellows as well it's absolutely amazing we've got a beautiful strand of multicolor kind of golds and yellow diamonds coming up in just a couple of seconds as well well done down now into single Single figures, it's superb. Patricia, you've got three in your basket, my lovely. If you want them, check them out. And it is one of those things as well, if you do want to kind of split this strand, then you absolutely can do. You know, you both have at least a couple of diamonds to work with. One of you will be lucky enough to have three, but you know, amazing. Gorgeous, well done, everybody, superb. Absolutely amazing, well done. Right. Oh! Now, oh, I'm glad we've gone for multicolour with this because, I, the, the, yes, you're going to be getting golds, but you're getting the most gorgeous canary yellows as well. Canary yellow diamonds can command some of the highest prices of all coloured diamonds. Um, and in fact, Tiffany's have got their own collection, which I think is kind of uh, promoted by Beyonce and Jay-Z uh, for, for just that yellow diamonds. Uh, this is something truly truly magnificent oh my word look at that so you've got these gorgeous golds these really beautiful kind of buttercup uh yellows as well and the greens as well look at the gorgeous greens you're going to be getting there it's absolutely beautiful can i just say we just had another five people with this in the baskets caroline maker phil amina oh my word there's oh. so many more people uh, with the blue diamonds in the baskets if you want it, you've got to check out now because, of course, we started with less than 50. They are flying, okay? Yellow diamonds are unmistakably beautiful. They are gorgeous. Here is, oh, Beyonce. She whiz, she's just, she's got no right to be that gorgeous, has she? She's just, <laughs> ah. Beyonce wears Audrey Hepburn's priceless Breakfast at Tiffany's diamonds in her first Tiffany campaign. 
I mean, if, if you if you want your diamonds, if you want to, you know, get the you know the best face for diamonds for color diamonds, you're going to give it to someone like Beyonce, aren't you? One of the biggest names in popular culture. Um, what I love about our strand, Mark, is you've got. Yes, you've got that gorgeous kind of honey colored diamond at the center of this collection. But either side, you've got yellows, you've got yeah. greens, you've got champagne diamonds on either end as well. It's, it's a tremendous palette of colored diamonds, isn't it? It's just, this, it's just this time of year, isn't it? Epitomized yes. Spring. It's just spring on a strand, isn't it? All the daffodil Most colors. And you get one extra diamond, don't you, on this strand as well? You get six on Yes, yeah, so on this strand, you've got approximately yeah. six of your diamonds. Yes, wow. you've got that big diamond in the centre there. And this is a 1.80 carat strand. These are big diamonds. Yeah. Yeah. So many diamonds that you get aren't even, you know, you can barely measure them in carats or points because they are so small and gravelly and like grains of sand. These are enormous pieces they are big enough to briolette cut the hardest mineral known to man 10 on the Mohs scale this literally is pure carbon we're at 199.99 should we be moving from here no, not really. We, we, you know, we should be kind of staying round here, around the £200 mark. Absolutely amazing. Of course, we are going to go lower, even though you're getting one more diamond here. We are going to be taking this price point down lower for you today. We are going to be giving you even more back in your pocket. OK. Another diamond. Six on this strand. And the most exquisite colours. The most beautiful palettes. And they do have that look, yes, of the Argyle diamond, yellow, you know, the yellow diamonds, probably one of the most famous diamonds to come from the Argyle uh, mine. They're gorgeous kind of fancy yellow tones through to the chocolate tones. And um, we've got a little diamond grading chart here. Now, this is specifically for the golden to yellow uh, tones. Even though diamonds are prized, uh, are, are, are prized as the quintessential colourless stone, they're also found in a variety of different colours, such as blue, pink, yellow. In fact, South Africa is home to some of the rarest and most valuable natural fancy colour diamonds in the world. You've got here this gorgeous kind of tone and saturation chart here where you get everything from your chocolate diamonds to your cognac and your champagne diamonds. I would say ours are kind of in that um, uh, second row from the bottom on the left-hand side. I said, I, 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 I would say ours are round about there. Um, but there are even more kind of, uh, there are even more colours in this strand which I'm not seeing on that chart at all, like the greens that you're seeing here, the kind of limey spring greens. Minute clock. One more stone. I can't believe we're giving you another stone here. I can't believe what we're about to do. Okay? A minute's clock. Blue diamonds, by the way. We've got two left of the blue diamonds. If you want it, get it now. Okay? Incredible quality. Incredible tone. Beautiful variety. And as Mark says, this time of year. This right. actual time of year. <laughs> when the world starts to wake back up and doesn't it make you feel wonderful? Doesn't it give you that, quite literally, that spring in your step? It's gorgeous, isn't it? Spending some time outside yesterday, the beautiful light, the gorgeous clouds, the gorgeous kind of, you know, oh, it's just, it's a good, great time to be alive, isn't it, this time of year? Already loads in baskets. Already I've got people checking out. You know, you know what a rare proposition this is. You know what a rare opportunity this is. Christine, Karen, I'm seeing different names coming through. This is great to see. Well done. Maker in London. Well done. Checking out. That's awesome. Superb. Your deal today. Enjoy. Just get it. You're getting another diamond here for the same price. 99.99. Just go. Go, 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 go. Alison, Pam, Beatrice, well done. Karen's got two in her basket. Just check out. Well done. Now, um, uh, a, a, an opportunity to get some of the most beautiful varieties, some of the most incredible tones in here for under £100. Alison, well done to you as well. Beatrice, well done to you. Pam in County Andrum, well done. Superb. Absolutely gorgeous. Go, 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 go. 0800 644 655. And again, with a strand like this, you know... 
I do look at this, Mark, and I think, you know, you could actually do, um, uh, you know, just you could do a lot worse than just keeping this in a, you know, in a box for um, yeah, yeah. from here to yeah. eternity. But oh, with the, with the colour of these diamonds, they, I feel like they deserve to be in yeah. jewellery. Because you've got six there, you've got two complete suites, haven't you? Earrings and... Oh, and my gosh, don't you just. Pendant. Yeah, I think they're just beautiful. I can't wait to get them outside in the sunshine. Yes. They're just transform. There's one particular one. When we see the VT, yeah. second from the left. Yes. It's, it's, it's ombre, isn't it? You've got that dark yes. at the top and as you go down to the yeah. base it's just that's my favorite stone on the strand I it's think. Beautiful, beautiful isn't it, it? yeah jillian well done to you more people checking out their baskets today this is wonderful well done and you know what if you do decide you want to split this between you and a friend you've got three each there haven't you which yeah, is yeah. which is which is just amazing being able to bring you uh genuine diamonds briolette cut and of course you can get this home today for 24.99 because it's on your four individual split pays um uh, which is amazing being able to bring you that split and we're in its birthstone month aren't we as well yes of course of course we are, yes! Why? Oh, my word. <laughs> okay. This hasn't sold out yet. Uh, Neria said they've all got to go today. We're going to offer you, I can't believe I'm about to say this, a closeout deal on genuine golden, yellow, green diamonds. They have all got to go. Oh, gosh. Oh, dear me. What are you thinking, Neri? Oh, gosh. <laughs> 99 pounds 98 maybe i mean uh to be able to bring it oh gosh don't diamond prices have increased by on average 30%. Have a look at this email from uh, Wayne's diamond contact, Aman. Kind of refer to the attached proposal of diamond cube strands. Diamond prices have increased 30 to 40% in overall products. The suppliers offering the diamond uh, beads at all prices. Please advise, is that workable for us? Oh my gosh, Hello. this is... I've, and, and he hasn't told me what price he's going to. He hasn't told me. Brian, make a carry. Oh, my gosh. This is... I don't know. Oh, no. No, 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 no. What? <laughs> I don't want to hold this anymore. I don't want to be here. I want to go home. Six stones... No. Oh my gosh. Right, anyone who is watching right now, whatever you are doing, stop. Stop and look at the screen. We are at 89 pounds and 99 pence for genuine golden yellow multicolor diamonds faceted into a briolette cut. We are at 89 pounds and 99 pence. I can't believe this. Brian, Kerry, there are loads of you there. We're not done. I don't know how we can do this. We are not done on the price. How can we not be done? How can we not be done? I have absolutely no idea. There are people coming through left, right and centre. 19 seconds. The price is going to go down one final time. But this is it. This is the caveat. This is a closeout deal. And these have to go today. They have to sell out today. Your deal today, not 99.99, not 89.99, but yours today 
for $79.99. Oh my gosh, take them away, Christine Maker. Well done to you. It's absolutely We've had a 30 to 40% increase on diamond prices, and we are bringing these to you at prices which are unrecognizable to the price point that we bought this at. This is absolutely tremendous. Yours today for £79.99. Agnes looks like she's going to come through for another one. Well done. Maker and Kent is going to come through as well. This is so good. Bristol, Alison, well done to you, my lovely. Well done to Kerry in Dorset. This is absolutely tremendous. Well done. An opportunity to own something of such rarity. Lincolnshire's bought two. The Channel Islands is now through. This is absolutely amazing. It's 79.90. These have got to go today. Well done, everybody. This is unbelievable. This really is genuinely unbelievable. And the fact that you've got another diamond, one more diamond, uh, is incredible, <laughs> isn't it, Mark? Incredible. That's amazing. Fun. Oh, my word. Well done. Superb. Unbelievable. At $79.99. Well done, everybody. That that really is above and beyond. I can't believe that. Um, those gold and yellow diamonds are similar, a similar color to J-Lo's engagement ring. They're so beautiful. So right. They are gorgeous, aren't they? And, of course, yes, colored diamonds are the absolute order of the day for so many um, uh, uh, kind of uh, not just not just kind of um, celebrities, but for so many iconic pieces of jewellery. Shirley, well done. You've just come through. Agnes has come through to get another one. Well done to you. They're tremendous. They're about to sell out. I think we've still got one or two chances of the blue diamonds left. So if you want to add those onto your order, please do. Wow. So we bought you at the end of the last hour the most amazing deal on genuine natural ruby, didn't we? Now. A star buy on the most amazing strand of emerald. This is amazing. Don't go anywhere. So, end of the last hour, we bought you that incredible strand of ruby, didn't we? Do you remember that? Beautiful natural ruby, great big sizes, gorgeous quality, you know, unbelievable kind of vibrancy. I can't believe that we bought you ruby, we've just bought you diamonds, and here's emerald. <laughs> it's amazing, isn't it? On the 12 o'clock hour, we've got tanzanite as well, just to let you know. Yeah. I'm going to make you a promise. Every single one of you watching right now can afford this strand of emerald. Every single one of you. That's, that, that's, quite, uh, that's quite a statement, isn't it? It's quite a statement. That's quite a statement. 200 chances. Whoa, that's a big quantity. Okay, don't worry. We'll look after you. Don't worry. Oh, look at this. Oh, my gosh. Look at the, the recording on this is beautiful. Ah! Look at that, Mark. Beautiful, isn't it? Whoa. It's one of the finest strands I've seen. The colour is just beautiful, isn't it? Natural, natural emerald. What do you expect to see? Greens, hopefully, but I expect to see a load of um, host rock inclusions, lots of kind of, you know, you know and, and, and kind of sizes which are maybe a little bit smaller. Yeah, yeah. Oh my word, this strand is gigantic. And I tell you something, those colors, they are popping away. Oh, that is good. They are seriously good. Look at how emeraldy this strand of emerald is. Look at this. Now, 17 carats of genuine natural uh, Brazilian emerald, 50 pounds. Amazing, incredible. Yeah, Fiona, well done. You've got two. Rosalind, Jocelyn, well done to you, my lovelies. Gorgeous, 49.99. Brilliant, superb. <clears throat> do we have a price point today that is going to enable 200 people to get this well yeah kind of but i'll tell you something for nothing this strand is not going to go to 200 people it's going to go to maybe like 50 people because the amount of multi bidders coming through to get this is going to send the phone lines the web and the app into absolute meltdown leslie lancashire well unto you absolutely brilliant at 49.99 it's brilliant it's incredible does anybody remember 
how low we went for the how low we went for the ruby Now, with certain gemstones, you want an eye clean quality, like your topaz, for instance, yeah? But with other gemstones, like your natural ruby, like your natural emerald, inclusions, or as they're called in emeralds, jardins, they are celebrated. They are encouraged. It's what gives the gem its character. Color-wise, carat weight size. Did I just hear that right? Yeah, it's obscene, isn't it, Mark? You've got a minute. You've got a minute, okay? You've got a minute. No, you don't. You've got 45 seconds. We're going to do one drop. One drop. No messing around. It's next month's birthstone, isn't it? Say again. Next month's birthstone. It is? We've got this month and next month. We've had Spinel. That's August. We've had Ruby. Yes, July. July. You've done well today. We have, haven't we, with the old birthstones? Brian, Beatrice, Maker, Carol, Pauline, Maker, Lydia, Maker, Eileen, Maker, Leslie, Rosalind. You're all playing it really safe. You've all got it in your baskets. And I bet you're thinking, oh, you know what? I reckon they're going to match the price of that. They're going to they're going to match the price of that uh, of that Ruby, maybe. Yeah, because that was brilliant. Or maybe you're thinking, oh, 19.99, amazing. Are you thinking we're going to match the price of the Ruby? Uh. Yeah, yeah. Yeah? Think again. It's $9.99. $9.99. Oh my gosh. What? It's $9.99 for the most incredible strand of genuine natural emerald. Pauline, well done to you. Lancashire's got two. Lydia, well done to you. You've just got this in Pennsylvania. Bedfordshire, Eileen's bought three. Well done to you. And by the way, if anybody missed out for that strand of gorgeous ruby, oh my word, look at them together. Look at them together. They look amazing. I'll just alternate those on a strand. Yep. I think that's uh, a great idea. An emerald yeah, and ruby necklace. Uh, yeah. A necklace? A necklace. Yeah. Oh, that matches perfectly, doesn't it? Imagine being able to say, I'm just, yes, I'm making an emerald and ruby yeah, necklace yeah, today. Yeah. Yes, yes. Imagine being able to use this. So many jewellery makers out there never even consider they'll ever be able to use genuine gemstones, let alone ruby and emeralds. The ruby that we bought to you, by the way, was twelve ninety nine. <laughs> this emerald is $9.99. This is tremendous, isn't it? It's yours today. You can get both of these strands today for what? Under £25. That is unbelievable for two of the most prolific gemstones uh, in the entire world. David, you've got the right idea. You've just bought two. Brian's got two. Carol's got two. Well done to you. London's got two. Beatrice has got two. T uh, Teresa's got two. Well done to you. Carol in, Raw in uh, Yorkshire. Well done to you, my lovely. You've just taken two. Anybody who wants to get the ruby, you're going to have to be ever so quick because these are flying. Well done to everybody. That is amazing. That's, Catherine... That works out at, um, at six litres of petrol. Oh, don't. Or a couple of, of half-decent Easter eggs. Oh, don't. Don't talk about the price of fuel at the minute. It's just awful. I always whinge about fuel every show I'm on at the moment. Anyway. Energy bills, Mark? Mm. Yeah? My, my energy bill, so £191 <laughs> a month uh, is my current direct debit, which I think is really high. They've sent me an email. Oh, by the way, your uh, energy bill, your direct debit needs to go up to £364 a month. I'm like, what? Oh, my In God. what world is that actually? No. Do you know what? I'd rather, you know, I'd... Oh, my Lord. Oh, Adam, don't tell me that. Uh, right. One of the three pairs of earrings for mum's birthday is JM Emeralds. All of them, all of the gems are from you. Without JM, I wouldn't be able to do that. Miss Janet, you're so right. Okay, Without jewellery makers, so many people out there, so many of you out there wouldn't be able to make not just gemstone earrings, emerald earrings. Mm. Emerald earrings. Right, from the sublime to the ridiculous now, we're about to bring you another star by. This time, this time, we're bringing you a trio of jadeite for a price which is, well, it's stupid. <laughs> star by.
things are special. Oh, look at that. Gorgeous little showcase here of jadeite. Should we do this one first, shall we, yeah? This one first, yeah? Okay, brilliant. No, no. Guess what? Oh, yeah. It's a bundle. Oh, is it? Right. Now, I... Um, four, six, and eight mil rounds. Type A, Burmese jadeite, boom. Um... What do we know about bundles? And I'm, and I'm kind of regretting saying this. Whenever we do bundles, we always say, oh, bundles are great because bundles save you money. This is a jadeite bundle, okay? So there's, there is a limit to what we can do, obviously. Yeah, there's a limit to what we can do. What are we thinking? What are we thinking? Maybe about the price point of some of our kits that we've had this week. 200 quid, 149.99. I mean, amazing. Three full strands of your type A Burmese jade. Beautiful. Yeah? Okay, let's go to let's go to 200 pounds, shall we? Yeah? Okay, well done. London, you've got the right idea. Already come through. Well done. Okay, let's go there. Yep. 199.99. Brilliant. Amazing, gorgeous, go for it. Such a rarity, such an incredible quality, such a special bundle. And bundles are about saving money, aren't they? So, we, so we're definitely saving you time. So now you know that you don't have to watch, um, uh, you know, three separate shows and kind of, oh gosh, I've got the four mil. Let, let's hope I can get the six mil next time I watch. Let's hope I can get the eight mil the next time I watch. No, you can get them all today, all three today. That's saving you time, isn't it? Yeah, saving you a lot of time. Yeah? Are we saving money? Well, at 199.99, you know what? That, that is pretty, that is pretty good, isn't it? I mean, that's, yeah, it's brilliant. Yeah, brilliant. We can go lower. <laughs> Just a smidge. Yeah? Oh, gosh. Oh, Neary. How far has jadeite come in the, what, three years we've had this incredible stone? I mean, it is literally, to be able to bring you bundles of jadeite is, is, is almost unthinkable. But to bring them to you in this kind of quality, this isn't kind of your, your kind of jadeite, which is kind of devoid of any colour or any inclusions. This is so full of character, isn't it? Yeah? Amazing. How about if I was to say to you today that we're able to do these for less than 50 pounds a strand? Yeah, so we'd be able to go to 149.99. Okay, so we can go lower than that though. Yeah, I don't know how, but when we bundle things together, we can save you money. How about under 30 pounds a strand? $79.99. Just go for it. Go, 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 go. Absolutely amazing. You are looking here at about £26 a strand. Amazing. 26, 66, 66 a strand. Well done. $39.99 is your split payments. Well done to Maker in Lincolnshire. Well done to Debbie. Well done to Alison. Well done to Charmaine. Lots of people coming through. This is amazing. And this is offering you so much in one go, isn't it, Mark? You don't have to get the four mil, the six mil, the eight mil in separate opportunities. You know, you've got them all today, which is wonderful. And over the past few weeks, we've brought a lot of jadeite carvings to it. Yes. With the drill holes at the top. Yes. And a lot of our viewers have got those in their collections. And this, the, you've got everything you need for a mala. Absolutely. Bracelet, an earring set in one bundle. Definitely. As you're carving to. And it's so. interesting. It's something that Alison said the other day. You know, with your malas, don't necessarily just think about necklaces. Mala bracelets, right. half mala right. bracelets. Yeah. You know, you can use quite delicate size uh, gemstones. So you could do it with your formulas if you want to do. Brian, well done to you. Maker in Lincolnshire as well. Well done. At 79.99, we've literally got a dozen chances remaining there. Well done. Very, very, very limited in stock. Well done. Anybody else coming through to get these today? Massive, massive saving. 26.66 per strand of your Type A Burmese multicolor jade out. It's absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? Well done. Um, well done, everyone. Go, go, go. 
<laughs> Polly likes my nails. Thanks, darling. Cheers, love. Alan, well done to you. <laughs> you also know, well done, 79.99. Well done. Check out your baskets. Well done, Northamptonshire. Debbie. Uh, superb. Absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> okay, let's now do. <laughs> ah. Let's do. Oh, what was that, Ben? That was a. That was a. Oh. Okay, very quickly. Yeah, very quickly. So what, what were you just saying? So carved, jade mm. things with the drill hole and... Mm, yeah. Things like this? Mm-hmm. Look at that! On Thursday, I did a, um, a little demo showcase on the Lark's Head Knot and how to use it and the right way to put it on and the wrong way and... So if you look back on Thursday's show, you'll see how you attach pendants like this to your core. That's so beautiful. There are no words for this. Yeah, it, it, it's, it's a... Oh. The... What you have here is an opportunity which has been passed down through generation after generation after generation. The gemstone carvers who carved these stones will have been passed down the expertise by their forefathers and their forefathers and their forefathers and then their forefathers and possibly the forefathers before them may have been the people who carved the pieces from the Ming dynasty. I mean, that is amazing, okay? These are exceptional pieces they are pieces of art. Each one is different. Here's your price. Gorgeous. Here's your price. They are monumental. They are monumental. Here's your guide price. Oh. Guide price this is. This is not where we're going to be finishing today. Guide price at 499.99. Looks and like it, was in it looks like a stylized peony to me, looking at the flower, I think. Or a proteus, something like yeah. that. Yeah. It's gorgeous quality. With like a butterfly at the top, vines coming out through the, uh, the, 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 the bottom of the flower. Gorgeous. Another maker through. Lawn has come through. That's great. Well done, darling. Here's your price all the way down. Enjoy. Tremendous quality. I mean... Quite, yeah, do you know what? I, I couldn't even draw that in paper, let alone carve it into jade. 179.99, Susan in Norfolk. Well done, maker coming through. That's absolutely amazing. It is tremendous. And the pieces you are getting here, the carvings you are getting here are fine type A quality jadeite. Type A jadeite. Not commercial, not dyed, not polymer filled, not acid treated, type A jadeite. You have got to get this right. If you don't get it right, it, you are, you are, you are in danger of ruining one of the most valuable gems on the planet. The one in the recording is slightly different to this one. You can see the patinations are slightly different, but the carving will be slightly different as well. Superb. Well done. Alison, check out your basket, my darling. Um, it's tremendous, isn't it? After the break, talking about design, I am so looking forward to this. Um, myself and Neri missed out on this collection. I was devastated because I know how hard Mark has worked on this collection. If you haven't caught uh, the Spring Chestnut Close uh, um, uh, collection, you are in for a treat. This is coming up after the break. The most beautiful pieces inspired by Mark's incredible uh, garden. Don't go anywhere. It's going to be wonderful. We'll see you in a second. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. 
Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Hello, Jewelry Maker. This is Glenn Lair and I'm here to celebrate my 10th anniversary with Gemporia. That means I've been on the Gemporia channels for 10 years now, so this is a big occasion for me, for sure, hopefully for all of you. And of course on the Jewelry Maker, what's totally brand new that we haven't done other than one other time is where now you're able on Jewelry Maker to actually acquire one of my stones. In this particular collection, you're gonna see a quasar cut, Taurus ring or man in the moon, where you can buy the loose stone, get your own mounting and put it together as your very own piece of jewelry. That's never been done before except brand new here on Jewelry Maker. I'm so glad to be able to host. I will be live in the studio. Tune in live from 11 to 1. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, 7 days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Stay interactive with Jewelry Maker by texting the studio during our live hours of 8 till 5. Start your message with JM Studio and send it to 78070. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Hello everyone, it's Mark here. Join myself and presenter Carol this Sunday, the 10th of April, where in the 11 o'clock hour, I'm going to be bringing to air the final pieces of my 
incredible Chestnut Close collection. It was very popular at launch. We've got a few pieces left and we need to make way for summer. So join us on this Sunday, 11 o'clock hour, I'm going to be bringing to air the final Chestnut Close spring collection pieces. I want all of these. Every single one, Mark. That's very nice of you to say. They are beautiful pieces. I, uh, they are. It, uh, talk to us about this collection, Mark. So I. This is so special. I've been asked for again, probably the same length of time. I was asked to do um, gemstone setting to put a collection together, and I've always felt. A, um, I didn't have the know-how to put a collection together. Mm. Yeah. And B, I didn't know a subject matter to do a collection around. And then this was probably September, October last year. Um, I sat down with Caroline, um, by, who buys all our sterling silver and, and pearls and that sort of thing. And she said, come on, we want you to put a collection together. And, um, and strangely, it came into my head after all these years. I think it's at, we're at the moment, our garden, we've been working on it now for about 13 years. Mm. And it's got to the stage now where there's something in flower every month. Yes. We get visited by a different animal, insect, bird every oh. month. Um, it's how we want it now. And, and apart from doing, you know, planting and deadheading, all the big jobs are done now. So we're actually at the point now where we're actually sitting and enjoying the garden. You know, it's taken a long, long yes. time to get it where it is. So Caroline and I said, well, you've got something visiting the garden every month. Something's in flower every month. Do your collection around the garden. Oh, wonderful. So hence, Chestnut Collection was, Chestnut Close Collection was born. So we, we, wow. it basically it's going to be separated into four seasons. So this is spring. Uh, we're launching summer in May, and then three months later will be autumn and winter. Mm. And each of the three months in the season contain a bird, an insect, an animal, and a flower that's oh. in flower in the garden each specific month. And we've only been able to do that now because of the point we are at in the garden. So it's, it's just perfect. So we launched spring two weeks ago, and I'm absolutely thrilled it did so well. And as I said, because we've got summer collection approaching the next few weeks, we thought, have we got any of the spring collection left over for anyone who missed it, missed out on it? And yeah, we've got, the, so we've got the last few bits. These really, and these really are low quantities, very, very, very limited. I think what I love about, what I love about this collection is um, there's so much of you in yes. this collection, Mark. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you can just tell it's all been so I mean, Mark is a complete perfectionist and everything has been executed absolutely perfectly. It's all um, from the manufacturing quality to the quality of the gemstones to how they've been set. They are all so, they're all so wonderfully made and they're all so yeah. clearly thought out and planned. It's, um, it's gorgeous. Can you share with us some photographs of your okay. of your uh, garden? Because honestly, yeah. they are they uh, these are this I think is probably my favourite photograph. I I just love it, Mark. Yeah. So so this is oh this is wow in the height of summer with all my, I love my hanging baskets and um, yes I know so we're, we're on about eighteen at the moment, including the front and the back. Whoa, so there's a lot of work. So um so we fitted up a watering system now, which takes away some of <laughs> some of the work. Yes, yeah, it must be a nightmare. Because that. Because sometimes in the height of summer, we were in, in the evening, because we'd water for an hour in the morning. Mm. So we'd get up really early and do an hour in the morning and then two hours in the evening. Oh my gosh, wow. So it did take a lot of our time just watering. And then you've got all the, the, the deadheading and everything else it needs doing as well. And lawn mowing. I'm not allowed to touch the lawn. Yes. That's Andrew's. That's Andrew's. Yeah, he, he, so he did put his foot down with the lawn. So he, he <laughs> does all the lawns. But when, you know, in the height of summer, you're mowing the lawn two or three times a week. Absolutely. It's, so it's, it's, it's I'm not allowed to work. touch the lawn mower either. My husband's absolutely it's bizarre, isn't it? fastidious. Yeah, he, he's stripes. got like a roller thing. Yeah, he needs yeah. to have his stripes. Absolutely. I've seen yeah. him stand there with his lawnmower and literally going. <laughs> yeah. Oh, absolutely. Like that, yeah, and it's yeah, just yeah. oh my word. That's amazing. It uh, look. Oh yeah. gosh, and the colours, Mark. They're just they're just amazing. So this year, because it's the Queen's Jubilee, the whole mm. of the front garden is going to be red, white, and blue. Oh so my word! 
said. We're going very patriotic this year. Oh, so and absolutely. Now, this yeah. is uh, this is um, the front garden. Yeah. This you did relatively recently, didn't you? Got so, it kind of looking yeah. like this. So the box hedging went in. So it's individual plants. There's, there's about a thousand individual box plants from cuttings and things that, that, that we did. So, so when I moved in, which was 14, 15 years ago now, mm. it was just a lawn. There was nothing else. It was just plain lawn. So we've dug out all the beds. We've put in all the box hedging to sell. And the reason that we put in the box hedging, because we, we, we go to lots and lots of National Trust properties, mm. and they have lots of knock gardens. And Andrew yes. loved the idea of having some sort of knock garden. But also, because some of the plants get quite large, the box stops it from falling onto oh, the ground. Oh, the ground that's edition. brilliant. So, um, Putty cats. Is, oh. Ripley and Thomas. Love yeah. the look of that. So that's, that's the back garden, which we had done year before last. Yes. So, um, Oh my gosh, Mark! So Andrew does like his his topiary. So he again he so he does all the box and with his little shears and his little scissors and so it's, it's a, bit <laughs> a labour of love. Yeah. Oh wow! Look at that! It's so lush. It's it yeah. it's it, it's ordered, but without it being too oh, regimented. Yes, it's got beautiful. Yeah. You've got some lovely yeah. shapes, some gorgeous organic. A lot of roses. Roses yes. are our favourites. Can't have enough roses in the garden. Are those roses on the left hand on the side? Left. Yeah, that's a rose called Gertrude Jekyll, which Beautiful. is one of the most fragrant roses. You really? Just pass and you get a you know, rush of heady fragrance. It's got a gorgeous that. colour to it. Yeah, beautiful. Oh, look. There's lot, lots of roses and lavender beds and shrubs. Yes. And and, and of course, uh, the bees love the lavender, bees, don't they? The yes. Full of bees, and uh, at the yesterday it was full of bees and butterflies. Quite early for butterflies. Butterflies are out as well. Yes, I've been seeing some butterflies over the last um, over the last month. Actually, gorgeous. Yeah, it's lovely. Oh, Mark, how wonderful! And you must get so much joy out of seeing things visit your garden, mm. as you say. Yeah. Seeing animals visit your garden and enjoying your garden as much as you do. It, it's it's just it is absolutely beautiful. Have you ever entered into kind of open no. gardens? You should do. Well, we the, you know the little yellow book with the open gardens. You have to be able to have the viewer um, twenty minutes of walking. Right. To to be able to go on, and you can and so and obviously you can walk around our garden in five minutes, I expect. But, but do you oh. see the hedge on the right hand side? Yes. There? Well, we've got, that's an alleyway that goes down the side of the house and everyone that walks around the corner stops. They're just amazed. Oh. And, and we had, a, we had a, a, a chap yesterday came and took photos, came in the, cl in the close in a car and leant out of his car and took photos of the garden. Oh. Lots of people come in. We used to, we used to get the, the local lady, Bobby, the lady policeman, she'd mm. come in and sit on the lawn with her pat lunch and oh. <laughs> so it's just, just amazing. Oh, that's gorgeous. Yeah. So are the people getting lots of joy out of yeah. this as well? Yeah. I think that, um, and, and, and you know, you're very lucky you've got, you've got, you've got a really beautiful um, um, uh, garden at both sides of your property. But I think that um, um, I love driving past and um, there's some lovely apartments on the way back uh, to my house and seeing people's balconies oh, yes. and, you know, with little Sorry. hanging baskets and really yeah. in innovative ways of creating that little bit of green space mm. wherever you live, whether it's window boxes, whether it's, you know, just little pots on your on your balcony outside. It really is incredible. And and, and it's amazing the joy that things like that bring and, and since, since the whole covid you know the two year, the past two years gardens have been really important for people mm. and uh, little sanctuaries and I, I just i don't know why i could do it because obviously we make jewelry 24 hours a day pretty much and uh, and the garden is my me time and downtime and it just yeah. just being out in the na in nature is just just, just absolutely lovely. very lucky very lucky now we've got here um a selection of pieces these are really limited you want them you've got to get them they are all so collectible i love them yes. they all come in these um beautiful little white um hessian bags i love these um oh it's just got there's very much a theme here with this yes. gorgeous lavender color here um, Spring at Chestnut Close by Mark Smith. Oh, this must give you enormous mm. pride. I love it. I I'm, I'm really, really proud really. of you. And it's not even my collection. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm, so, I'm so proud of you um, for putting this together. Um, we've got various different pieces. We've got flowers. We've got um, uh, beautiful little insects. We've got, the, um, we've got butterfly as well. Which one are we going to start with, Neri? I've got... Which yes. one so, would you like to so start we, so with, So we've Mark? got March, April and May. Yes. So we'll do the flowers first. So Brilliant. So March is the tulip. Okay. We've got, we've got two. So this, this is citrine. Oh, it's been beautiful. 
Yeah. Whoa! Lovely, aren't they? Do you know what? So this has been beautiful. Yeah. I'm going to start off actually by showing you the back, um, just purely because you've got to see the amount of silver we've poured into this. Yeah. The temptation would be with something like this to hollow the back out, to hollow the, the, the leaves out from behind. But in actual fact, it's a solid piece. Would recommend it to all. I bought every piece last time. Can't wait for summer. Have made a list already, says Alison in Merseyside. Oh, that's just gorgeous. Um, that's just lovely. We've already got people phoning up. We haven't even got the graphics live yet. Um, um, that is a well-loved garden, says Fran. Yes, a lot of hard work. Uh, Mark, I could sit in your garden for hours and be at total peace. Yes, definitely. And that's it. It's that it's that bit of peace. Um, I'm going to turn this around and you can see the beautiful, oh, the uh, the exquisite. They're lovely. Yeah. So, um, oh. the, the, so the spring collection, they're all pendants. But in future collections, we've got rings and we've got earrings. Oh, fantastic. But, but so it's, it's all, all pendants. They're lovely, aren't they? Isn't this gorgeous? Tulip, by, by far and away, my absolute favourite flower. I love it. I do see it as a symbol of spring. I love the, the, the really elegant lines of a tulip. And, and it's been captured beautifully in this design mark. And there's quality of the citrine you have Beautiful. in this piece is um, I mean it's verging on Madeira citrine isn't it it really really is no, so in, in all, as well as the little bag you get a little, little yes card with descriptions or poems oh or, look so you've got here yeah. Here's the, uh, here's the back of the card uh, with a beautiful photograph of the back of the house uh, with the garden in here as well. Um, and here you go. Here's your little bit of information here on uh, the tulip, which... Um, the, oh, shall I read it? Yes. Shall yes, I read yes. it? Is that OK? Yes. Um, so it says here, the most known meaning of tulips is deep love, also known as the 11th wedding anniversary flower. If you're about to embark on new adventures, going through life changes or welcoming a new member to the family, the tulip is thought to be the perfect gift. How gorgeous. How beautiful. You're going to be getting the beautiful Hessian bag. You're going to be getting the gorgeous um, information card. Wonderful to be able to gift this to somebody with that little, with that little um, sentiment there so people know what it means, they know where it's coming from. And it is such a collectible um, collection this is it really really is I'm I know that there are so many people excited about the summer collection about autumn winter it's going to be a, a tremendously successful collection it already has been these are the last few chances available for your citrine tulip um, the deal we're about to offer you honestly this is this is unbelievable look at this 29.99 Unbelievably, it is not even remotely near your price. I have to say, for a beautiful ready-made pendant, and of course, if you want to kind of take it apart, you know, you know, pop it, you know, pop it into a design and kind of make it an integral part to another design, you absolutely can do. But you've we got to. Lots of, and when, on the launch, we had people multi-buying because they wanted to wear them as earrings. Absolutely, definitely, one hundred percent. It's exactly the kind of um, collection which you can which you can uh, create that look with. Not your price point, all the way down, the most exquisite collection, a true testament to the dedication and the love that Mark pours into not only his work here at Jewelry Maker, but also his incredible garden. And you can have a slice of it today, $17.99. I am amazed at that price. I really genuinely am. That is incredible, Mark. So, the, so the, we, we've drawn sketches, and so these, these are exclusive designs to us oh really so they come from sketches yeah. see this so, is incredible yeah. this isn't something which you've picked and said right i want that and uh, you know this is this is what you've been offered and someone else in another country has got exactly mm. the same design but maybe with a different gemstone this is something which has been drawn exclusively for this collection so what you are getting here is a world exclusive kathleen maker in staffordshire well done to you caroline maker in lincolnshire maker with six in the basket Another maker coming through as well. That's absolutely phenomenal. Well done. Uh, beautiful quality too. And yes, I think that is something which you cannot underestimate. It is the beautiful quality which you have here. The fact that we haven't... Um, 
we haven't carved out the silver behind uh, the design. We've, you know, we've kept it really beautiful and solid with that big gram weight, with that really gorgeous design, with that generous amount of sterling silver right the way through the design. Dorothy and Aberdeenshire, well unto you as well. Another maker with two in their baskets in Lincolnshire, well unto you. It's absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? Well done to everyone. Um, we have got um, another tulip coming your way with the most... <laughs> uh -huh. uh, yes. Um, and we've got a whole host of different animals as well, flora and fauna to bring you as well, which is just gorgeous. But well done, Catherine in North Yorkshire. Well done to you as well. Lots and lots of people there. We've got to make it with seven of these in their baskets. I'm looking at these thinking these would be wonderful Easter gifts. They would, actually. And wonderful yes. kind of yeah. um, gifts for people who maybe... Uh, don't have a garden or or they or they really mm. miss having a garden and um, um, i i love tulips and it's the flower which my husband always buys for me and it would be the perfect gift for me because you know tulips unfortunately they, they don't last forever no, do they and they're no. so beautiful um well done uh, more people coming through it's great to see well done uh let's do should we do the other yeah. tulip yes here we go so this other tulip here i'm trying to work out what gemstone that is is that Hessenite yeah, garnet? Yeah. Oh my word. Beautiful stuff. Oh, that colour. The stone is on fire. Could the tulips be worn as earrings or, or, or bracelet charms? Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, so so the, you just open the bale ever so slightly um, and then just pop on your shepherd's hook. And then you've, then you've got a bale in your stash if you wanted to as well. Yeah. Perfect. Absolutely. Absolutely, Hessenite garnet. What a gorgeous, mm. rich colour you're getting there. Isn't that just stunning? OK, let's get these prices straight in for you today. Well done. I just love, I love, I love the entire concept of this. I love the packaging. I love the little sentiment card. It's wonderful. And it's, it, it's going to be so meaningful for mm. people when they yeah, receive these as gifts, yeah. Mark. It's and gorgeous. And also, the one thing that, that the viewers are mentioning when we did the launch is that lots of these pieces are Christian names. Yes. So we, we had a lady whose mum was called Tulip. Oh, my and, word. And, and, and we've got Camellia, and we've got Iris, and we've got yes. Rose coming up. And so lots of people's names as well. So there's lots, yes. of, lots of different connotations as well. Absolutely. Yes, that's a wonderful, that's a wonderful thought. Um, uh, Julie's message in, I have the ladybird. It's absolutely stunning. You should be extremely proud of yourself, Mark. I have to say the ladybird is, is, is one of my favourite pieces. I love it. It's gorgeous. You're going to, it is coming up. seventeen ninety nine for your beautiful Hessenite garnet um, uh, sterling silver tulip. It's absolutely uh, beautiful. I mean, tulips are wonderful. They come in so many, a whole range of colours, don't they? They really yeah, do. It doesn't a colour a tulip, doesn't it? Even black. Yes. Yes, they do, don't they? They're absolutely stunning, aren't they? Where did the tulip originate from? I remember South America. It was South America, because I always you you always think, oh, it's you know it's a Dutch flower, but actually it's it's well, the first not, person to it? own a tulip in Europe was Marie Antoinette. That's it. Yeah. Yes, I remember that fact. And it was more you. expensive. You, you could swap a, a single tulip bulb for the equivalent of a bar of gold. Oh, my word. They, they were, yeah. Goodness me. Beautiful. And the tulips, are as, as a flower, do they come back every year? If you... Not every year. Mm. Um, it's, it's quite potluck, really. Really? But, but one thing is, if you, um, if you lift tulips, don't plant tulips in the same hole. Oh. Because they can cross-contaminate with virus and all sorts of things. Really? So okay. Just, just be careful. If, you're, if, you, so if you lift tulips, put daffodils in or crocus in or something like that. Don't, don't replace. Interesting. Yeah. Interesting. Um, this next piece is gorgeous. Um, we did do a um, a ring. Um, oh gosh, now it was it was years ago. I remember, and it was with chocolate diamonds. It was beautiful. Wow. It was a gorgeous rose um, uh, shaped diamond ring. And this piece very much reminds me of this. The layers that you are getting here in this gorgeous. Oh my gosh, that's solid. Mm. Whoa. <laughs> I'm going to show you the back again because look, this is, I was not expecting that. This is a solid piece of silver. Gosh, that's beautiful. We, we've not skimped with silver at all. You wait, you wait till you get to the, um, the iris next. Yes. <laughs> that's ridiculous. Okay, yeah. look at this incredible, incredible design. Oh my gosh, isn't that stunning? <gasps> oh, these are the most exciting. Exquisite garnets, Mark. 49 altogether. Whoa! Mm -hmm. Oh, that is beautiful. Hi, Mark. I have the lady, uh, the ladybug. My partner oh. bought it for my birthday. It's just oh. beautiful. I love it. You're amazing. Thank you, says Tracy. Thanks. Oh, there's a real, there's a real love for this collection. I think because 
We've always known you as someone who's a very passionate gardener. And for you to share that with us, Mark, is just is so generous of you and just so it's so this is so lovely. So tell us about this flower, Mark. Tell us about the so camellia. This is the camellia, which you, you generally find living wild in woodlands. Uh, right. around the country so you, when you go when you go to arboretums do you know batsford arboretum i love batsford uh, arboretum they, they have lots of camellias there mm. and um what on the i think on some of the um on the writing on the back there so yes it's really it's a really cute and and presenter eleanor um got a bit emotional it, about this it, because it is gorgeous yeah, because when when camellias are in bud mm. the outside the, um, the outside petals which are which are sort of a woody material they're the, supposed to be the male in the relationship and they won't open until the the, the the really serious frost or the cold have parted and then they open oh. and the female is in the inside and the male petals never drop off they're always there to protect oh how the female, wonderful even, even right to the very end and then right at the end the whole flower will drop off as well as the outside petals as well so it's wow. all to symbolize relationships oh how gorgeous and, and, uh, and closeness and no it's this lovely sentiment behind oh, it and again they come in sort of reds and yellows pinks white oh and how just romantic it, it, it says here um camellia camellia flowers are known for symbolizing the love between two people if you need to express devotion faithfulness mm. eternal oh this is wonderful eternal love i think the beautiful camellia is the perfect way to show a union between two individuals how Lovely. Just beautiful Lovely. um I, I i i see them um in this in this pink that's kind of the yes, the, the color yes. which i'm used to seeing them in they are the most vivid flowers absolutely beautiful price point on this honestly is absolutely incredible it's that the it, work that's involved putting all those individual stones in and they the are all way. gem set aren't they that's that's so impressive 34.99 in Incredible. 49. 49 stones. garnets here. Margaret yeah. uh, Dahlia, well done to you, my lovely. Well done to Maker. Well done. And it's just so lovely. Um, uh, Tom, uh, producer Tom keeps on kind of flashing up kind of images on, 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 on the screens of the, of, the, of, the, um, of the garden. Oh, look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? For example, you see, we've, we've got a Dahlia. Yes. You see, that's, yeah. coming up, that's coming up in a late, that, that's coming up in, in um, autumn. Oh, really? In, in the autumn range. So, so straight oh, away that's the just so lovely. Yeah. Oh, that's so nice. Yes, yeah, so we've got a dahlia from Newport yeah. with two in her basket. That's gorgeous. $34.99. Isn't that gorgeous? Beautiful. Oh, I just love all these photographs, Mark. And of course, there's so much preparation that goes into, there's so much preparation that goes into, um, uh, uh, the garden and of course there's so much preparation that's gone into this physical collection as well it's just so impressive it's got look at that oh my word even when the flowers aren't out there's always something to look at always. isn't there absolutely always because mm. I said there's, there's lots of green there's lots of structure but as I said yes. we've got to the point now where we've got we have something in flower every month gosh that is, is quite a task <laughs> there must be saw, um, you just saw a picture of a, a blue and yellow flower I'm going to have to describe it like that, the Irish. Ah, there we go. This is, this yes. Is, this is the next one. Um, I've just, I've spotted this. Oh, my word. <gasps> yeah. <laughs> this is a piece of art, Mark. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to show you the back again. Look. Look at this. You'll have to remind me of the gram weight, but it's, it's enormous. Look at this incredible piece. <gasps> Yeah, we grow veg. We grow veg. In the, we're lucky to have a greenhouse as well, so we do yes. tomatoes, cucumbers, peppers, and strawberries. Yes. But uh, it's a lot of because we're on the, we're on the allotment list. So oh, soon, are you? As soon as we get the allotment, which is just just down the road from our house. Yes. Then, um, we'll be able to do. We'll be able to go because we've got the garden just how we want it now. It's it's, mm. it's easy looking after. Mm. But, so yeah, veg will be the next. Oh, how wonderful! That's in Andrew's retirement plan. Yes, I can <laughs> imagine. A, oh, how yeah. wonderful! Yeah. The piece you are getting here is absolutely sublime. Um, uh, Neri, what's the gram weight on this? Oh, there we go. Four and a half grams of silver, Mark. That it's is very weighty, in, isn't it? Really weighty. That's incredible. But it, it, the, 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 it, you can tell a mile off. Uh, that you are going to be getting this beautiful iris shape. You can tell what flower it is. And the iris is such a gorgeous, such an exquisite flower. Uh, it says here, 
Uh, we all know that special person we look up to, the person that inspires us. The Dutch iris often associated with royalty and nobility is the perfect garden flower to adorn any garden, large or small, a symbol of purity, charm, and most importantly, compassion. Oh, oh. Yeah, they're, they're just lovely. Presenter Elle bought the iris. She loved this piece. I have to so, say, this is something yeah. which, which I have to say. I, I, I am so... I am so amazed at the quality of what we're offering you here because, of course, the, the, the sterling silver quality you are getting here, the polishing, the detail, the work, the time it's taken to get the silver looking like this is amazing. Caroline Maureen, maker, maker in Renfrewshire, well done to you. It's absolutely beautiful. The quality of the, uh, of the amethyst as well is yeah. simply incredible, isn't it? Well, the, most, the most common colour in the Dutch iris is the purple, hence why we've, we've got the photograph. Yes. And then we had to have amethyst. We had to have amethyst. Oh, wow, wow, wow. And this comes out in spring? Yeah, yeah. This, this will be out next month. Gosh, yeah, that's just, incredible. They're, they're just coming up out of the ground now. So they'll, they'll be in, in May. They'll be in flower. Gosh, you would have thought it would be more of a summer flower. It's got such a pop of colour. It's, it, it's I love, so I love iris because you get the Dutch iris in spring and then you get the big cottagey flag iris yes. as well. So there's, there's always iris in flower. Oh, yeah. gorgeous. I'm loving the detail. It's just so, it's been so well thought out. Um, right, we're oh. moving on now to the beautiful little creatures. Um, yeah. Are we going to do the butterfly? With baguette cut pieces of stone. Right, pieces. these oh. are... Mm. These mm. are in this is this is incredible. So one of the earliest butterflies that wow. we've got in the garden, which is the native painted lady, which you've got in the little picture on your, yes. on your card there. So this is to represent the, the painted lady. That is absolutely gorgeous. Butterflies are, are such incredible creatures, aren't they? They're so delicate, they're so beautiful. Um, and uh, when you get them uh, in your garden, I, I always feel very lucky whenever I, see, whenever I see butterflies like this. They are just such, they are, they are a wonder of nature, a symbol of change, a symbol of flight, a symbol of um, you know, uh, beauty. Um, they are quite incredible creatures, the, tra the transformation they go through as well. Uh, if you're about to let go of the old and expand into the next phase of your life, um, oh yes, I believe the butterfly provides us with great lessons reminding us not to take life too seriously as they flutter and dance around the garden. They do, don't they? Yeah. They dance, they're yeah. beautiful. The gemstones you're getting here, Hessonite garnet and citrines. Now, you've got the rounds and the baguette cuts here. The quality is unbelievable. I can... 99.99, tremendous. Every day of the week, there are lots and lots and lots of designs like this out there. You don't see too many of the floral designs that we've bought you. That, they're very specific to this collection. But a gem set butterflies are something which, yes, you can find elsewhere. You can see designs like this elsewhere. Um, not for... Not for the price point we're about to do today, though. This is absolutely amazing. The ultimate Easter gift, I think. It's gorgeous. Whoa, twenty-seven ninety-nine. That is a shockingly low price. I thought maybe fifty quid. I love this piece. It's incredible, Mark. And we've not just gone for a size and filled all. The, I mean, there's different shapes and sizes, and even the shape has different <laughs> sizes as well. We've got and have and have baguette cuts. And do you know what, Mark? You could have gone for round uh, round cut, yeah. uh, you know, and done a lovely cluster design. But you've gone for baguettes. You've gone for one of the most expensive cuts. I have this, and it's awesome, says Shirley. I wonder if there's a way, because um, I mm, I would want to take the bail off. I'd want to make that into a ring, Mark, I, or, or something along that. I, they are. Ab it is so beautiful. Or the centerpiece to a brooch. Maker in Neathport Toll, but very very popular this one. Margaret Maker in London. Susan Maureen's through. Well done to you. Ab Absolutely gorgeous. Um, the iris has my birthstone in, so just had to have it, says Margot. It's a stunning collection. I think you've got such uh, a lot of talent still to emerge, says Margot. Oh, yes. Most definitely. Most definitely. Isn't that just gorgeous? Well done, everybody. Lots and lots and lots of potential with these gorgeous pieces. And so, and so beautifully designed. 
a really brave design because you've got the round, brilliant cuts and you've yes. got the baguette cuts there. But my word, it works so well, doesn't it? You wait, you wait until next launch well, to see what we've done with the dragonfly. I'm so excited. Oh, I bet you are. Amazing. I bet you are. Amazing. Should we do oh, the ladybird? Oh, I love a ladybird. I love a ladybird. This is, this is one of the pieces that when we were promoting the show, it really caught my eye, this. It, it, is, it is gorgeous. It's such a beautiful uh, little creature. Perfect stone choice as well. Look no, at no, this. No. <laughs> 2.16 grams of silver, and you are going to be getting garnets in the body of this incredible uh, incredible critter and you've also got black spinel and white topaz mark this is Love a this triumph one. it's gorgeous one of my favorite combinations is i do a lot of seed beading in black red and white mm. so, and it's just the perfect for the lady but we were going to have the ladybird with the wings closed but Ooh. caroline thought it'd be really nice if we had the wings just about to take off yes so you could see the, the body as well and they're it, so, so they're, pleased with they're it. so clever aren't they and they look almost kind of prehistoric when their mm -hmm. wings are yes. opening they're, yeah. they're, it, it, it's so impressive if you catch sight of them to, just about to take off it's wonderful it says here the ladybird um is a wonderful friend to share your garden with reminding us that even with limited resources and simple actions one can make a huge difference to the world oh mark what beautiful sentiment Known as a positive omen of good luck, the ladybird reminds us to look after our friends and family, but not overlook ourselves. Gosh, that is something to genuinely live by. These are adorable, aren't they? There is such an adorable piece here. Uh, 29.99, Brenda, Gabrielle, Christine, Lorraine, Catherine, Margot, Maker. They are so, it's such a popular piece. And it's one of those little, um, uh, you know, even as a child, I remember being oh, yeah. absolutely, absolutely fascinated by yeah. ladybirds. They're just such lovely, joyous little animals. And for, the, for the gardener, I mean, they are so important in the garden. What do they, because, what do, they do? Well, they are do they the most, they're most carnivorous insect in your garden. No, really? Bar, bar none. So, that, so for, for black fly and green fly, and yes. all the tiny little aphids and things, they are, they are the perfect antidote for yeah so love to see the ladybirds oh that's fantastic they're lovely aren't they they yeah they are they are just gorgeous and i knew that they were kind of a gardener's yeah. a gardener's friend oh now right we have a beautiful a beautiful final piece um here which is um oh, mark this is mm. mark showed this to us earlier on and I was amazed at the design but mostly I was amazed at the size of the gem you are getting here this is larger than almost any stone uh, of well it's, it, it's larger than almost any um, any um, uh, incredible peridot I have ever bought you before it is an enormous seven by five millimeter peridot you are getting in the most beautiful chaffinch design it is unbelievable you're getting your beautiful peridot you're getting your stunning amethyst in here as well in the most gorgeous chaffinch, uh, chaffinch design um the chaffinch is such a beautiful little bird um Hope is a thing with feathers that perches in the soul and sings the tune without the words and never stops at all, says Emily, um, um, Emily Dickinson. How mm. wonderful. Just, it's just lovely. How gorgeous. As well as the connotations we, we had earlier with, with the flower and the names and things, all of the pieces in this, in this collection are all birthstones as well. So yes. again, isn't added. There's an added connotation to it as well. The silver work on this is, mm. is absolutely superb to the point where even on the back of this piece, Mark, it, it's just glorious. The amount yeah. of silver. We've been so generous with the amount of silver in these pieces, haven't it's we? huge. No, it's absolutely huge. And this is the only stone that we've, the only piece that we've got that actually has the hollow back because we wanted the light to come through to yes. the light of the there. And it works so well, Mark. It really genuinely does. It's just, it, and the swoops, the lines yeah, that yeah. you have created here are just, they are just stunning. I'm looking forward to 29.99 for you today. Well done, Catherine, Janice, Edna, Yvonne, Sally, Heather. I'm so excited as well about 
are the birds that we're going to be doing uh, hopefully uh, that you're going to be doing hopefully later in the year Mm -hmm. Are we, we going to see a robin? We are. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Because that's literally my ultimate, my ultimate bird. Go on, give us a clue about maybe some other birds. Maybe, maybe. More birds. We've got a blackbird. Oh, we've, have we've you? Got, we've got a blue tit. Oh. Uh, we've got, what else have we got coming up throughout the year? We've got red squirrel. We've oh. got hedgehog. We've got bats. We're doing a bat. Oh, as well. fantastic. <laughs> oh. Awesome. So it's going to be, and we, and we got, and we got things like holly and daffodil, a little daffodil snowdrop. We've got. Oh, how wonderful! But, but next, next, uh, the summer launch is going to be incredible. Yes, it sounds like it's going to be absolutely yeah, we've amazing. Got, we've, we've got a bumblebee. Yes. We've got a dragonfly. Oh, oh my word! How wonderful, Brilliant. Heather, Janice, well done, Yvonne, Gillian, Christine. Very, very popular. This one, it's just gorgeous. And it's so nice because a chaffinch is such a, I mean, it's such a, you see them quite often, don't you? It's, it, it, it's, it's a very familiar bird, isn't it? I don't know if any of you have done the big bird challenge, the RSPB oh, yeah, one. Yeah. Uh, it's, in, it, it's kind of every kind of January, February, isn't it? Which is, and, and, and you sit there with your piece of paper, with your little, you know, doing your little five bar gate, you know, which birds visit your garden within an hour period. And it's mm. quite incredible the amount Absolutely. of different um, yeah. birds you do yeah. get coming yeah. into your garden. I, lo I love the chaffinch as well because because the, the female is quite a drab, as most birds yes. are, aren't they? Yes, yes, well. unfortunately, but, yes. But the male has this amazing iridescent green breast. Mm. But the reason we've got the little purple amethyst near its bottom, it does have this tiny little patch of purple as well. So attention oh. to detail. Yes. Oh, it's gorgeous. Very, very popular. Margaret and Glasgow's come through. That's great to see Barbara in Sussex. Well done. Bit of a cue on the phone lines for this one. Do answer your call as soon as uh, um, do um, do hold the lines and, and we'll answer your call as soon as we can. So well done, everyone. If you can join us on our website or on our app, then please do. But all of these pieces come to you in these beautiful little Hessian bags. They're so collectible. Um, and Mark did say earlier on uh, that the next collection, the, um, that mm. the summer collection is going to be blue. a light blue. Light blue. Um, and, then, and then autumn is going to be an orangey red and then winter is going to be dark bottle green. Oh, gorgeous. Just imagine all of these little collections. Oh, it's just going to be so wonderful. Well done, everybody. Um, that's a good idea, actually, Neri. So, yeah. so Neri's saying, you know, with yeah. the beautiful little um, uh, chaffinch, could you use it as a uh, could you use it as a, a charm on a bracelet? You yes. absolutely could do, couldn't absolutely. you? Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, very, said, very easy. If you find easily. that the bale's too big, you can take the bale off and pop on a, a sterling silver jump ring if you wanted to, or to pop on your bracelets. Mm. Yeah. See, that's a love. Yeah, that's so nice, isn't it? So, so pretty. I can imagine these being sold in kind of National Trust properties yeah, and yeah. things like that. It's just, <laughs> can you? It, it's just a really lovely, a really lovely little, um, a really lovely collection, which is going to mean, which is just going to be, it's so easy and so sellable. Um, beautiful. And I just love the little sentiment cards as well. Just a really nice touch mark. It's gorgeous. Um, we've got some bracelets coming up, which... Uh -huh. um, if you did want to add these uh, gorgeous pieces on as charms, because what I like about the size of these pieces is they're not, um, they're, they're not overly big as in that is a pendant. Uh, you could quite easily use these as charms on bracelets, absolutely. couldn't That's you? Absolutely. And if you go on to, after the show, if you go onto the website, mm. I, think, I think if you go onto the med website main page, the Chestnut Close Collection um, page will come up. If you go on, if you click on that, there are actually some matching chains. Oh with um, extender chains with the gemstone. So oh, it, it, fantastic. If you wanted to have the chain alongside it, you could. Yes. Oh, like, wow, that I, would I, be I lovely. I like the idea of a bracelet. Yeah. Yes, gorgeous. Yes, do make sure that you add that onto your order. Um, you've got here uh, this beautiful uh, bracelet chain, which is, um, mm, it's not seven inches, though. It's seven to eight inches in length with the most beautiful... Yes, so seven to eight inches in length with the most beautiful white topaz bezel set. This is very, this is very, very much like some of those gorgeous bracelets that you see with diamonds set into them for, you know, X amount of money. I'm just going to put this, I'm going to put the beautiful chaffinch here because he's just so, he's so lovely. I'm so excited that you've got maybe a robin coming in. Yeah. Oh, that's going to be, see, look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Just the right size, isn't it? <laughs> Oh, look, gorgeous. $14.99, all set into sterling. So I'm just having a little giggle. Mark's, um, the pictures of Mark's cat. Who is that? That's Ripley. 
He's naughty, isn't he? He is very naughty. Mm. But he, he, whenever I go in the greenhouse, he's in, we made up a little bed for him as well. Oh, really? There's another, so pic nice there's another picture of the two of them, actually. If, if you've got that there, you'll see them. Yes. Yeah. It must be such a lovely warm place for it's them lovely, to go. Yeah. So, I'm oh, at, so I'm working at the bench and they sit underneath. We've got made two little Little crates. <laughs> oh, that's gorgeous. Yeah. Oh, they look so comfy in there. Have you put blankets in there for them as well? Yeah. Oh, Mark. <laughs> You're just I'll making a rub for your own back there, I'll love. Know. Yeah. And so whenever they know I'm going into the greenhouse and they yeah. follow me in and they sit underneath while I'm pottering on, on the workbench. Oh, that's so nice. Do you have a radio in there? Yeah. Yeah, nice. Yeah, it's that kind of, oh, yeah. yes. That's nice in there. Can you imagine if you get an allotment? Oh, that's going to be wonderful. That's going to be wonderful. We've got to change you at what? Both of them? Oh, yes, I remember. Oh, yes. Star by coming up now. Time for this gorgeous duo of chains. Absolutely amazing and wonderful with Mark's incredible collection. I have to say... Um, Collections like this, and and because I know a lot of, because it is obviously jewellery maker, and I know a lot of people are going to be getting these pieces and and uh, making them into their own pieces. Make you know, being inspired by Mark's collection. Maybe you want to take that further and add more peridot to the um, uh, to you know add the chaffinch to a peridot design or an amethyst design. Um, but if you add um, if you're adding these onto chains, um, these chains that you've got here are absolutely. They are ideal. Um, when you get chains like this, Mark, which oh, have got the most beautiful open kind of paperclip uh, links to them, they are, they are begging to be made into pieces which, which have got um, uh, 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 um, rosary linked pieces which you can weave Absolutely, onto them or yeah. maybe cord you can weave yeah. into them. Also, because you're getting two chains in, you can see that the links are slightly different. The links on this one here are slightly more um, elongated, slightly larger, and the ones here are slightly shorter. If you wanted to make a really large, long chain, oh, then you absolutely yeah. can do, just literally by connecting the two of them together. Yeah, um, let me just take that one off here as well. Uh, they're all uh, 925 sterling silver as well, which is, which is wonderful. And they've all oh. got that lovely diamond cut quality on them as well which is just so lovely a lot of gram weight here um as well what what did you say the gram weight was lovely 12.03 grams no. of silk that's absolutely incredible i love that that's look. huge it's so nice isn't yeah. it that look it's just it's just so relaxed but so fashionable so easy to wear wear them as bracelets as well they look wonderful yeah yeah Yep. as individual bracelets as well but there's so much you can do with these but I mean these kind of paper clip chains you can get um in so many different um in so many different um uh, uh stores whether it's Monica Veneda and we've got one there on uh, that that, that uh, Neary's found as well a hammered link necklace 110 pounds set into sterling silver absolutely gorgeous I mean I prefer ours if I'm being honest that one's got more of an overlink this is uh, the ones that we've got for you today are much more of that rectangular paperclip uh, kind of link. I'm not sure of the designer, but um, we watch a lot of dramas and things mm. on Netflix. Mm. And we've noticed recently that a lot of the ladies are wearing this paperclip chain with a padlock. And I'm not sure if that's a, a, mod, a Tiffany design or... That does sound Tiffany's, yeah. doesn't it? Yeah. It does sound it, like a everyone really... Everyone seems to be wearing them at the moment. Yes. I know that... I mean, Gucci do a lot of the designs with this gorgeous kind of um, toggle with this kind of T-bar on it. And of yeah. course, the benefit of that is if you wanted to, you can pull that through oh, even more and like kind a of, lariat. Yes, yeah. and kind of wear it more as a lariat design That's should you idea. want to do that. Um, there you go. Just give it a pull. Oh, hang on a minute. There you go. Just kind of wear it more, more of a lariat oh. design, and it will look absolutely, um, it will look absolutely gorgeous. It will look so relaxed and beautiful. Pandora. Here's the Pandora one, gorgeous. Uh, this is a, a gorgeous long line necklace there um, for 60 pounds, gorgeous. These are both 20 inches in length, so a combined nice. uh, length of 40 inches in total. If you want to wear them as one, absolutely perfect. I love the idea of wearing these as bracelets. And I think the fact that you've got that really lovely open link 
it just means that you've got so much potential to add on to it to really make it into a bespoke piece. Oh. I bought these uh, and I've had many compliments when wearing them. Yes, Carol, I can totally understand that, whether it's with a, a lovely T-shirt or a, or, a, or, a, or a dress or, you know, it's absolutely, it, it's, just, it's just a really lovely chain. Um, you're getting two of them. Or uh, both sterling silver, a combined gram weight of over 12 grams. Morgan Paulette, Janet, Susan, Sally, Nuala, well done to you. Oh, 34.99 for both. That's for both. That's absolutely wonderful, isn't it? It's just gorgeous. Well done, everybody. It's just, it's just gorgeous. Can I try these on as bracelets, maybe? I'd love to do that. Here we go. Or anklets, maybe. They're just, they're, lovely. they're kind of modern day classics, aren't they, Mark? They're, they're kind of... They're beautiful. And they'll sit nice and flush on the skin, won't they? Yeah. Yes, if you want them to, they absolutely will. But of course, with that diamond cut quality, they give you that little bit of luster as well, don't they? Well done. More people coming through. Sally, well done to you. Really make a feature of these gorgeous, um, of the toggles there and the... I mean, they're absolutely wonderful and so on trend, as we've, as we've already said, you know, whether it's... Uh, whether it's you're looking at Monica Veneda or Pandora or, you know, or, or, or Tiffany & Co. Um, but such a beautiful patination, such a wonderful quality and so on trend for $34.99. Christine Allison's got two in her basket. Well done to her. Margaret, well done to you as well. Really, really, really love these and just and just so much potential. So nice you're getting two of them. And actually, I really like the fact that you've got two slightly different chains there. Um, you've got, um, does the what, sorry? Does the toggle go through the large... Oh, gosh, now you're asking. I don't know. Let's have a quick look. It might do, it might not. If it doesn't, then don't... No, it doesn't. Uh, does it get... Mm, no. Ah, maybe. Oh, no, not quite. Not quite. There you go. Uh, but, yes, obviously, it'll go through the loop there. That's what it's meant for. Uh, but, yes, well done. <laughs> uh, Christine, well done to you as well. Gorgeous. Beautiful. Oh my word. <laughs> Another star by time for your black jade. Have you picked this strand up? Well, no, because I know what will happen. I'll go a bit funny. Just, just mm. feel the weight of that, Mark. That, it, that does feel heavier for the same size in other gemstones. Yeah, it? yeah. There is something about the weight of this stone. Do you know, the feel even, of this even stone. Even now, I know jadeite has. It's the only gemstone that does affect me. Really? It, it's not, I, all that. I, it just sends tingles down you. It really does. It's the only gemstone that's ever had any effect on me at all. That's yeah. That's amazing. It's got such oh. a wonderful feel I mean and it's and it's a and it's a known and it's a known thing that jade rollers for instance uh, which you literally roll on your face to reduce puffiness and to help drain your lymphatic um, uh, system and um, you can get them in uh, rose uh, quartz you can get them in various different gems but the ones that people really want are the jade ones and it's because jade is a really cold uh, gemstone takes ages to heat up um, and it's not like an amber which when you pick it up it's room temperature almost slightly warmer than room temperature sometimes um, this is the very first time that I can remember us bringing you type a gray jadeite that is so beautiful it's it's in incredible quality. Jadeite comes in loads of different colors. I've got a little slide with all the different kind of colors uh, of uh, jadeite because it really does come in all sorts of different colors, all sorts of different sizes and qualities. And it's, and it's always really exciting to see all these different colors of, of, this, um, of this amazing gemstone. However, when you get this shade of silvery grey, because that's what it is, this gorgeous silvery grey quality, 
It, it is neither, it's neither black, uh, but it's not, it's definitely not white, obviously, but it's kind of that midpoint and it's got that smokiness. It's got that texture. It's got that wonderful character. which gives it the most beautiful character, the most beautiful. I mean, it, it is a fascinating stone to look at, isn't it? Really is. These are enormous pieces. I don't think we've um, ever bought Jade to, to wear in these kind of sizes before. These are huge huge rounds that you are getting here today a total of 480 carats of taipei gray jadeite have a look at this have a look at the colors you're getting here so there's lots of different colors of jadeite some of these will will undoubtedly be dyed some of the purple ones especially but you can see you get your river jades which are yellows you've got your lovely kind of russet ones there as well which are kind of reds and oranges but you can see there's one solitary gray one on the left hand side of that color wheel and that's what we're looking at here on its own it's beautiful isn't it gorgeous mark it's the only stone to affect me mm. calming out of all of the gemstones i mean i play with gemstones every single day and we always talk about, you know, because, you know, everyone is into sort of the, the, the chakra and healing properties and things like that. But, um, but of all of the gemstones, the day we launched Jado in the, in, this, in the channel, I thought, oh, what's that? Yes. It makes me feel a bit odd. And it's the only stone, and, and all of the jadeites just, just, yeah, I can't explain it, can't explain and it. it. Is, and it is something which I would never... Like Mark, um, uh, I would never say is somebody who would go into crystal healing yeah. like uh, Susie, like guest designer Susie does or, or Debbie Kershaw or Gemma Crow. They're all really into it. You, I, I would say you're never, you know, it's not something you've ever really been into. But even for, even for you to yep. say yep. that this has an effect on you. And I, and I have to say, I'm not massively, I mean, I find it interesting. I'm more affected by colors. I love anything grey and silver. This for me is, 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 this is an interesting stone for me. I love the silver. I love the kind of almost wisps of kind of smoke that you get inside the gemstone. This is all completely natural. These are enormous. They're 14 mils, aren't they? 10 opportunities. Oh, yeah. Sorry, 12 mil rounds. 10 opportunities. This is such a special opportunity, isn't it? It's such a special proposition. Ten chances. Oh. Elaine in Monmouthshire, Sally in East Sussex, Maker in Staffordshire. Nearly just said the price. Sorry, that was Mark's reaction. It's crazy. Ten opportunities available. We've never done. We've never done no. um, Grey Jade Hype, ever. Ever. Well, not to my knowledge, anyway. Janice has got it in a basket. Maker, you've got it in your basket. Well done, Pat. You've got it in your basket. We've got enough in baskets for this to sell out. Ready? Steady? This is your deal. It's going to sell out. 199.99. There you go. Done. 199.99. Four individual split payments of 49.99. This is absolutely phenomenal. Yours today. Ten opportunities. Okay, down now to eight chances. Well done. A 199. 99, a tremendous strand of a very, very special gem. Teresa, well done to you. There's so many in baskets. Agnes in Lanarkshire, well done to you. Down into the last six chances available. Well done. What a tremendous deal for such a special stone. It's got something about it. It resonates on a certain level. There is, it's just, it's just beautiful. And whether you're affected by the supposed properties of the stone, or just by the colour, or yes, by the physical weight of the stone, or the fact that it's ice cold. That is undeniably uh, something special. The physical weight, the gorgeous kind of icy cold quality. So many in baskets, well done, 199.99. I would definitely be using my uh, split payments as well of 49.99. Yeah. Gorgeous, well done. It's just gorgeous. Get it home, experience it, use your 30 day money back guarantee. That is amazing. Down to the last three chances. I've got mo loads more in baskets than we've got chances available. Well done, everyone. Superb. 
Go on, have one last hold of it, Mark. Go on. It is just, it's just, I love it. It's absolutely beautiful. It's gorgeous. It, it, the sound of it as well, the, the clinking sound. sound. It's a really bizarre thing to say, but it, ma it makes me block out everything else that's going on. Really? Yeah, completely. Oh, I like yeah, that. Completely. Isn't that interesting? It's just bizarre. Oh, yeah. It's gorgeous. Two opportunities. Well done, Pat. You've just come through. Gorgeous. Um, well done. Two opportunities oh. left, whoever they go to. Well done. Okay. We've got genuine black jadeite now. Um, this is amazing. It's so wonderful. You have to have them together, don't you? Yes, I think you absolutely do. They're really going to play off each other beautifully. Look. Oh, my word. You can tell when you've got black jade out. You really can. It's got such a gorgeous, oh, such a gorgeousness to it. Different to the black agate we saw earlier on. Different to every other black gemstone, isn't it? It's got a, a certain stoniness to it. Oh, it's gorgeous. Again, that weight. That, that, I'm actually struggling to hold both of these in one hand. They, they, it is a really weighty stone. Have a look at this, black jade, Hugh. What, what we call black jade is generally speaking an extremely dark 95% toned green. Most black jade jewelry uh, found in the market is uh, nephrite. You are getting here a tremendous strand of black jade. It's absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? The color is so deep and dark. Totally black jade is very dark, 90% um, uh, plus, uh, um, uh, plus green. It's fair to say that the higher the to uh, tonal value, the closer the hue gets to 100% tone, i.e. pure black, the better wow. it is. Um, you are getting here what I can only describe. I mean, that is pure black. That is pure, pure black. It's nearly jet, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. you're absolutely right it is. It really is almost jet. It's gorgeous. 10 mil rounds of your Burmese black jadeite. We're at 499.99. No way near your price point today. Let's get that 30 second clock on the go, shall we? Come on, gang. Okay. This is going to go low. Absolutely tremendous. Here we go. Oh, there we go. We got the clock out. <laughs> okay. We have black Burmese jade out, how often? Not often enough in my, in my opinion. I love this stone, I love the way it feels. If you've never experienced it before, you've got to get it. It feels amazing. Enjoy your deal today. This is absolute, this is gonna completely fly. Hardly any available. Well done, people already got this in the baskets. Well done, yours today. This is way too low, way too low. 119 pounds, 99 pence. Four individual split payments of 29.99. Go, 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 well done. It is amazing. Such a special stone. Wow, that's beautiful, isn't it? Gorgeous. Well done. <laughs> there we go. Ben's going absolutely crazy at Nira saying, why have you done that price? I know it's completely bonkers, isn't it? Well done. What a tremendous deal. It's yours today. Type A black jadeite. Yours today. And it is the genuine. It, it's the real deal. It's completely natural as well. It hasn't been filled. Lots of black jadeite is dyed or it's been filled. This is completely and utterly natural. Well done to you. Coming up, we have got the most amazing masterclass hour. Gorgeous kits, Mark. We need to double check, don't we, and see what's, see what's won. But yeah. I think it's the tassel yeah. toppers at the minute, isn't I think it? so, yeah. Um, gorgeous, gorgeous kits and the most awesome masterclass demo. You're going to love it. You've asked for it. It's what you're going to see. Don't go anywhere. We'll see you in a sec. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Want to know what's going on in the next show? 
then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Hello, Jewelry Maker. This is Glenn Lair, and I'm here to celebrate my 10th anniversary with Gemporia. That means I've been on the Gemporia channels for 10 years now. So this is a big occasion for me, for sure, hopefully for all of you. And of course, on the Jewelry Maker, what's totally brand new that we haven't done other than one other time is where now you're able on Jewelry Maker to actually acquire one of my stones. In this particular collection, you're gonna see a quasar cut, Taurus ring or man in the moon, where you can buy the loose stone, get your own mounting and put it together as your very own piece of jewelry. That's never been done before except brand new here on Jewelry Maker. I'm so glad to be able to host. I will be live in the studio. Tune in live from 11 to one. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Stay interactive with Jewelry Maker by texting the studio during our live hours of eight till five. Start your message with JM Studio and send it to 78070. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. I love these kits. They're so, they're so gorgeous, Mark. They're great fun. They're really cute and something a bit different. And uh, no, they're ace. So literally, ace. it was less than a week ago and producer Neary said, do you know what we need more of? Bicones. We need more glass bicones. We have not done, bi we've had some bicones. I think it was on your mm. birthday show. They completely right. sold out. We had another set of bicones. They completely went. They are in such high demand. Not only are you getting bicones in these kits, but you are getting the most beautiful gemstone cabochons as well. They are gorgeous. We've got them in jade, rose quartz, tanzanite. Beautiful tanzanite. Oh, you're also going to be getting these gorgeous, and these are so big and significant, they're aren't they're they? Amazing. They're so substantial. So what I've done is I've made Woo! two with the key ring fobs. Yes. And then the other one I've made into a necklace just to show you how differently 
it works. And because you've got know. some, because you've got two cabochons, yes. I've used the tassel that you get in the kit. Mm. But I'm sure many of us have got tassels at home, or we make tassels, or we've got some sort of tassel. For sure. So you've got another cabochon, plus you've got all of the seed beads left as well. So it will go along. So you've got at least two, three oh. pieces of jewellery with each kit. So what we're going to do, Mark, if it's OK with you, we're going to do the demonstration first, and then mm. we're going to play all three of these kits. So, um, uh, right, demonstration-wise, this, so, this is so much fun. I well, I've it. just checked, and Tassel Topper has one. Oh, brilliant. OK, so I will, fantastic. I'll show the Tassel Topper, and then we'll bring the kits. And then if we have time, I'll show you the, the beginnings of how to do the cabochon, just oh, so you know how to fantastic. actually clasp the cabochon. And then, and then it's just experimentation. And uh, so, what, so we've got three pieces, and they're all different. Yes. So, just, so I'm just sort of showing you the, 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 the beginnings for then you to elaborate and add your, fantastic own, your own take. OK, it. let's go. So I'm going to use the green tassel. And I'm going, I'm going to put my stronger glasses on, actually. Isn't that awful? Oh, have you got different glasses now? Yeah, yeah. Oh, my. Well, I've just turned 50. I know you so, have, but... Yes. Oh. Never mind. Never mind. Can, am I in? I'll just bring that in. There you go. OK. So I'm going to show you... I'm going to use two colours of the CBs that you get. So obviously Lovely. I've mixed and matched with all of the, the kits. And I've got these amazing green bicones. So this is the beginnings of the tassel topper. Lovely. Okay, now, this is your basic peyote. And without um, taking the, the half an hour up with peyote, mm. I'll just talk you through how many, we, how many beads we add, and then I'm going to show you how to do the last two rows. Yeah. So all of the tassel toppers, they've got this binding around the top mm. holding it together. And the circumference around the outside uh, is 18 11 O's. OK, so I've threaded on 18 11s, tied a knot to make a loop. And it's easier to actually tie the loop around the tassel. Yes. You can, if you wanted to, make the ring and then feed it on. So it's e I think it's easier mm. and it won't stretch it out of shape. Mm -hmm. So I'm using the, uh, for this one, I'm using the silver um, wildfire. Lovely. And then for, uh, but... Um, Hobnob is the one that um, mm -hmm. I'm using for the, I keep saying that, H-O-B-N-0-4, which is the forest green. Yes. Is both, I think both of, those are, both of those are on the website. Yes, brilliant. So this, as I said, this is just your basic, straightforward peyote. So what I've done, I'm, I've got three rows of my green, and then I've got three rows of red, and then I'm just going to do three rows of green to finish off, okay? Have I pulled out? I haven't got the right colour. There we go. So I'll pop on the green. So you will need for the for the for all of the tassel toppers I've used, you will you will need you'll need nine rows. Okay. So for all of them. So I'm just going to do my last two rows. Just gonna take this round. Now what you can do is the the tassels actually come in little um acrylic sleeves so you can leave the tassel in the sleeve if you wanted to but um, I've taken mine mm. off so I'm just going to go all the way around lovely it's quite nice actually doing peyote onto a tube like this I did my paracord DVD before Christmas yes last year and there were lots of different ways of, of sea beading mm. over a tube or oh, paracord so nice. this, is, this is just a, a nice nice way so we're just going to go all the way around so obviously you only add 18 in your first row and then each row afterwards will be will be will be nine. Ah, green wildfires on screen now. Lovely. O B N 5 Hobnoss. I always remember that code. Yes, me too. <laughs> 795. Gorgeous. That's amazing. Still can't get over that price. Some of the prices you can see on on other websites. Are yes, amazing. crazy, aren't they, by comparison? Yeah. Well done. Okay, so we're just going to do the last one of this row. And then we're going to step up. So we're just going to go into that last one. And then we're going to step up. So at the moment, I'm on the row I've just been added to. So I'm going to go 45 degree angle, stepping up to get to the last row. And you'll find that nine rows completely cover the binding that's around the tassel. At the Brilliant. Top OK. All of them. So we'll just do the last row. And then I'll show you how we start doing the different. So I'm going to show you the, the basics of adding the bicones 
But as I said, once you get to that stage, you can then add your own tweaks and uh, that's you can such elaborate. a lovely that's such a lovely um, addition though you could almost just leave it like that couldn't you absolutely no absolutely gorgeous but as I said um, the, the whole binding is nine rows okay together of your, of your basic POT and if you wanted to you could go a bit lower but I think I just wanted to cover cover the binding mm -hmm. so we'll do a couple more Because, as I said, because you've got that tassel running through the centre as well, mm -hmm. it's, it's quite nice to actually peyote onto something rather than having a, an empty tube. So we've got a couple more. Mm -hmm. Gorgeous. And as I said, you get one, one tube in each kit. But what I've done is I've sort of mixed <coughs> and matched colours. Yes, nice. Look at that. So pretty. And then we've got the last one. Lovely. Up inside there. Okay, so there you've got your you've got your nine rows again, which fills the binding. Fantastic. Okay. So what I'm going to do next is I'm going to follow the direction that I've been going in with my peyote, but I'm going to I want to get into that middle row of the of the reds there. Mm. So I'm just going to. So I'm just going to go 45 degrees into the next row inside. And I'm going to go into, again, 45 degrees. And this is a way of changing rows without actually leaving any exposed thread. And then we're going to go again 45 degrees into the inside. Okay, so I've stepped up from the outside into that middle of the tassel. So now I'm in the middle row of the three reds on the inside. So this is where we can start adding our bicones. So all I'm going to do is we're going to be, so as you can see, we've got our three rows of our red, and I'm going to be concentrating on the middle one. So I'm exiting one of the red 11 O's. I'm going to pick up a bicone, and I'm going to jump into the next. Okay, so I'm not adding any seed beads at this point. I'm just adding my bicone. Lovely. There we go. So don't, don't be perturbed at how it's sitting at the moment because mm -hmm. we're going to, we'll, we'll, we'll remedy that on the next round. And I'm going to go, go into the next. Let's make sure that it's sitting flat. There we go. Lovely. And then we're going to go around again. So because we had 18 of our 11 O's, you will need nine of your bicones. So again, just give it a wobble. Oops. And bring it across. <coughs> Did you know what's happening on Thursday? Have I told you what's happening on Thursday? Well, you've told me. <laughs> Go on, Mark. I've got my very first, it's only an hour, but I've got my very first stint on Sewing Street. Yes. I'm doing, I'm doing, I'm doing the 12 till 1 hour, so the last hour of the show, uh -huh. on Thursday with lovely John Scott, and I'm going to be bringing <gasps> my love of cross-stitch to the world. It's going to be brilliant. Yeah, so, um, yeah, as I said, it's only an hour, it's going to be my trial hour, see how it goes, and then hopefully I'll have a few more little sessions. Oh, that'll be so much fun, Mark. Oh, that'll be so great. Sweet. Yeah, your cross stitch, your your love of cross stitch is quite incredible, isn't it? Yeah, love it. And then we'll do the last. Well done. We'll do the last one. And then what we're going to do, once you've added our last one, it's going to sew through. There we go. What we're going to do next is we're going to sew into the first bicone. Uh-huh. Okay, so we're sort of we're stepping up into that first. Here we go. Bicone, if you like. Okay, so if I just show you around the outside. Okay, so they're all around the outside. So next, what we're going to do is we're going to fill the gaps in between the bicones yes. with one eleven o. So I'm just going to pick up. So it doesn't matter what colour. I'm going to stay with the. I'm going to stay with the red. So what this does, it straightens out your bicones down the centre, and then also gives you the beads in place 
to do the next section of... Yeah. I'm just going to pull that all the way through. And obviously, if you added a, um, an 11 0 in between each bicone before at the previous round, you wouldn't be able to then sew into the red beads that were on your peyote section. Mm. You need to add the bicones first. So as I said, your bicones will sit at jaunty, funny angles when you pop them in the first time. Yeah. But then as soon as you add this row, they will all straighten themselves out. As you can see, look, they're all straightening themselves yeah. perfectly. Gorgeous. Okay, so we're going to go into the next. This looks quite nice actually popping a bead in between when the beads are there. Yes. It's quite nice. The, it's the little things. <laughs> no, I know what you mean though. It's, yes, it is. That's lovely. The colour of those bicones is amazing. So nice. Okay, so we've just got two more to do. Gorgeous. I'll just flip that round. There we go. And then into the next. And then what we're going to do is we're going to sew through the bicone uh -huh. that's directly following it. And I would definitely recommend, if you have the time, it's just going round, all the way round once, if you can. Okay. Just, just, just to strengthen it. And you need to exit through one of your little 11 O's. Okay. So that's the next row. So you can see now how, how straight and yes. they, they yes. become really straight and uh, all in a row. Lovely. It's perfect green against the red and green, isn't it? It is, isn't it? Yes. So the next step we do is we're going to be doing the frames for the bicones. Oh, lovely. So again, you're going to choose your colour. I'm going to stick with the red because it's quite easy to see against, mm -hmm. the, against the green. Is we're going to make some little picots. So we're going to pick up three 11s. Lovely. So one, two, three. We're going to go round the back 360 degrees, back into the 11-0 that we've just added. Right. And then we're going to go through the bicone and through <laughs> the next 11-0. Mark, what with jewellery making, cross stitch, I gardening, etc. Do you ever sit down and do nothing <laughs> at all? <laughs> no. You're an inspiration, says Rachel. Not very often. But I don't have children, which does help. I wouldn't be able to do any of this if I had children or things. But I tend to find that I do a lot of cross stitch during autumn and winter because of the dark because Yes, of the dark nights. okay, yes, it makes sense. Outside. And then, so obviously my, my cross stitch time will be depleting over the next few months because the gardening will take over. So. Yes. That. No, it's great. Busy, busy, busy. It's so nice. So I've, I've done a little pico in the 11 yes. I've sewn through the, through, through the next 11 You're going to pick up one, two, three. You're going to go round into the 11, into the bicone, into the 11. Okay, so I'm just going to make sure that's in position. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to carry on all the way around doing yes. these little picots. Mm -hmm. And then if, if you want to introduce the sh introduce the kits yeah and then i'll show you how we do the next stage okay that yeah. sound like a plan that's absolutely fine yes of course it is levy that's yeah. great yeah first kit these kits by the way oh, okay they're gorgeous. no idea what they're going to these prices <clears throat> oh by the way um my yuki um i'll just say this really quickly my yuki 60 bundle You just concentrate with what How you're doing. How did you get these? I've no idea. I've never seen so many six O's in my life. Look at that. Look at all haven't, of those. Haven't these been embargoed? Oh, uh, don't worry about that. There we go. Twenty-four ninety-nine. Eight tubes okay. of six O's. <gasps> I, had, I had nothing to do with this, by the way. Marion Maker, Pamela, Stella, Karen, Angela, Catherine. They're yours for twenty-four ninety-nine. Just get them. Go, 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 go. Well done. Oh. We've got the blue version as well. We're going to be bringing you those in a moment. But first, and don't worry, the demo has not finished. <laughs> um, <laughs> we have got here, mm, we've got here your first kit. Purple tassel. Gorgeous. The, the tassels are so beautiful. They're made from... A gorgeous kind of, um, it, it, it's the nylon cord, isn't it? They're just so... Yes, it's very, they're, very fine. It's lots so, of, of um, of yeah, they just move beautifully. They're just, oh, they're gorgeous. Um, so you've got your gorgeous purple tassel. You've got your 11 O's in uh, silver, line, uh, silver lined gold. There you go. Okie dokie. 
You've then got your beautiful bicones with this gorgeous um, amethyst color, amethyst AB color. Okay. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I love that. Look at how well that goes with that and with the gold. And then you get um, your two key ring uh, clips. These are really big. And actually, it was interesting. When first question I asked Neri on, um, on Friday when we were talking about these kits is, what are the clips like? Um, you know, are they proper key ring clips? They are absolutely awesome. They're so, so, so striking. They're base metals. They're really nice and strong, gorgeous. And then you get tanzanite, rose cut cabochons. These, yeah, they are incredible. I know, amazing. The quality of these, Mark, they They're are amazing. stunning. They're just, they're just absolutely beautiful. If we get time, Mark's going to kind yeah. of talk through how to yeah. bezel set uh, these incredible cabs. They are wonderful. And they are rose, they are proper rose cut because they've got flat bottoms on them. They are beautiful. 39.99 is where we should be. That is absolutely nowhere near where we're going to go today, by the way. Yeah, all the way down. Here we go for your two tanzanite rose cut cabs, for your 11 O's, your tassel, your two um, key ring clips, and of course your amethyst AB colored bicones, 24.99 for the whole kit. How amazing is that? It's brilliant, isn't it? Well done, gorgeous. So nice to see a kit with so many wonderful kind of different elements in, and you've done such a, you've done such a, a phenomenal job with these, Mark. I just love them, and they're so much fun. No, they're really, they're as I said, they're they're, they're amazing. As I said, you've got you've got two cabochons. Yeah. So you can make two of everything, and as I said, if you have tassels at home, you don't have to have a tassel. You can just have them as a, as a charm or something as well. I suppose would there be a, would there be a way you could see bead around both cabs and do them kind of almost back to back? Well, yeah, yeah. So have I kind of almost that. a reversible yeah. piece. Absolutely. That would be. Yeah, An interesting really take. Catherine's yeah. got two. Gordon, Margaret, Hilda, Susan, Maker, Dawn, Donna, Maker, Maureen, Leslie, Heather, well done to you. Um, we're not done. Nope, we're not done. Yep, 100 chances. We want them all to go today. So we're going to be doing something a bit special with the price point. This is, um, what I love about these kits is it's something a bit different. These are seriously fun. You've got lots of gorgeous elements. And of course, you make one of these tassels, you will have so much left over. Uh, and I think that's what Mark has done and, and what Mark's explained so well is that you have the opportunity to really build up your stash with these kits as well and take these designs as far as you want to take them. Maker and Kamath and Shield, well done to you. Here we go. Let's just, there, yeah, well done. 19.99, under 20 pounds for everything you're going to be getting here today. Well done. Susan's got two. Catherine's got two. Well done to you, Angela. Um, uh, well done to Sheila in Cambridge. Well done to Pauline in Cambridgeshire. Well done. That's brilliant, isn't it? 19.99. Um, and the Tanzanite rose cut cabs on their own are worth, you know, Absolutely. much, much, much more than they're, that, aren't they? That's an amazing price. They're that's gorgeous. Amazing. Could you pass me the purple tassel um, piece? This piece? The, yes, of course, spray. lovely. So you what, are. If I show you, put my specs on. Mm. So what I've got, so this is the, this is the front yes. of the, of the um, tassel, oh, that's or the, so the mandala, nice. okay? Uh-huh. And then the back is actually separate from the front. Oh gosh, I, it is! If I just separate that. Yeah. Okay. So there's the so there's the the back. That's okay. lovely, so, Mark. So if we have time, I'll show you how we actually cage the um the bike the um cabochon. Yes, that would be then, lovely um, to see. How to do the inside and outside? But what I did with the tassel, you get that very long string. Yes. So it wouldn't have actually worked with this. So what I've done is I've is I've cut it in half and then yeah. knotted it with a bit of jewellery glue in the back there. Uh -huh. And then what you do is you, you just close up the two, the back and the front, and then you'd have your, yeah. you'd have your um, tassel topper. Yeah, gorgeous. So that that would be so nice cool. to see. Okay, yeah. I haven't seen yeah. a cabochon set like that before. That so would be easy. interesting. Really? Yeah. What should we do? Should we do the other two yeah. kits very quickly and then, and, then you can, and then we can literally just give you, give yeah. you yeah. Um, kind of yeah. a whole, whole more chunk of, uh, another chunk gone. of time. Um, so, yeah, that's the thing. Oh. The pink, the 6 O's have, have pretty much sold out. We've got them in blues. Yeah, come on, let's do these blues very, very quickly. Oh, my word, 20 I chances really don't available. I how you did this. I've never seen that many. I've, I've never seen this many 6 O's. I bought, like, single tubes of 6 O's before. Never bundles like this. This is ridiculous. Margaret Maker, Dawn, Karen, Carol, Angela, <laughs> Catherine, 24 99 Just go. Go, 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 go. Well done. 
Yeah, yeah these are like properly embargoed. We're not meant yeah. to have these at all. Yeah, amazing. Well done. Six O's are the scarcest um, sea beads that we have here on, on Joy Maker, aren't they? Yeah. They're absolutely flying. They've, yeah, they've sold out. Well done. Green kit. Mm. Oh, gosh. Green kit. Tassel. I'll do, we'll do these. We'll race through these. Gorgeous minty green tassel. Gorgeous um, silver-lined green seed beads. Gosh, they're really nice, aren't they? Bicones. Now, what are these bicones described as colour-wise? These are described as... Uh, they're just described as uh, green AB. There you go. They're gorgeous, aren't they? Beautiful colours. Absolutely gorgeous colours that you're going to be getting there. Love all these shades of uh, different shades of greens together. They work together beautifully. Okay. Uh, you've then wow. got... Oh, look how popular oh, this kit is. I made a mistake with these, didn't I? When I came in this morning, I said, oh, we've got these, these diopside cabochons, but they're not. No, Mark. They're not diopside. I've these... These are jade. Oh, my gosh. Incredible. Honestly, I took them out a moment ago. They are, they're, a, they're, they're ridiculous. The colour. <gasps> gosh. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Look at that. Okay. Here's your price. Go, 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 go. Come on, Neary. <gasps> no, 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 no. Don't do that. Oh, oh, go on. Stuff it. Yeah, do it. Yes. Matchy, matchy, match, match. Oh. Here we go. Loads of people there. Jade, Jade kits. I know, I know. It's crazy. That colour is extraordinary. That's like imperial jade, nephrite beautiful, gorgeous. And the setting you've made for this is just so, it's so beautiful. It's just gorgeous. Look at that, Mark. It's just gorgeous. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't that gorgeous? I love it, love it, love it. Well done, everybody. £19.99. Well done. Super duper dupe dupe. Gorgeous. And even these earrings, Mark, they're, they're, they're so delicate. They're so sweet. Well, I had to. Um, they? I, the, these are, I had to. There are two or four on those two, isn't there? Uh, I had two left yeah. in the kit. Yeah. And I had, think I had three of each on the other kit. Oh. So I just. Uh, Pop them from feed booths. I mean, just beautiful little earrings matching. Oh, absolutely beautiful, yeah. Mark. So different. Love and hugs to you all, says Jean in Flincher. Isn't that lovely? Gorgeous. Well done. Oh. Mark, you can say this. I think you should. As oh, a, gosh. As a thank you to everyone for, for um, joining us today. Okay. He's going to get into trouble about the six O's, or he may as well get in trouble for something Oh, Mark, else. he's going to get into trouble about everything today. He's going to get in trouble about the deal of the day. He's going to get in trouble over the nine o'clock kit. He's going to get in trouble over uh, the seed bead bundle. He's going to get in trouble for everything. So he may as well, in for a penny and for a pound, he may as well take the price points down, because you know what? It's not a Saturday, it's a Sunday, love. It's Sunday today, lovey. <laughs> lost a day. He's lost, he, he, he doesn't even know what day of the week it is. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Oh, gosh, it's a jade kit for fourteen ninety nine. No! Okay, there you are. Go, go, go. Yeah. Oh, my Lord. Okay, Mark, go on, love. I will. Carry on with go your on. demo. Oh, gosh, no. Ah! Okay, so I've made my little picots all the way around, okay? So what you would do then is you would just fold them into the bottom of your design and then what you need to do is you'd be exiting through the 11 o yeah. and you want to step up to the outside of that pico so you're going to just take your needle follow all the way around so you, you're in now exiting through the top you will change direction uh -huh. just to warn you now can you see we've got an exterior point an exterior point all the way around in between the picos okay can you see that little space in between so what we're going to do now is we're going to fill the space. So I'm going to go back. I'm going to choose change back to green again. So I'm going to pick up two of my green 11s. And all I'm going to do is I'm just going to sew into the next, into the next. And what does that pull? Not only it pulls it tight, but it also brings your beading down as well. So I'm just going to take two green, pull it through. This is really nice if you have um, Christmas decorations as well with tassels. You can just add beadwork to your Christmas tassels. Yes! I'm just going to pull all the way down. Oh my gosh. So one and two. 
And again, so I think probably the peyote is probably going to be the most difficult part of this. Mm. But peyote is very simple, if that makes sense. Yes, yes. So, um, so I all said all, all. all of the three tassel toppers, they're all the basic peyote. Mm. They're all added the bicones in exactly the same way, but it's what you do after you've got your bicones added. So that's all about experimenting. And, and as I said, you've got so many beads to play around with inside in the, in the tubes there that you can just have a, have a play. Okay, so, pull. so as you can see, when I'm pulling down, it's, it's forming the interior circle inside the yeah. bicone there. So <laughs> continue around. So again, going to go through the next one. And then we'll do another one. Like so. Okay, so that's the bottom done. So you can see now we've got all the way around, we've got that little second circle. Yes. And then also we've got the, the little, um, the picos and it's pulled down. It's adorable. So what we've got to do next is find out where we are. And we need to, so I'm just going to continue through the first two green that I added and the first red 11 which is the exterior of the mm. Pico. Like so. And then I'm going to do my, um, going around the Pico again, so I'm back into the middle. So do one bead at a time. And then I'm going to exit through the 11 o that in the middle of the bicones that we've already added. Okay, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to flip it round 180 degrees and mm. I'm going to repeat everything I've done. So oh, okay. I'm exiting the 11 o so, so we're going to do these little picots again. So I'm going to go round the outside into the red 11. I do this like so. So I've got, again, I've got that little group of picots going to go through the bicone. So through the bicone, through the 11 o pulling it nice and tight. So then you have your second row of picots. So what you'll do, you'll do this all the way around and then you'll just repeat the double row of green all the way around. Uh -huh. And then you simply then tie off, cut away your threads, and there you have your completed tassel topper. So as I said, that's that's the um, the, 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 the initial one. Yes. So once you've got this point, you can then start doing more picots to go tight to the tassel at the bottom. You can add another row of picots to go tight at the top. You can incorporate 15s <laughs> if you wanted to. It's never ending. You know, but, but what I wanted to show you was the initial peyote of yes. which you'll need nine rows okay that's really important because that covers the binding yes then do exactly what i've done with the row of bicones and then you can start then elaborating and adding seed beads and patterns etc gorgeous that as well isn't okay. that lovely so i think we've got one more kit left have we that's it we've got one more kit anything else you want to show so i think i'll if it's all right with um tom to show the um cabochon Absolutely, that right? that'd be lovely I'll do that to afterwards. see. Well, I'll get that yes. set up. Okay, brilliant. Get that ready. How lovely. A couple Thank of demos you, here. This is really nice. Um, right, final kit. Um, yeah, that last kit, by the way, very, very, very limited. This kit here, love these 11 O seed beads. It's a raspberry, silver line dyed gorgeous, raspberry colour. It? It's a yeah. gorgeous colour. Um, you've got here tassel madness. Yes, of course. <laughs> you've got your gorgeous, um, you've got your gorgeous pink tassel. Then you've got this gorgeous rose uh, coloured AB um, bicone collection. Again, really love. I just love how the seed beads and the bicones fit together so well to the point where I'd find it almost impossible to stop creating this design. You yeah, just yeah. make it bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. Um, but um, uh, you then get your oh, there we go. Yes, your um, your key charm um, uh, uh, toppers there. But then you uh, uh, sorry. Um, um, clasps there but then you get rose quartz rose cut cabs these are really really lovely love this color oh it's such lovely quality rose quartz look at these aren't they beautiful 
beautiful. That rose cut quality is just so, oh, it just adds such a lovely, no, <laughs> Neri, oh my word. Just adds such a lovely quality to your rose quartz. Such a powerful uh, gemstone. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Here we go. I know these deals are ridiculous today. Margaret, Catherine, Maker, Susan's got two. Pauline, Dorothy, Kimmy, Hilda, Maker, Heather. Yep, they, there they all are. Fourteen ninety-nine. I can imagine these these cabochons being more than fourteen ninety-nine elsewhere. You know, they're they're absolutely gorgeous and they're rose cut. Don't you think that piece that Mark's made there? Doesn't that? I mean, that's English country garden, isn't it? It's so sweet, Mark. Look at it. it it's just gorgeous. It's a delicate pink. Mix it with a a kind of like a darker, more more um, vibrant pink. And then, of course, you've mixed in the seed beads from one of Absolutely. the other kits. So nice yeah, how yeah. you've used all these kits together. Well, they all together. work so beautifully. So I've used two colours in each of the three kits, and they mm. all work beautifully together. Yeah. You've got the red and the yellow, the green and the yellow, the green yes. and the red. No, they're lovely. lovely. So nice. So nice. And I think this one here has got such a lovely vibrancy. And again, you've got that wonderful yeah. setting for the cabbage in there as well. Um, right. OK. So setting this rose cut cabochon this is this is amazing i love i love how this has been done it's so different and it, what and also this this simple technique which i'm going to show you lends yeah. itself to every single cabochon you could possibly oh ever wow imagine. all you need to do is alter the, the the initial circle of beads to start okay. okay so what we've got here is now again i've measured this perfectly for you as well for yes, the, for the, for the you, cabochon so so i'm using the forest green fire line with a size 12 needle and on my piece of thread which to do a full cabochon and all the flowers and the petals you'll probably need about four feet it's 120 centimeters of thread so on your needle you're going to put eight groups of two bead of one color one of another okay so I've got two red yellow two red yellow and I've done that eight times okay tie in a circle with a couple of knots and I've cut away I've cut away my my um, tail. Uh -huh. So what you need to do is you need to sew away from the knot, first of all, and exit one of the single beads. So in this case, it's the yellow. So I'm exiting the bead and I'm going to pick up the following beads. And what we want to do, we want to make petals. So I'm picking up five 11 O's. I'm picking up two of the red and a yellow, two red and You've got your five beads, so two red, yellow, two red. And what we're going to do is we're just going to jump the two red that's on our little circle of beads into the next yellow. Okay. What, and what will happen is you'll have a group of five, so it makes a little triangle, a little petal. Mm -hmm. And then we do the same again. So we pick up two of our red, one of our yellow, two of our red, and to jump the two reds into the next yellow. Okay. And because we've got 16 groups of beads around the outside, we will have eight petals. Okay, so we're going to do this all the way around, and it will look like this, if I bring this over. So, okay, so we have our eight-sided flower. Oh, that's really pretty. What a lovely little component. Then what we're going to do is we're going to, what again, what's called a step up. So we're going to... Find out which our last petal was, which was this one. Yeah. And then what we're going to do is we're going to step up. So we need to get to the outside edge. So I'm trying to see which direction I've gone in. I'm going to go that way. So we're going to go up through the two red and the yellow to get up to the exit point. Okay. And at this point, you're just going to double check that your capuchin fits in nice and neatly at the top lovely and then what we're going to do we've got the little could you pass me the um let's have the, yes, the tantalite one's fine but the um finished tassel yes of course oh, that's Perfect. beautiful I'll, I'll pop it along Gorgeous. alongside that's the right way there we go <laughs> okay so what we're going to do next is we're going to fill the gaps in between with one bead right so let's go for let's let's go for I'm going to go for the red again. You're making like a seed bead sandwich almost. Yeah, sort of. <laughs> no, not at all. Okay. So again, we're going to fill the gaps all the way around. Oh, 
Sauri says, um, I've been following your journey with JM since day one, Mark. Superb demos as always. Good luck on oh. Thursday. First of many, I'm sure. How sweet. Bless you. Thank you. Isn't I'm really looking gorgeous? forward to it. I'm really looking forward to it. I'm going to tune in. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be gorgeous. Okay, so we've got one, 11, all the way around. And as I said, what you would do if you, you choose any cabochon, any, as I said, any cabochon size, just make a circle of beads, but you just need to make sure that it's slightly uh, smaller than the uh, outside point of your cabochon. So it's basically going to sit under the cabochon rather than the outside. Uh -huh. And then we're going to pick up, oops, our last bead like so. Okay, and then what we're going to do, once we've, once we've got this, and you will have, have I got the bead in there? Yes, is we're just going to pop in our index finger in the center and just, and just pull up to make this little cup. Nice. And then we're going to drop our cabochon. There he goes. Inside. Row side down or, oh flat no, side flat down, side flat down. Flat side down, yeah. And then we're just going to push down on that and we're going to pull up nice and tight. Okay, and then what can you see? It's now caught the cabochon. Yes. And then we're just going to go all the way around. Very good. Strengthening and tightening our cabochon. Mm -hmm. So keep, keep your thumb and your finger all the way around and you're just going to pull away from you. So you're sort of pulling, a, you're going round and pulling away from you. Okay. And then... Okay, we're going to go all the way around. All the way around. Pull nice and tight. All the way around. And that's nice caught nice and tight inside. If you find that you've got a bit of thread showing here, you might want to pop in two beads, but I think one okay. is, just keeps everything tight. And we're going to be covering with the next section Anyway, okay, so just going to pull that all the way around. Right. And then what we're going to do is we're going to basically we want to sew down. Again, you're going to follow the beads. Yeah. So as not to expose any of the thread. Let me just expose some of these. We're going to go all the way down to get to the base again at the bottom. And we're going to go through the yellow, like so. And we're going to come up through the yellow. So this is why it's better to have two colours, just so you can see. Definitely, can you imagine doing yeah. it in one colour? So much counting. So what you would do then is, do you remember these two little, the, the little petals we made around the outside? Yes, yes. So you're going to, this time you're only going to use one red, one yellow, one red, and yeah. you're going to jump into the next yellow and you're going to repeat that all the way around. So you have these little triangles again. And then once you get all the way around, you'll step up into the 11. Yes. And then you'll fill the gaps with your bicones. If I show you the back here. So this is the back. Okay, so, so pretty. then you add your row of bicones. So once you've added your row of bicones, then you can start elaborating with your petals yes. around the outside. And then the, probably the most difficult bit is you need to then wiggle with your needle into the inside mm. and then back up through to the front and then again you can then so the, oh, can you see I've okay. made I've made little picos on the front here right. which we did in the other demo and then that leaves then a space then for your bicones and then you can elaborate with your exterior petals and I, I stopped at this point but there's space to pop another bicone in the gap and then do mm. another layer and do another layer and so uh, again quickly what I've done because you get a long string with your tassel yeah is I cut it in half, brought each side up through to the top and then tied a double knot. Oh, I've okay. then cut off with a bit of jewellery glue just to keep it tight. Yes. And then once you've got your two, you've got your little sandwich, all the gubbins will be hidden inside anyway. You just need to make sure where you position the base of your tassel so it's sitting symmetrically at the bottom there. But that, that as I said, this, this um, cabochon wrapping you can do that with any size cabochon. Mm. You just need to obviously add more seed beads to start. If it's quite a deep cabochon, yes. instead of doing your two, one, two, as we've got on the side here, you might need to do three, one, three 
because you need to come up higher up to the top okay. of the position there. But then, when, then you just bring all your, your sort of petals together at the top and then that will clamp and keep your capuchin That's nicely That's ingenious. So it's really simple. Um, as I said, you can, you, can, yes. you, can, you can use that technique with any size capuchin. Just have an experiment with a number of beads to start with. It almost looks like circle. a Tudor rose from the top yes, there. It's yeah, beautiful. Yeah. And it's an ingenious way of setting of setting it. It's it's um it really is, Mark. Thank you so much. Pleasure. Pleasure. Gosh, you've definitely got your got your <laughs> got your master class there. That's awesome. I'm amazed you managed to get all that in. That's wonderful. Thank you so much, Mark. Beautiful, Pleasure. gorgeous. Pleasure. Um, message, lots and lots uh, of lovely messages coming through. Uh, well, look, lovely on a handbag. Oh, yeah. yeah, you're absolutely yeah. right, Lorraine. Beautiful as um, handbag charms. They're gorgeous. And beautiful uh, work, Mark. So glad you've been able to show both demos. Yes, Karen. Isn't that nice? That's gorgeous. Uh, right, very quickly, before the end of the show, oh. we've got a star by. This is amazing. Don't go anywhere. I love this. The minute I, I saw this. this a few weeks ago, it literally, uh, I think I, I launched it with myself and Claire. I was over there, Claire was here, and we were just like, there was silence in the studio because Claire was taking out all of the gemstones of these, um, um, out of these boxes and putting them together in really kind of lovely color combinations. I was just going through them and just being so amazed by the quality of what you're getting. This is the most gorgeous collection of uh, gemstones. You get this really lovely wooden box um, uh, which houses all of these stones. All of these stones. They are gorgeous, okay? You get here really nifty little uh, clasp. Really, really lovely. Um, now, I'm going to open the box. Oh, no. oh look, at, aren't they stunning? Now you can, if you want to, once you've, you know, you can, you, you can take this out. It's entirely up to you. You can, you know, do whatever you want to. Um, it's, you know, it's really lovely. You can have them kind of on display if you like. But I, I, I like, I like what we've, so I like what we've. Done I don't here. know the price we're going to with this. Oh, okay. But, but when we go, you pop. I think I've, I've mentioned this before. When we, when oh, we go to the lake district, the lakes, yeah. Yes. Um, on the last day before we come home, I always go to the Ambleside Rock and Fossil Shop. Nice. To have, yeah. Have a little gemstone, and they sell. Three tumbles for ten pound. Without the box, without the phone, without the information, they sell three for ten pound. Okay, okay, okay. Shall we go through these gemstones? Now, they are, they really are awesome. Carnelian, <sighs> not muddy kind of, or wishy washy carnelian. That vibrant. Vibrant. I've got to show the next gemstone with this because it looks so wonderful. Oh, Malachite. Yeah. Isn't that just gorgeous? Carnelian. Malachite. So it connects to the heart chakra and there with your root chakra. Next gems. Green Aventurine. Look at the size of that. Huge piece of Green Aventurine. Look at this. Hematite. Whoa, that's a big stone. Isn't that gorgeous? Really big stone of hematite. You wait till you see this. Lapis lazuli. Look at the rock you are getting there. That is unbelievable, isn't it? Yeah, it's gorgeous, isn't it? The gorgeous flex of pyrite in there. White opal. Beautiful translucent stone. Really, really lovely. Right, okay, pink amethyst, yeah, here it is, beautiful stone, gorgeous gem, pink amethyst, picture jasper, oh Ooh, wow, that's good, it's so good, this is gorgeous, this next one, red poppy jasper, isn't that glorious, isn't that colour amazing, Mark, wait till you see this. Oh, you're going to love this. Amazonite. Oh, look at this. Isn't that glorious? Okay, look at this next one. Oh, my God, I love this. Labradorite. Oh, no. Look at the state of that. It's literally unbelievable. 
Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh! Love it, love it, love it, love it. Citrine, beautiful color, amazing size citrine here. Absolutely tremendous. Citrine sister, amethyst. Oh, they look good together, don't they? Absolutely beautiful. The most amazing tiger's eye I think I've ever seen in my entire life. Look at this. Tiger's eye. These are absolutely flying out the door. Black tourmaline. Ah, okay. Clear quartz. Look at the size of this bad boy. Woo, look at that. It's like a block of ice. Rose quartz. Oh, gosh. Quick, Carol. These are, these are literally selling out. Okay. Blue lace agate. Oh, gosh, no. Ah, no. Okay, ready? Selenite. What? Oh, I know, I know, I know. Oh, Look wow. at this. It's incredible. Look at that. Sun. It's absolutely amazing. Look at that bad boy. Okay. Milky aquamarine. Gorgeous. Look, it's like the size of your head. Amazing. Smoky quartz. Wow. Oh, gosh. Yes. Oh, no. I know. Oh, gosh, no. So delight. Look at that bad boy. I know. Oh, gosh. Shungite. Look at the size of that shungite. And last but not least... The most amazing moonstone. Okay, there we go. Beautiful moonstone. Gorgeous. Right. You are getting here huge carrot weights. Enormous qualities. You are getting here 1,140 carats of genuine gemstones. Phone lines have gone nuts. 49.99. That would cost me £80 without the box. At yep. The shop. 24 gems. Gosh. Your individual split payments of $24.99. Maker in Ayrshire, Christine, Shan, Yvette, Sheila, Lucy, Susan, Gail, uh, Maker, Maker in London, Lynn, Donna. Absolutely tremendous. It's yours today. And for your crystal healing, this is absolutely yeah. beautiful. For your chakras, amazing. As a collection, as a collection though, Mark, that is Incredible, unbelievable, yeah. isn't I it? I love that. It's gorgeous. Do you know what? Do you know what you could do actually? Get this as a gift for somebody. Mm. Take all the gemstones out and then every birthday give them another gem and oh, another yeah. gem nice and idea. another gem. Build yeah. their collection. Build their collection. It's gorgeous. Yeah, you've got 24 years worth or 12 if it's kind of uh, Christmas and birthdays. Uh, but there you go. You know, it's yours. Um, it, it's absolutely amazing. Uh, Maker in London, well done to you. Carol, well done to you. And it all comes to you in this gorgeous, gorgeous spot. It's beautiful. It's the ultimate gemstone collection. Gorgeous, isn't it? Well done, everybody. Susan says, Cynthia, well done. Rosemary, check out your baskets. Well done. I can't believe that. Isn't that That's amazing? Incredible. And as you incredible say, at, at a great price point in, yeah, the, you know, in the crystal absolutely. shop in, in, in Ambleside, you know, yeah. 80 quid for all that. Yeah. Absolutely amazing. Brilliant. That's brilliant. You know, with the box, let's say 100 quid. Amazing. Brilliant. You'd sell out. 49.99 for you today. Janine, well done to you and Conway, well done to you. Great is photography tools, great to kind of put colours and qualities together. You know, does this colour go with this? Also, you know, a bit of fun. You know, if you want to kind of put all the gemstones together and then and then close your eyes and just choose a gemstone at random, and that could be the gemstone that you wear that day or whatever. My partner bought this for me for my birthday this April. It's well worth the money and uh, fab gems. Yeah, they really are superb. Gorgeous quality. <laughs> Yes, what he should have done is given you one gemstone. Next birthday, another gemstone. No, you know what I mean. Uh, well done, Jackie. Well done to you. Uh, more people coming through. It's great to see. Well done, everybody. Oh, Mark, what a great gift. I love it. And Father's Day coming up as well. Oh, yes. Yeah, I've got a budding um, mm. gem fossil expert. Yes, absolutely. Mark, you've been amazing today. Thank you today. so Pleasure. much. It's been Pleasure. gorgeous having you with us. And you're next with us on... Um, well, with Sewing Street on Thursday, Ooh! and then I'm back here on the 19th. So yes. on, on, on my Sewing Street next Thursday, I'm with amazing John Scott. Oh my gosh, that's going to be that is a show not weekend, to be missed. Saturday the 24th. Yes. John Scott is joining me. <laughs> it's amazing. I love it. <laughs> Whole five hours, it's going to be ace. <laughs> that is going to be so much fun. Amazing advent calendar. Yes, yeah. of course, 24. Brilliant. Yeah. Yeah. What a great idea. Um, Amazing. Thank you so much for joining us today. You've got an amazing afternoon on Hobby Maker. Look at all of this adorable scrub. We've got a lo lovely Pauline's with you today. You've got, you've got Dave as well. It's going to be a brilliant afternoon. So make sure that you're tuning in for that. But Mark, thank you so thank much you. for joining us Pleasure. today, darling. And thank you Pleasure. so much for joining us. It's been brilliant. Your text today, your input's been absolutely wonderful. Uh, make sure you have a wonderful Sunday afternoon on uh, Jewelry Maker. And uh, we'll see you the other side of this for a brilliant afternoon this afternoon on Hobby Maker. See you in a minute. Thank you.